Not suitable for children or sensitive adults. Viewer discretion is advised. You know, creating very fine apple quenchers was not easy. Get back there. Because each apple quencher flavor is a blend of three different fruits, like apple, strawberry, banana. And combining them so you could taste all three fruits was hard work. Mr. Banana. Ow. Because fruits have big egos. They're not really team players. Each one wants to be the dominant flavor. But we got them to cooperate. There are times, Andy said, when it's best to play it safe. Here for the swamp tour? Especially when on safari in the Everglades. 14,000 square miles of alligators, snakes, and frogs that bite. So Andy suggested the great tasting old Milwaukee non-alcoholic. It's got to get better than this, I said, as Gil, our guy, took us butt bruising for the day. Good thing for a cold old mill N.A., there's enough exhilaration already in the Everglades. And hey, you don't want to end up as gator bait. So she stared deep into my eyes and said, hi. Nice hat. Nice arm. I replied suavely just to break the ice. What are you drinking? Zima. Zima. What is that? A beer? No, it's not like beer. Z, no duds. Wine cooler? No. Leave for yourself. Zao. Disarming taste. Yet somewhat sophisticated. She smiled subtly at me and said, say, what's your Zion? Stop. See the wildest, weirdest, most outrageous commercials of all time. We're working our tails off. Malcolm Jamal Warner hosts your favorite commercials tomorrow at 7, 6 Central. Rock is back. When it comes to brothers, there's a fine line between love and hate. And you know what side I'm on. Richard Roundtree guest stars on an all-new Rock Tuesday. You know what I paid for this case of Kindle Oil? Nothing. I'm Kyle Petty. Sure, Kindle pays me to use it, but I get a great oil that protects my engine. I just wear this cap and let Kendall put their stickers on my car. What a deal. Now, you can't get Kendall at the price I do. But right now, you can get three bucks off a case. And Kendall will throw in a racing cap with my name on it. Three bucks off, a racing cap, and no stickers on your car. Now, that's a deal. Kendall Motor Oil. Hey, man, buy it at these locations. How to save money on groceries. Rule five, buy in bulk. Rule 13. Stick to your list. Ooh. Rule 7, use manufacturer's coupons. And above all, rule number 1, shop at Tops Friendly Markets, where prices are lower every day. That way, you could even walk away from a few of the rules. One, two, one, two, three, four. Give me a break, give me a break. Break me off a piece of that cheap jack bar. Give me a break. It's a big country, so remember the rules of the road, Andy said. Plenty of the old mill up top, and plenty of lead free in the tank. Because there's plenty of unknowns in the great outdoors. You boys need a tow? It's gonna cost you. And what I want is them golf clubs. Give me that motor scooter. That Weber drill. Take that. Take most of that. Bring it out here. I'm gonna need all your beer. Well, as long as you keep your sense of humor and hold on to all your old Milwaukee, it doesn't get any better than this. Think her robe is white? Not next to his Clorox white. This looks white, but look again. Let's face it, clothes washed in detergent alone can look dull and dingy. But it doesn't have to be that way. Because adding Clorox liquid bleach every time you wash brings out a white that's as fresh and crisp as new. Now this is the real white. Clorox liquid bleach for a brand new kind of white. Also in lemon and fresh scents. I can't believe she asked you out, Sam. I had to say no, Herb. Whoa. Cough, sore throat. Try nice. Sugar-free nice showers your throat with medicine for icy, cool relief. Cool, feels better. So what you gonna wear? Well, only have one suit. Oh, yeah. Put your throat on ice with nice. Was it self-defense or cold-blooded murder? You decide. Honor thy father and mother. The true story of the Menendez murders. Coming Monday, April 18th to Fox. <laughs> That doesn't matter. 
Uh, if I may, the Canine Academy is conveniently located. We, we train show dogs that... No! Dealing with destructive behavior is our forte. The 9X Yellow Pages, it's surprising what the ads can tell you. I'm not only the Academy president, I'm also a client. All right, I'm here. Gotta remember the steps. Hi, everyone. Mr. Lifford, Chase, how y'all doing? I'm gonna go ahead here, not forget about the synchro skin. And put it back to shutter speed to 59.8. That's what the Game Boy Collar here on the GameCube wants. Gotta go. I'm allergic to garlic. You know, I love garlic. It's one of the finest things in life for me. Garlic, uh, tomatoes, fucking goddamn chair. There we go. Uh, I issue uh, eat garlic like TikToks. I'm talking about raw garlic. And obviously the garlic is here because of Wario. That's uh, he likes garlic. But at around 2016, I started to get sick with garlic. I developed not allergy, which is you know allergy you can't eat it at all. At all, I have uh, some sort of intolerance. So I feel if I eat garlic raw, if it's cooked, it's fine. But if I eat any bits of uh, on the fucking set here of raw garlic, I feel like I I drank two liters of whiskey. I get a hangover. I feel like shit. I feel just terrible. Mr. Liffer says the key word spooky season. Now, today, this year, is a request uh, by Jerome. So, after this here video, I completely forgot about the Halloween, which is my favorite season alongside Christmas. After today, there'll be no requests unless we're going to talk about it later. So whoever subbed, I have the list here, will be, for now that I'm small, will be able to request a game. There's a few rules, no turn-based RPG and a few other things, and I have the right to refuse uh, and ask you to pick something else if it sucks, and I don't want to do it, you know? So we're going we're gonna to do that. I already granted Chase's request. Mr. Liffer's got two of them. Uh, that's enough, and uh, Jerome is getting his today, and I'm going to ask the other folks who are in today what do they want, and I have a text file here ready to, to, you know, to add it here, even without the keyboard, I can copy and paste. Starting with, uh, what's the second one? Well, uh, one and a half, Mr. Leifer, if you want to be a technical. Uh, the second one was fucking Rayman, what are you on about? It was Oddworld and Rayman. Uh, I couldn't finish Rayman, but, you know, I tried. You can't blame me, honestly. Well, the second one was Oddworld. You requested Oddworld. I played Oddworld. It was four fucking streams, eh? Now, the game was fine, but still, it was a request. That was, uh, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have played Oddworld, at least not now. I would have played eventually, you know. Yeah, I counted Oddworld. Why, why wouldn't I count that? It's, it's a request. I played it, and of course it counts. So, uh, but right now we're going to organize it this way. Uh, whoever subbed, uh, not YouTube, if you're on YouTube, you can leave suggestions. I'll look into them. It's not like I'm going to ignore you like the drunk chick at the party. But right now we're going to, until we get it, we're going to have a system here. And Shiro, Shiro, I don't think is in today. He's at work. But I'll talk to him because I didn't have time to call him this weekend. But. I think because I'm very tiny right now, it's fine to do, uh, and listen, if you're on YouTube, uh, Chapters are your friend. This is about Twitch. I'm on Twitch Live right now, interacting. I feel like I got to say that a lot sometimes. Uh, I thought like two requests that didn't run yet, or rather not. I don't know, complicating, overcomplicating, Mr. Leif. You, you ask me to play a game, I play it, then you ask another game, and I play it. I didn't finish. I did a full stream anyways. It's not like I really have to finish every game. I mean, I try, but on that on that case, you, you still got a very long stream out of it, right? I mean, it was like, what, six hours, something like that. Uh, Mr. Leifer subscribed. Oh, you you. I thought you would. Well, thank you. Either way, uh, thank you very much. Uh, well, we get you get another request, but you go to the back of the the line, yeah, because uh, there's a lot of other people. Now, obviously, if I get a little bigger here, I, I won't be able to do that. So I, I'll have to come up with a system. Uh, 
because I do love this as interaction. And again, Mr. Leifert, thank you for that, uh, for the subscription. Uh, two months, just like two, just like two Odd World PS1 games. I'm not sure what that means. You got there was four streams. I mean, <laughs> you know, it's like there will be a few rules. Like you, you request GTA 5. I'm not going to play that now. First, I don't have the monitor yet. I want the FW 900. Right? If somebody requests that. I'm going to say no. And the game is massive, so I don't want to be playing like two weeks of GTA here right, right now. Right? This minute. I mean, maybe in the future. Uh, to be honest, I'm not sure. It's not. It's not a two. He's saying I'm not sure. Odd World or Crash Bandicoot one so first choose yourself one of those uh crash bandicoot if you want that but you can't it's changeable just you know i'll paste that here already i do have your name here uh paste crash bandicoot one so there you go i can put space here but i guess that's fine uh f where where was he and uh don't worry i'll turn I'll, i want to see who is here and get that out of the way fort max was here Turn vampire. Hello, hello, Fort Max. Uh, Fort Max, you uh, Persian air. Persian air. Can I pick one? Uh, yeah, you can. But let me let let it be known, Persian air, that I bought I bought uh, Green Fandango on PC just yesterday. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to make it work here. If not, uh, because you know I don't have a retro PC. But I heard you can get some files and get it going. I looked in, into the game. See, I do consider what y'all say. You said that was your favorite game, I believe. Uh, Green Fandango, that's done. I already I bought it just yesterday on eBay. If I cannot get the old PC working, then I'll buy it on the Switch, but you have to wait another month because it's, uh, it's more expensive, a lot more expensive. So, But I bought Br Green Fandango. is on the way. Uh, and I'll write that down anyways for Persian Air. Fort Max, you have a request? And remember, after Halloween, uh, not now. So, but I, I have the the save file here. Let me see. Persian Air Green Fandango, and uh, no picking platforms. So, platforms will be played. I decide that. All right. So, okay. Uh, I'll have to think of something. It doesn't have to be today. Uh, we have the whole of Halloween left, so you can think about something uh and let me read here and just when it comes along no no turn-based rpgs there'll be no chrono trigger final fantasy fuck off with that i don't like that i'm not playing that no long current gen games i can't even i, I can I'm, I'm not doing it okay like uh i don't know some motherfucking ps5 i have a ps5 here allegedly i haven't even been able to been able to turn it on yet well i turn it on i can't use the fucking thing because asking me about age verification so I have the right to refuse. No staple franchise title skip. What does that mean? Silent Hill, Resident Evil, Mortal Kombat, Castlevania, Mario. Uh, I'll be playing those kind of in order. So it's irrelevant. Like I'm not playing Mortal Kombat 9 here. It's not its time yet. I haven't even moved past the second one. In Persian here it said Mortal Kombat 2. <laughs> that was funny. And the game, th this will take effect after the Halloween. And please... Uh, two months from now, let's say, for some fucking reason, I would have double the subscribes. I can't be... I, we have to change... This is temporary. Right now, because I'm very tiny, I believe I have 15 subscribers, something like that. So... And Mr. Leifer said, so what if a game is like an entire different game on different platforms? We can choose two. Well, I know what you mean. Uh, yeah, I'll look into it. You pick one, pick one of them, and I'll see. I'll be the judge. I own the fucking channel, so I'll be looking into it myself. Because I'm playing here. I don't want to play a horrible thing. You know, I don't even mind. I could play something horrible, just not overly long. Like because you know, somebody's uh, requesting a game is short, sweet, and then somebody else requests a game that'll take ten streams. I mean, you know make pretty expensive uh you can fuck right off with that i'm not uh, buying expensive games if your request involves me buying an expensive games with the amount of flash cards i have here for nearly every system and no d's for nearly every system i have to buy a game you out of your shit out of luck pick something else huh make it clear here i'm i'm the the big mamoo around here so you tell me a request and i'll see if i can do it that doesn't mean your word 
doesn't mean it's not the law. So if you tell me a game, you will play GTA 5, I spend the fucking channel points or some bullshit, which is not even channel points right now, right? I will ride refuse. This is, I mentioned that. Ride to refuse. No, read the comment above it. What comment above it? Uh, no, the comment below it. I mean, what, what comment above it? There's no comment above it. The, the the comment was so if a game is an entire different game on a platform and then you said after I, I already spoke could do the game Mr. Liffer why are you making things complicated all the time just pick up you already picked the game what are we even talking about here dude honestly you know everybody picks a fucking game and that's it what, what is there to why are you why are you on a you know about the little little if the game doesn't work, I'll just tell it doesn't work. Pick something else. That's it. Done. End of the end of the story. Utente del pasado, buonasera. Como stai? So you pick, Mr. Leaf, you pick Crash Bandicoot. We, we'll cross the bridge once we get to it about the little problems that may arise. I'm not, it's not, it's not really overly complicated. <laughs> I mean, you could do game wishes with channel points. Yeah, uh, yes, no, I, I need to discuss with Shiro. For now, it's something I'm doing regardless of channel points. If you subbed right now, right this minute, uh, if you are subbed, you will get a game. Uh, this is uh, my getting back to you regardless of, of channel points. But the channel points is a, an awesome idea. I want something like that. Obviously, if I get more subscribers, uh, you'll be very hard. I can't do this. Imagine Mike Matei doing uh, every subscriber. He's got like a, a gazillion subscribers. He, he'll be playing games that the people ask for the rest of his life and play nothing he likes. I don't want that here. This is a thing that I'm doing as an extra, as a bonus. The deal for me here was to come and play games on a CRT. The request, the other shit, I never care about that. But I decided to do the request right now, regardless of ch channel points. So obviously, if the person is not here, Halloween has come and gone. Uh, they miss the opportunity to ask for a game. It's done, and I'm not going to go back in time. Is the Switch an option or two modern digital game? Unfortunately, I won't be buying digital games. Sorry, no, I should have made that clear. No digital. I have uh, awesome games that I like, and they're digital. They do not exist for me. Physical only for modern platforms. It's a current gen, uh, modern plat, and current gen no over the long games. I'll s tell me the title, and I'll tell you if it works or not. I'll tell you immediately. I'll look it up if I don't know now. I will look it up later, and I will come back to you on that. And if it's a negatory or if it's a, a green light, all right? Uh, no digital. I won't be. And my switch is not pirated. I I do uh, ODEs flashcards for older systems that are no longer supported. If you disagree, your you know your fucking opinion. Uh, current gen, I buy the games because I want to support the industry. Okay, I so I do buy the games. I don't. I could. I could. I could pirate my my PS4 right now. I could pirate my Switch right now. I actually have the the chip that Nintendo sent people people to jail, but is a it's in a box for the the Mariko the version two Switch. I bought the chip before all the shit went down, uh, but I never use it because I don't play the modern platforms enough to 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 do really pirating, and I'm not in, I'm not interested in it. I barely play it. So buying the physical games is enough for me. But tell me the game, uh, and yeah, I know that Ghosts and, for example, i give an example here. Ghosts and Goblins R Resurrection is a game I was interested in, but uh, it's on a digital song. No, I'm, I'm just, I got, I got fucked too many times with digital. I'm not doing it. Uh, so if it's only digital, you might have to rethink your options uh, on that, you know. Uh, but yeah, but, you know, if it's physical and expensive, then also no. I'm, uh, I'm poor. So I can't, you know, I can't afford it. I can't afford it. But tell me anyways, because it might be a game that I actually want. We might have a similar taste. So I'll just go ahead and buy it. And Utente del Passato said, uh, another TV, a few Game Boy and a Garlic. Yeah, we got here a Game Boy DMG, uh, backlit. Uh, not a replacement screen, backlit original screen, and a Game Boy Ben Van, the first one he made. The Game Boy Color, sorry. And it has even the Game Boy Color light. I'll be showing them at the end of the playthrough anyways. Uh, 
And the switch is not too modern. Fort Max, I have, I have used here with the with the splatter. It depends on the game. Here, what what it boils down to is a game wide screen, which will be in my. Can it be downscaled? Does it have small tax? If not, for example, I can I will play here about uh, blood blood stain curse of the moon, uh, and I. I think I'll be fine. I have a widescreen standard set, and I'll be fine downscaling that. And uh, so, a lot of games, I, if I if if there's no small text, I can downscale to 240p to a standard CRT. Boom! There you go. Uh, I could also play on my BVM, but it's kind of tiny. It's a 14-inch set, and with a mask, it's a 16. Then it's it's very tiny. Yeah, it's possible. I play Little Nightmares here, so we, we can see how it works. Okay. Tiny Goomba says, how many TVs I have? I have currently 36, 25 Twinitrons, and then I make sure. Today I was actually going to bring a Hitachi out. It was going to be the first consumer. It's in my kid's room. It's a very nice Hitachi. It does RGB. Very cute. Uh, but it was a pain in the ass to get it out there because uh, I have they have in their room, they have a VCR, they have a DVD player. It was cables up the ass. I was going to be forever in there. So I just decided to get this BVM here, which obviously we used before. So there's no not a blank screen here. Let me go and what do I do here? Computer. Yeah, Fort Max is a shame. Ghosts and Goblins Resurrection. Never got Brutando's here, Brutando. Uh <laughs> it's cables up the ass. It's a lot of them. Should be out the ass though, right? Uh Brutando, hello there. Brutando, we're doing a subscriber request. If you have a game that you want to request that is not RPG, that is not gigantically long, uh, that is not current gen, and that is not a staple franchise that I play here, uh, say your say your titles now or think about it. As the subs begin to say the games that they want, I'll write them down here. So we got Commodore Crash, Yuds, Tunama Aftermath, Fort Max, Batamwell, Star Wiz Retro. Uh, and it doesn't matter if it's gift subs. If you sub, that's it. Ash, uh, Satsum, Brutando, Feeder House, Persian Air. He gave his already, which I knew it was Green Fandango. Declimatic, Shiro. And my wife is not subbed, but she'll get it because she's my fucking wife. So she, I told her already she can pick a game. Um, that space that it takes to store at 30 must be huge. No, a mobile home. You know how people say, I don't have space for a CRT, but then they have fucking boxes laying around. I live in a mobile home, 35 by 12, and the majority of my CRTs are right in the living room. The fucking thing might sink like the Titanic someday, but the CRTs are, I have a wall of CRTs. Organize them well, stack them up correctly and you have space in reality it takes about this much space here right uh, i do have two gigantic ones i do have some in storage here 32 inch but they're repeated so the 36 inch and there's some 32 inch so repeated sets are here what i mean repeated sets so sets that don't do anything special than any other set can do uh, at home but i i have a lot of crts at home the majority of them are home and they are used regularly so it stack them up, stack them up, and you're fine. Barely in a space. Like about this, the footprint is actually quite small. If I was to remove all my CRTs from my living room right now, mm, you wouldn't gain much space because they're stacked up. They're like in a shape around the walls, like this. So you know, like a square, right? So yeah. Green Fandango looks very interesting. Uh, I I looked it up. I uh, read about it. And Brutando says, I just beat Metal Gear Solid yesterday. Great game. It was pretty good, yes. It was a great, that was quite an adventure, no doubt. Uh, technologically speaking, the most impressive game I ever played on the PS1 by far. Persian Air says, a point, point and click. Bitch, what's wrong with you? I just told you I looked it up. <laughs> I know it's a point and click. <laughs> yeah, no, I, uh, I looked it up. I'm in. I'm in. Uh, you know, it looks like a thinking man game, so maybe I'll, I'll get fucked here, but we, uh, 
It looks very interesting, the set, uh, and I like point and click, some of them, you know. Mike needs to play Monkey Island too one day. Well, remain sub and make that a re request. I play whatever you want with limitations. Okay, let me turn on this thing. Okay, don't worry about the refresh rate. Now this here, yeah, I'm aware of the line. I'm not changing so that goes away. Once the game kicks in, that's going to be gone. What's going on here, this is a PAL GameCube, which is uh, very welcome in my, um, my collection because I don't have to play PAL games on it. So this has GC Loader, it has the Game Boy Player, and we have the uh, EverDrive here, yeah. Uh, and you can play NTSC games. Now, why a PAL GameCube? Because I have an NTSC. Well, the PAL GameCube has an advantage over the NTSC GameCube, and that's RGB capability. So if I have on the NTSC, NTSC GameCube, uh, I wouldn't be able to play here on RGB, right? And I don't think the set does component. Federico says for Federico 420 Super Probo Contra is Contra. No, no, there will be no Probo or Pal stuff here. Uh, but I, I, I it, the, the voting. I don't mean to be exclusionary here, but the voting is for subs. If you're sub, you vote. I can't, I can't grant requests from everyone that's chatting and commenting on YouTube. I mean, for the subs, is already pretty tough. This might be a one-time thing. We're going to do channel points later. Channel points for subs, okay? So that's what's going to happen. The PAL system is better. I, I never said that, bitch. You're crazy, bitch. You're crazy. I never said that. I said that it's a welcome addition, and I said it has RGB. Uh, that doesn't mean it's better. What happens if you get, there's plenty of people that don't like, they don't give a shit about RGB, and it's not an advantage. So I say it has RGB, that's all I said, which it, which it has. Uh, I never said it's better. That, that shit will never come out of my mouth, okay? The PAL system is better, and <laughs> no. And uh, the, the NTSC, you can do YPBPR. So get a second mortgage, get the cable, the official cable, nothing else will do from Nintendo, the component cable. And uh, then it's just the same as RGB. So, but I, I get you joking around. Uh, but the PAL is welcome. I like it that it has RGB. Same with the Wii, by the way. I have a PAL Wii and I have an NTSC Wii. So I don't give a shit about PAL in reality, NTSC. If you can do 60 Hertz, rounding it up the number here, I mean, PAL 60, and I don't give a shit about that. My problem with PAL is 50 hertz unoptimized. And a 50 hertz, I don't like the 50 hertz, okay? Just for movies, it's fine, I guess. Uh, but yeah. But Pedereco, welcome to the chat. Uh, and uh, welcome here, okay? So yeah, so I think I got a, did anybody, if I forget your vote here and I didn't see it, uh, please let me know. Just just type it in again. Uh, if I can see it, just put requests in capitals, so I'll know. So for now, I just have Persian Air Grim Fandango and Mr. Liffer Crash Bandicoot. So let me start a game here. Uh, so at least the game image is, is going, okay? So we're gonna go to GBI, which is awesome. It's a piece of homebrew that is fantastic. And I know it's weird, but I have to put uh, five by four for it to be nearly full screen. Get this shit out of here. 60. Oh, no 50 option. Oh, that's sad. Because uh, the Game Boy doesn't run at 50 anyways. Okay, well, it does. 59.72, I believe. So, m closer to 60, right? And that should do it. And then I have to zoom in. Fuck. To three. That should do it. And that'll be Game Boy Color, colorized, and that's it. So basically the game is colorized. That's what's going on here. It was originally a black and white game and a fan colorized. It's not the most perfect colorization there is, but uh, there you go, there's color. Thanks, man, Pederico says. Uh, I've been watching for a while. Thank you very much, Pederico. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda miss the old YouTube intros. They were so class. I really miss it too, man, to be honest. If I could, I really love that. I miss it. I was just thinking about it yesterday, but 
there were a lot of work to to record you know the fancy shots and i couldn't possibly stream you know four or five times a week and do those and god damn it i really needed a slider to do those things it was very hard about you know doing the shots like the scroll without sliding i'm like holding the camera and kind of panning <laughs> it's kind of fuck a lot of times i'm doing jobs that uh <laughs> that require tools and i'm here working like a caveman banging rocks you know and of course we need that thumbnail in so let's get things nice and pretty there we go uh I'll see about it, Bitterico, in the future. So for now, I just have the commercials. I know. It's, I have to pump those out more, but I do miss the old intros as well. Uh, how long you been streaming for July? I looked it up the other day. Since July. So, yeah, it's a lot of a lot of videos because I, I do stream a lot and sometimes for many, many hours. Okay. I came back from Muffin Killer's Ray the other day. Yeah, I appreciate it. Tell him I appreciate that. I, I, I did follow him. He's got some good content. Chase, it's a me, Wario. <laughs> so that's what the garlic is in there. Let me make sure there's no refresh rate lines. That everything's flicker free here. I did adjust the contrast earlier. The color is looking pretty similar to what I'm seeing in person here, actually. It, uh, obviously a bit uh, softer. So this game was requested by Jerome, who's a big friend of mine and a friend of the channel, and he requested this game, and that's what we're playing today. And it's raining here, so if you hear the rain, that's all there's, that's happening. And it's been 30 minutes, so I'm going to start the game very soon. Oh, and I see here two months, just like two out of world PS1 games, uh, Mr. Leifer's message. So for now, it'll be like this. Please don't come in the future and go, mm, you should do one subscribe when I have like, let's say I, I get very successful, big man here, big pants, right? 500 subs. I'm not doing 500 fucking games. So we got to think about, this is just a one-time thing for now, okay? So I'm going to get my tobacco here and get started this game. And I'm very, uh, as much as I enjoyed uh, Metal Gear, this is home to me, to the retro games is where I'm most comfortable. It's my comfort zone, you know? There we go. The game looks fantastic. I think the colorization here was... It's good. It's good enough. It's good to see color. So this game is originally black and white or pea, pea green. Okay. So I'm going to get started. So... Putting my gloves on here. And we go. Oh, and uh, KBX, the Game Master. Snipe backwards. Uh, loop the loop. Bruno Soas. Thank you for following. And once again, Mr. Leifer, thank you for subscribing. And with that in mind, we'll let the intro play here a tiny bit. And uh, let's uh, go. That's it. And we got started. Cinnamon rose cooking. The other day I ate uh, apple strudel. Let me adjust my volume here. It's a bit too high. Too... There we go. Too loud. I ate some apple strudel the other day. Straight out of the oven. That was pretty awesome. Love myself some pastry. Cinnamon rolls. Man, they smell good. So there you go, we go to file A, and Brutando 
uh, don't forget if you want to, I mean, you're not, you're not required to do that. Uh, don't forget to pick a game that you, you request, whoever subscribed. So throughout the, this stream, we'll try to get as many requests here as possible. After Halloween is over, uh, starting tomorrow, I'll be playing nothing but horror games or spooky games, Halloween sort of games, theme games like Luigi's Mansion. Uh, I know of another fella that requested a game. There, there might be some games that are requested, I'll be playing them anyway. So if, if your game that you request is part of a game I was going to play, I'll just be honest and say, listen, I was going to play this game anyway, so I'll let you do another request. Nice timing. Jerome says it literally arrived when you went down the tube. Nice timing. Good to see you here. The apple strudel is great. What's that hat? What was that about with the one game you scared from? Uh, that was Fatal Frame, aka Project Zero in Japan and Europe. Uh, no fucking way, dude. I don't know. I, uh, uh, that game does scare me, generally. Like, I, I just thinking about him already stressed. Uh, mm, I don't know, man. That game is fucked. I'm here in the shed alone. I don't know. I, uh, for now, I'll decline that. I, I need to think about it. You got Crash Bandicoot anyways in. Uh, with the, uh, with the Halloween, I won't be taking requests. This is separate from the request. So there you go, we're Wario looking fantastic. So we got a dash here, like Shao Kahn. Ah! You can grab the fellers and do this. Ha! Ah! Oh shit, did they come back? All right, you outlive your usefulness. So you can do dash. Fantastic game. Uh, I never, I played here and there. Uh, pretty much my wife, she played all those games. Uh, and I helped her here and there. You know, but I haven't, I'm yet to play this game. Like seriously, like I'm doing today. And do a, do a playthrough of it. So I might mess up here and there. Probably get behind, so. Get out of here. Now I'm pretty sure there'll be times that I'll need to use the fellers and I, I threw them away or something. God damn, the trucks here are hauling ass. It's horrific. And there's the garlic. Gives you special powers. Okay, and Brutando says... Okay, I'm missing a lot of Project, Project Zero. Almost purchased for the OG Xbox of some months ago. There's a timer, so catch up with it. That should be the game for Halloween night. No, Halloween night actually falls here. Halloween night is going to be a special treat. It's not going to be games, actually. If everything works. If it, does, I, it, it is original old hardware, so if it doesn't work, I can do it. Okay? Halloween happens to be on a day off of mine. I think it's Monday or Tuesday, one of those two, right? Uh, it'll be a special treat. It won't be commentary. I won't be com commenting anything. I'll simply be playing. I, I order an RF out. It'll be a movie. It'll be a night of the living dead. I mentioned this a long time ago. Of course, I'm not calling you out for not remember what I said a gazillion years ago. Uh, I'll be playing night of the living dead in its entirety. It's public domain. Twitch will mute the VOD. It doesn't matter. I'll upload it to YouTube. It's a public domain movie and it's a classic. It's everybody should see that. All the zombie genre owns its existence to, to that's the first, it's the first zombie movie. So, you know, how can you not watch that? It's black and white. I'll be, the plan is to play it on VCD out of a PlayStation 1 to my old Trinitron. We'll see how, how good that will work. Using a rare, uh, a rare uh, PlayStation model that I have, I have, but haven't used on the channel yet. Yeah. <laughs> And say, do uh, Brew Tando asks, do I have a, do you have a list to choose from for from vote or just a game up to a certain gen? Uh, no RPG turn based, no current gen long games, and right to refuse. So you, there's no list. You can pick whatever you want, and then I'll tell you if it works. Say, Michael being costume irrelevant. Only my hands show. 
uh, dress as a bunny, there's more chance of hell freezing over than that happening. Uh, I actually do dress up on Halloween and as Jason Voorhees. I already have a mask. I have an actual mask of Jason Voorhees. We go out to the office with my kids. My kids are all dressed. We, we get candy and we'll go home, hang out in a costume. Maybe there's no party. We don't do none of that shit. It's just us and we have a fun Halloween. And I'm uh, literally every time Jason Voorhees. Uh, my kid's name, my son's name, was going to actually be Jason Voorhees. I have a Dutch last name, and Jason Voorhees is a Dutch name. Well, Voorhees is, and it would have fit, but I, I name him Merle after Earl Scruggs anyways. Uh, dress as a Mario here. I got the Tash. I've been called Mario here, and in the, in the, there's a guy here in the yard that calls me Mario already because of the mustache, yes. And the hat, because I wear, I, wear, I wear a red trucker hat that says Booty Hunter. Most of the time, I'm like a cartoon character. I don't change clothes. Like, of course, I wash clothes, you doofus. But I mean, like, I change the style of clothes. It's pretty much the same hat. Ooh, you can, can do this shit here. Wait. <laughs> and I think I came from up there, right? Yeah, damn it. Are you telling me I done goofed? Wait. Don't break it. There we go. Okay, you can do this, and goodbye, sir. I'll look at the chat in a bit. Let me clear this first level here. Ah! Wario's awesome. Oh, fuck. And I think I'm gonna... Well, I definitely don't want to break this here, right? I'm kind of fucked if I do. Oh, I thought it was... Shell cut. Wins. Okay, there's... Luigi the Gardener calls him for that. Yeah, Tekken I'll be more of a Luigi because I'm tall. Uh, I'm not... I'm not fat, so I'm tall and skinnier. So, but I guess Mario is more... What the fuck? Mario's more popular, so the guy just calls me Mario. I do have a Luigi, Mario, a Wario, and a Waluigi hat. I love the series. I love Mario in general. What, what, what's going on here? I can't do nothing right now. With this. I can't, I can't work under uh, these conditions here. Ah! You son of a bitch. Damn it. Do I lose a dash? Yeah. You fuck. Eat that, you motherfucker. Lost my powers. And I'll look like a, an idiot. <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> fuck, what the fuck are you? All right, I got bigger again. Game for hearts or coins? You're betting, man? Let's see. I remember this game with the ton thing. One ton stuff. Yeah! Oh, you can play more if you don't know. That's how the casinos get you, you know? We're out of here. We double our, our bats here. What's with the alphabet here? Can I enter my name or something? Is this how you save? The oh, fuck? What was that alphabet? Stuff. Hmm. I hope saving is straightforward. Was there any requests I missed? We'll try to come watch. Let me see here if I'm... Fort Max said the remake was very good. The remake of, uh... Fatal... Fatal Frame? Alright. 
If you sleep on it on a request, uh, the window closes later. Uh, not today, though. There will be plenty of time. Okay, Rice Beach. Life is a beach. Oh, is this dangerously close to the word bitch, isn't it? Yeah, that's the joke. Mm, some of the folks at the office have been complaining about that. <laughs> Family guy. All right. Oh, ah! <laughs> Come here, you dying fucking. How do I kill this thing? Get out, get out of the game. What the f Ah, fuck off. She got sucked in there. There we go. Oh, just disappear in platforms. Ah! Idiot. Oh. Oh, no. Here's where, where I'm home. 2D platformers. Sort of. Ah! And I just said that. Okay. Here's where I'm sort of home. 2D platformers. Yeah. Yeah, but I can't. Can I? The fuck? The fuck is that shit? Okay, it's the dragon power. Look. Fucking awesome. Night of the Living Dead remake. Is that the one? Front in the, same in the mall, right? No. No, that's not it. Dawn of the Dead. My favorite uh, zombie movie of all time is the remake of Dawn of the Dead in Wisconsin. I love that movie a lot. The fuck? Oh. It's been established. Yeah, I can watch that movie anytime, anywhere. And I love the original too, of course. But I, I like the remake better. Cool, we're fucking burning everyone alive here. Oh, and I have some news on the mice front. Uh, my two days off, no mice. Uh, so I guess I murdered the whole family. Awesome. It was five of them, and I think they uh, they ran out of mice here for my traps, and I got them done in... Okay, what's this one? What's this about, fellas? I know you gotta enter some coins here, but how is it that you start to press select or something? Well, I don't know what that is. Return of the Living Dead, then Night of the Living Dead. Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead is awesome. Up plus B. Thank you, Jerome. There we go. I was about to leave here. Do I have. Is that not enough? I'm not sure what's happening here, I forgot. I know you have to, sort of like, uh, you have to enter the, the coins, but what does this redness mean? What, what is this? Hello? It's a checkpoint. Ah, okay, I thought it was the end of the, the stage. Okay. And now what? There's a different way. I reckon it's, oh, there's a door here. So fucking, uh, let's check here. No, it's kind of sneaky. It's fine. The brightness is fine. Kind of sneaky. I could barely see the fucking... What? <laughs> Fuck all y'all, you fucks. <clears throat> Shoulder bat, bitch. Shoulder bat. Shoulder barge. Shotgun. If you're playing sh uh, Mortal Kombat 2, this is shotgun. Ha! 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 Just constantly shoulder barging it. That fuck. Got a leak? Get out. Okay. Give me that. Stop screwing around. 
No. <laughs> that thing looks weird, man. Looks like a, some sort of automated deal, though. Die, comrade. Can I... There we go. Burn for it. It's this evil thing here. Get out. Ah, should have used some kind of trick here. Don't you go up there? There'll be secrets that I'll miss here, so pardon me. Uh, okay, we got a vote here. Let me pause and I'll write it down. Brew Tando, uh, Friday at 13th on the NES. I actually have the game physically. I have watch. You can beat video games. I have. It'll be hard, that game. Uh, but it, you win is your request, and I will honor it. I mean. Let me see here. Fuck. Move. So, Brutando. Friday the 13th on the NES. Oh, alright. Put NES this in case I don't have. Don't mix up with, with the other one. Ah, you fucking fuck. Okay. Fucked up here. Oh, undo. Undo. There we go. And undo again. There you go. Brutando, Friday the 13th. Yeah, I'm a big fan of Friday the 13th. Uh, I think that game is it has a lot of cool ideas. So, poorly implemented, but... Yeah. But it is what it is, you know? I'll try to watch Strategist before. Because it's a bit of a cryptic game. I love the tune, the cab tune. I even learned that on the I transcribed it to the banjo, made an arrangement for the banjo. On two copies, lose copy. I got a seal one for sixty seventy dollars. Definitely not worth sixty seventy dollars. I understand a seal, but to me, seal games are worthless. But each to their own, you know, it's a big thing. Fort Max says my original. Okay, I gotta look. If you're on YouTube, just just fast forward. You know, don't don't bother me. I, I'm I'm taking requests here. I'm a busy man. Uh, Grace Counter GM. Never heard of it on the Switch. You like to do a shmup that's not too difficult with a long neat mechanic. I'm open-minded to that. Uh, a few months ago, I would have said no. Uh, but I would uh, digital release. No, come up with an older one then. Come up with one in the near future in the same vein, but with what's possible. I have flashcards, but I, I every console you've seen here. Uh, so there's a lot of shmups. I have the PC Engine, a lot of shmups there. I have the Genesis, the Super Nintendo, old shmups, ZX Spectrum even. I have a flashcard. Everything you can think of, the consoles that I have, I have a flashcard or, or OD. Dreamcast OD, which would mean any game you want can be played there. Uh, GameCube, OD, Wii is hacked, Wii U, it's hacked, uh, but I, I don't think that's a platform for shmups, but uh, there's a lot of them. If you pick something that's very difficult, I will give it my best, but no guarantees if I can beat it. If I can beat it, I can, and I'm new to shmups, so I'm not used to it. And, yeah. Yeah, uh, Friday the 13th is happening. Uh, that's a game I uh, I don't know why I have uh, infatuation with it. So I definitely will play that game. Uh, it's been okay. It was something that I would play eventually, but I... Quite... It's a bit scary to me. Not that the game itself is scary. It's scary how cryptic and fucked it is. And it's a bit, a bit tough. Yeah, 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 yeah. The fuck? Okay, up and... Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Calm down. Is there a door in there? Oh, there was a door. Yeah, let's try... Try one. Probably lose it this time, though. I'm feeling this one. Bullshit luck. Oh! Got luck here. That's enough. Now we live. We, once we win, win, we get out. 
go at you. I'm hoping to give this map a shot. Fun. There we go. What's with the alphabet here? I'm not. Do I need to press something to save the game? Uh, no! I don't want to get fucked again and lose my game because it crashed or some bullshit. So what's with the alphabet there? It looks like it's a place to save, but I don't know what to do there. Yeah, for example, uh, on the shmups of Fort Max, uh, I wanted to play Hellfire on the Model 1 Genesis I have here. Because I really, really, really love the first track of the game. It's one of my fav most favorite soundtracks of all time. But the game is, I already know, so fucking beyond hard that there's no way. It's best to avoid the right, right this mean until I uh, get more familiar with shmups, yeah? Because it's just a, a genre that never interests me. Now, on RPGs, uh, forget it. That's n just not happening. If anybody's like, oh, I'm subbed and I want the RPGs, they're like, no, this is like a courtesy, you know? I'm not... Like I did, I don't, I don't want to sound like an asshole, but I didn't come here to be playing requests all the time. That's not what, you know, if, if, if life was like that for me, uh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be doing this, to be, to be honest with you. I'll be like, I, I don't want to do this. I would just be offline and play the games that I want to play. But like I said, because I'm very tiny now, we do this. And as time goes by, if I get more subs subscribers, then we have to come up with a system. Obviously, I can play every subscriber's fucking request a game. That's insane. But for now, uh, I think uh, if my vote wins, you got to put put the JSON mask somewhere in the background. Nah, I'm very peculiar with that. It has to fit here. For example, I have a Wario hat. It doesn't fit here. It's too big. I don't want to put it in here. I don't want to put it in here. I, I do have a JSON mask. Uh, I think it'll look cool, but it has to be like on a corner. It has to fit with it has to fit here without me having to zoom out. So if it fits here, if there's space here, right, then it should be no problem. Yes. Uh, I will do very occasionally very tiny decorations. Like this here, the garlic. I think it fits in well and it doesn't take space and it doesn't look trash. It has to it has to look good. Have you ever played Chase? Ask. Have I ever played Alien Storm on uh, Sega Genesis? No, I never played no shooters. Uh, not a request. Uh, no, no, I haven't played. And and, and you had a request anyways, because you 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 got yours just now. <laughs> you got yours. I played Metal Gear. That was that was the request. Uh, one per customer. Yeah. So Hellfire is a ball breaker. I'll think of something easier to get you going. Yeah. I don't mind hard, just not incredibly hard. Like, you know, if you got something that's hard, I don't, when I think of shmups, n nothing overly easy either, because I, I heard there's some shmups that are too easy. At least that's what J Joe from Game Sex is, but he's used to shmups, yeah? I think, yeah, Brute Tando says, gotcha. I think it should work. What console is it? Is NES, right? Yeah, it might work here side a bit sideways. I think it'll fit if it's just a mask. You know. I love that mask. I used to use here to conceal my identity, but I stopped giving a shit. Who, who am I to be hiding my face here? Who cares? I don't want to make it uh, a thing that's mysterious. Again, face showed up here a few times sideways. You can see my fucking mustache and everything. Who cares? You know? I just don't want to make the focus of the content, but I don't want to make it like it's a big mystery. Like, if I was to get big and it was a big deal, uh, I'll probably just show the face real quick, say, that you're happy, please go away. Uh, stop talking about the fucking face. It's not important. It's ju it just doesn't fit here. I could make it work, but I, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really interested in my own face and seeing it here. There's, there's nothing special about it. Uh... You know, I'm not ugly, if that's what you, you know, because some people go, oh, because I've seen some face review, the guy is like a nerdy, I forgot the name of the guy that was on, his career was over, pretty much. Uh, I'm not ugly, I'm actually a stud, a 6'1 stud, okay? An Adonis, a, a demigod. So forget about the, the looking ugly, I'm just really not interested in it, you know? I'm not deformed, I'm not a monster. But I'm not a model either. I'm just a very average looking person. So don't want to make a big deal out of it either. Because I think if you go out of your way to hide your face, then it becomes a thing as well. I, I don't want it to become a thing. 
So if once you become a problem, you know, it would be a problem. I don't know. I, I don't want to reveal anything. I think it's stupid. I, I don't know. I feel it's, it's, can I? Oh, you cannot do the, uh, mm. what happens if I go here? Oh, you have a, some time. Okay. What is the hearts again? Oh, okay. I don't know what the hearts, the hearts do something. Yeah, I just don't want any, anything. Because, yeah, you say, oh, you're never going to beat me. You don't know. You know, I want to, if I get big or not, I want to establish that from the beginning, the, the ground rules here. Come on, come on. Oh! Oh! How come? He didn't fire the, the thing again. You motherfucker, you. See, this guy gave me the impression he can't go on top of him, but he, you can. Just fine. Uh, oh, he doesn't. Okay. Well... Well, there goes my fucking awesome power. If I hadn't fucking picked it up again, I would still have it. Now look, are those poundable? I wonder. Yeah, okay, well. Oh, there's a thing in here. Oh, shit! I thought... It's because I play fucking, uh... What's it called? Alfred Chicken. It's a chicken game. You're a chicken. And there's an enemy very similar to that, that once he stops and does that thing, you cannot go on top of it. Okay. Uh, very sorry to tell you. I, I, it hasn't been long, but I, what can I do? I've drunk a lot of coke here, and I need to pee. So it'll be a very quick break. Sorry to... I really don't want to. I want to keep playing here. It's annoying. But I gotta, I gotta pee here, brother. I, I really, I really gotta pee. Let me find a break thing here. Jerome says, pro tip, diagonal up plus jump make you jump further. Thank you. I'll take a look at that. All right, uh, no commercials, just go pee real quick at home. I'll be right back. Stay tuned. Sorry, once again, like an idiot, I muted the game and not the microphone. Well, good going, stupid. I done peed. So, that was, that was that. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. 
heard everything possible because I, I went all <laughs> I went all the way to the house. It's very far away. I love how, and I don't mean to be whining and bitching. I usually have the panel off, but I have the panel on. It, I think it's funny. That's why I have that shit off. I go pee. Three viewers leave. How dare you be human and need to pee? You <laughs> just reabsorb it into your bladder. <laughs> the attention spam today is like, fucking, you want me to be here the whole time and there goes the light. The whole time here without peeing. Ah, fuck off. Oh my goodness. Caught on my fucking. And how goes, uh, God damn it. Okay. Set some, uh,. Get your game requests in. We're doing game requests for this time is a one-time thing. For now, we're doing uh, game requests. Okay, let me do here. Just give me a second. I'm gonna. What the fuck are you doing? I need to put Friday Thirteenth here. Can somebody put? Can somebody type? I don't have a keyboard, so I can copy and paste. Can somebody please type on the chat? Friday the Thirteenth. NES for me, please. Somebody do me a favor. Piss in a cup. I gotta do the low tier God stuff. The bottles of pee. The massive bottles of pee. Something to think about. You see, the gate just closed. Once the gate is closed here of the yard where, where, I, where I live, the, the workers are gone. I can go and pee outside. It's a, it's a field, so there's, there's no problem, right? But obviously, when the business is open, there's workers here. I can, can just do that. Thank you, uh, Brutando. I just need to copy and paste. I fucked up. I, I really need to sort out my keyboard situation here. There we go. Satsun, request a game. Subs are requesting games. Now let's go. There we go. Fuck off. Give me some fucking time here. You fuck. Looks I'm big again. It's okay, I went. What the fuck is your deal, bitch? What is this guy? So he's untouchable then. He's a fucking, he's a, he's a made man. Papanculo. Mmm. I don't like it. <laughs> fucking burn. Can you fucking block that? Son of a bitch. Mariconi. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Mm. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Oh, I'm not gonna trust you again. You let me down last time. Burn everything that moves. Burn all those who disagree with me. Ah! Will the fire work underwater? Yes. Very good. Oh! Oh, there's a passageway here. Let's go check it out. I hope it's not death. Cause that'll be kind of terrible. Yeah. Ooh. Look at that bitch. Low tier, <laughs> low tier god. B. Yes. I find him. Uh, yes, I know. I'm aware he's very horrible and say a lot of horrible things. Fuck. What the hell's wrong with you? Get out of here. Uh, but uh, he is very entertaining to, to me. And I watch a lot of his stuff. I don't catch his streams or none of that. I'm not a, the biggest fan here, but uh, he is very entertaining to me. There was a door in there. Look at that. And at least he speaks his mind instead of being fake, you know? Mm -hmm. Now, it's not always pleasant to hear, but there you have it. But it does have... Ow! Oh, so I can hit him. Oh, from the back. Okay, so only from the back. He does. He does like the rage quitting, though. I don't like. I. I don't get it. Like every time, right? He loses his. The guy is either a scrub, or uh, the controller. Or he picked the character. He's always like. I never. I never seen him saying, "I lost because I fucked up." And that's just his personality. Uh, but he's very entertaining to me. What the fuck? 
Oh! I didn't know you could do that. Look at this shit. Fort Max will be back later. Oh, have a good one, Fort Max. Thank you for stopping by. And don't forget your request later on. I'll be streaming here tomorrow the day after and all that. And just remember, all this shit uh, after Halloween, except... I forgot to mention, except, for example, Brute Tando mentioned Friday the 13th, and that might work. It's a Halloween type of game, you know? So that that I could do before, before the Halloween thing. <laughs> Fucking shit, come here. Fuck you, you motherfucker. Damn it, it took forever to get out of this bullshit here. No. I need a heart. I don't know, what do the hearts do? I done goofed here. I don't know. I'll try to try the coins one time, I suppose. I mean, losing is coming. I'll go with this feller. Huh. Yeah! Yeah. No, we're leaving. It's all good. We got one. It's fine. Hunter hearts give a life. All right. Uh, Jerome, what's with the alphabet here? How do I save the game? I, before, I, before I even proceed here, I'll, I'll take the time to have a smoke. Chase says, the color in this game looks awesome. I'm happy to hear it does. Somebody made this. It's a fan. Nintendo never did this. A guy went and colorized the fucking ROM. Isn't that awesome? A bit dark in places. You mean that my, let me make sure my TV set is, we'll wait for a, a dark place. Because if, if you put too much brightness, it gets washed out a little bit. Let me go here on full screen. Just, I like to take a look at details like the background. See, it's a bit washed out. Because I do, I do dial it in before I come streaming. As much as I can, I'm very anal about this. Jerome doesn't remember how to save. That's okay. It's, it's not really okay, Jerome. No, I'm kidding. Of course it's okay. I uh, wonder what the alphabet's all about here. I'm trying to press select. If you press B, you leave. You get out. Uh, okay, well, there's no save then. I could do a save state, but why? The game does save, right? We'll see how it goes. Brings it to life. You sure? Sure it does. Oh. Is it coming here? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Oh, shit. And I'm here goofing off. No. Fuck off, you fucking freak. All right. Music is awesome. Let's listen. I love this type of music here in old games. Very cool to music, but now what? End of the line, kid. Ah, just go on top of this. Give on. Cool, cool. Oh, be jittery here. Warriors a bit on the jittery side. Fuck you, you fuck. Okay. That's oh, a good spot to take a look at the brightness here. Let me go full screen. Jerome said it was a bit too dark at times. Uh, I don't know, man. The, it's kind of looking the exact same as what I'm seeing here. Perhaps this a tiny bit darker. Let me see. There you go. A tiny bit more brightness. And then picture. Maybe it's just a contrast a bit off. There we go. I think this is pretty close to what I'm seeing here in person. Yeah, I wonder how to save in this game. <laughs> Chase, do the look up if you don't mind, brother. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, we we'll leave that. Let's not get overcome with greed here. 
You're fucking annoying, this brick. Quick! I don't need it, I already have it. No, shit, what? Levels are already cool. Like this different stuff, like this one here, Run, running from this guy and using him as a platform. Oh, yeah, I say he and it. It's a, it's a slab of stone, for fuck's sake. Huh. The fuck? Yeah, but if I go there, he goes... There's spikes in there. But there's spikes in there. I can't go in there. You're crazy. Right? Okay. There's a door. Yeah, this is dark here in person. Let me see if I can improve that a tiny bit. Yeah, there you go. It is a bit dark. Just give me a sec, cause I, I'm having trouble seeing it myself here. So, so basically, you're getting the same image I'm getting here. There you go. I think, I think that's kind of a bit better. Right there. Excuse. That's what I'm, I've, I've had, yeah, they, it was your dark, Jerome. I couldn't see, I couldn't even see the fucking door, so. It's a problem when you, sometimes there's no one size fits all. Ha 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 Suffer. So sometimes you look good on a light scene, but bad on a, on a dark one. What's the problem? Like a trust? I don't need uh, the coins here. Jerome said that's way better. Problem is, though, with the lighter levels, it might be too uh, too bright. Let's see if that that one. Let me go on the full screen because this is very colorful, very bright. Let me see if that works. But it is way better. No, I think you see a bit of more red here. Let's go ahead and get rid of that a tiny bit. There we go. Tiny, tiny bit of more ray. That's it. I think that's uh, that's the one. <laughs> uh, let's try this. Yeah! Give it to me, bitch. Ho oh, ho! It's a bee water. Oh, I missed! Beautiful, color, colorful, awesome game. I love it. And this is the first time playing Game Boy Color, because technically it is Game Boy Color, and you can't run that on a DMG, you have no color. So even though the game originally is a DMG game, right? This sort of looks like a save for me, but... Don't know how to operate the whole thing. Course number five. It's looking good. A bit washed out, a tiny bit, but not too bad. Ha 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 ha, what's so funny, bitch? Okay, wait for this feller to come down. Off we go. Oh, so I did miss out that one time. Nope. <laughs> Be patient here. Just take your time. I <laughs> like I was affecting the other fella. <laughs> oh, I get you. On top. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Very fucking funny, asshole. <laughs> now, nah, you want to go on top of this thing here. Go. Get all the coins. He's, he's a greedy motherfucker. Yeah, just... Oh! 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 The hell are you up to? The fuck? Right, let's go. What the fuck? The fuck you doing? What you doing, bitch? 
I need a... <sighs> the fuckers. I need a thing. Get out of here, you... Fucking kind of belly button is... <laughs> oh, is the same shit? <laughs> oh, you fucker with your fucking freaky belly button from hell. Suck on this, motherfuckers. Can't break things anymore. Okay, maybe there would be a power up here. Damn you! What the fuck? There we go. I'll keep on a moving then. Yeah, there's a door here. It's barely visible. Is it. Ah! I'm trying to fucking. Boss man. Holy shit, that was a lot faster than I thought. Thought the Game Boy game was supposed to be slower over here. What are you on about? Where's my fucking lives? How many, how many lives I have left? Six. So, okay, so... What would happen if I had entered a coin place and summon a door? Would that mean the level's over, but then wouldn't that... Wouldn't that mean I didn't play the boss? Hmm. Okay. I'll try to concentrate a time a bit harder here so I don't lose all my shit. There's a door right here. These things are weird. I want to know what that other asshole goes. Okay, I guess I can just keep going here. Like here, if I summon... What I... Oh, it's a checkpoint. That's right. Okay, I got you. I remember now. Uh, what is allowed, what is not allowed? Sometimes I wonder. Because I, 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 I had the impression I jumped on top of this thing. It's gonna be small to boss again. You jelly belly motherfucker. Nice. Got another chance here. It was a lot quicker than I thought the turtle man here. Ugh, now I jumped too fucking hard here. Doofus. Do I have a checkpoint this time? Yeah, but... Oh, and I'm big, okay. Fuck, fuck those guys. Oh, here comes those knees. <laughs> Fucking hell. Sorry about that. Hope it'll be just one sometimes. Like, fuck off the belly! Oh, fucking get your fucking wiener out of here, man. God damn it, you fuck. Alright, just avoid those assholes. Fuck it. Okay, pay more attention here. Come on, bitch ass. Yeah, and then what? When is my turn, asshole? What the fuck am I to do here? Thank you, honey. I'm like, best uh, blow my nose here. <laughs> Metal Punk 7. Sorry I missed your, uh, your follow alert here, because my, uh, my speakers don't, don't let me hear it. Thank you for following me. The Korean, huh? Cool, cool. Thank you for following. I appreciate it. Let me try again here with uh, advanced audio properties and alerts. Put monitor off and try monitor and output again.
beyond me why it doesn't work. Okay. Ba, ba, ba. Oh yeah, and uh, I forgot because it was mentioned Super Mario uh, Bros. Sorry, Super Mario Land 2. Fuck this guy. Super Mario Land 2 uh, DX. I was going to play that. And the reason I'm not playing because this here is a request. I want to get the request out. So at least your ROM's request here. So that I can... Fuck you, you motherfucker. So I can go on with the, with the Halloween stuff. Oh my god. Get the fuck out. Fucking weirdos, man. So starting tomorrow, and it'll be an NES game. I think it's called Monster Party or something, but no promises. There's a door here. The fuck? The hell is that about? All right. Not sure what that do. Oh, we turn off the things here. Okay. Hey, hey, hey ho! Tardo man's gotta go. Don't come nowhere near me, you freak. Let's go. Got some powers here now. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Shit, you fucking gavon. Oh, God, it's straight to small. Huh? What the fuck? What's my problem with that jump? Fuck yeah, bitch. Hey, 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 <laughs> give me that cash, bitch. There we go. Yeah, let's do some batting here. I lose. You're insane. That's what happens when you gamble, doofus. Yeah, like fuck, I'm gonna gamble again. Is this auto save? Going. Get on, bitch. Mount Teapot. I always love when Mario, uh, the Mario franchise of games, they have like uh, in the old times, you know, everything named after food. It makes me hungry. Let's go. Look at the graphics. Look awesome. It's one thing sometimes with modern games that I don't like is how I do with this shit. Well, they're bombs. What the f Oh, I remember those jerk off. You die, fucking asshole. Let's get down here and explore. Can't do anything while you're small, tiny man. Fuck away from me, dude. Was a time mine. The hard first. Ah, uh, man, no, I love those older games. Nah, nah, you're not doing this shit, bitch. Fucking. There we go. We got our power back. I like how they made Warriors Teeth yellow, too. Oh, fuck me, huh? <laughs> Give me the coin. Oh. You gonna lock me in here? Else I should have gone there first. That that's the game, yep. So I missed those little coins there. Okay, that's fine. Activate the mine. Get it out of the way. 
Okay, how about I do this here? You fuck. What the fuck? Can jump... Can jump on top of it? What the fuck? How did I kill that bird then last time? Bitch ass. Fucking bird. <laughs> fuck you. I love the mine mechanics. Pretty cool. Get lost. What the fuck? What's he doing now? Liable to have things here. Keep an eye on that timer, too. Oh, I got some news uh, on the console department yesterday. I was quite busy uh, with my PSU. My new PSU. I got a SCPH. Oh, there's the Bonnie thing. What? Oh. Fuck your couch, then. <laughs> There's something up there. Something unholy. Come on, dude. You gotta have a secret passage here somewhere. Can I... Can I do something here? Hmm. <laughs> okay. Get the fuck away. Oh, I can do the... Oh! There we go. Some hidden secrets in here. Checkpoint. And there's another door in here. Hey, that's that part there, Paisano. There we go. I don't think that was an upgrade, was it? I don't think so. The, the other one lets you dash. This one can't even dash. What the fuck? I can't even dash here. Yeah, I don't think I should... Ah! How the fuck am I killing the... The feller? Fucking birds and crows and shit, always. What? Get out. I wonder if he kills the enemies, too. So, yeah, the PS2. So, I play... I only use my PS2 as a Silver Pal modded one. Uh, on my very first video. And it was Mortal Kombat. So, I have done a few things. I got an NTSC Japanese SCPH, I believe, 37,000. Kill him, kill him, kill him! Yeah! Uh, it's an ocean blue, it's a translucent blue, it's a, it's a thing of beauty. It's very beautiful, it's a very beautiful console. Um, it's 110 volts, and here where I live, the voltage is different, 240, I believe. So I uh, added something about a very long time ago called RE PSU. So it's a 12 volt conversion for your PlayStation 2. So it runs cooler. And you use a 12 volt adapter. Yeah, we'll get the hearts. No, I can't. Can't do it. Ah, uh, fuck your cash in. So I tested it. Works perfectly. Everything working. Uh, and there's a new edition of OPL. Ah! Fucking asshole. No! I need the heart. I'm very ready. Everything you got, man. There we go. So there'll be PS2 here soon in uh, the month of uh, Halloween here. I'm thinking Silent Hill 2, fellers. That's what I'm thinking. Ah, eh, shut up. Don't fucking rush me. Ah. Oh, this is an inter... So what if I go here? Is that death? Ah, fuck! The other time was a goddamn... All right, I'm not gonna bitch about that game too much. It's fine. Get back in get back on that horse. The other time was the secret passways. Now just kills me immediately. Oh pardon me for being a little curious here. Ah, <laughs> ah you fuck! What the fuck is up with this goddamn bird? Every game with a fucking miserable fucking birds, man. 
But you know, I not like birds. Every fucking motherfucking game here. The, the damn birds, I'll, I'll kick your face in. Silent Hill 2, yeah, it's, it's happening, dude. Definitely. Play the first one. I want a bottle of the finest whiskey there is, though. And, uh, he's not a, mmm. He's not a subscriber. I don't think so, but, we should, you know, and not eligible for the, the request. However, it's a game I really want to play anyways. Has been saying the thing on the Xbox. Oh, fuck off. Uh, I might play that as well. It looks interesting. Flawed. Fuck you, but interesting. Can I activate the thing down there? But Silent Hill 2 is a classic. It would be my first time playing. 100 fucking gazillion uh, percent no backseat in the fucking game. You backseat, and I'll kick your ass out of here. Honestly. I played the game once. I want to discover. I probably forget a lot of things. And that's fine. But it is the kind of game... Ah! Uh, the kind of game that really, really attracts backseating, for sure. There's some games that do, you know? And if I already play a game, I don't want to hear it. Unless I'm really fucked, you know? The thing is not backseating, it's unsolicited backseating that's a problem. Come on, bitch. Well, don't, don't go in there again. It's the way out. Yeah, Silent Hill 2 is a classic, and that one, here's the thing, you go about graphics and uh, resolution, if you're always caught up, caught up in resolution, you might be inclined to play that game on the Xbox, because of 480p support, that's what I usually do, but nope, that game is tailor-made for the PSU, with the PSU hardware in mind, and there's problems with the, with the Xbox, uh, that for me are deal breakers, the fog is not as good, and a lot of other little things here and there, that's... So, I personally want to play that game on the PSU. I could do widescreen, but I don't want to fuck with the game. I want to play as intended as it was kind of back then. Although, I, I, I think I probably did widescreen when I played. Yeah, I did. Silent Hill 3 and 2. I can't remember if I did widescreen. I think I might have done it. Because there's this place called PSU Wide, and you can enter very easy. You can do hex code. Uh, hex code your game, modify the game via uh, hex codes, and you can have widescreen enable, you know. But I think I want to play that game on 4x3, just like back in the day, and I might even use just a consumer TV. So, I'm looking forward to it. I'm just, uh, just setting up my PSU. I did all the hardware. Oh, by the way, the PSU, what a fucking... I was surprised I had never opened a PSU before or done any mods to it. I just needed to replace the PSU. Well, the first mod, what was it? The first thing was... I, I forgot what I needed to do on it. No, just change the PSU, right? Yeah, just change the PSU. Well, holy shit. You know, with the PS1, you open the console, there's your PSU. Because I have the RE PSU for the PS1, right? It's like Pico PSU. It's pretty much the same thing. Very cool. You know, because 12 volt, you can go anywhere you want. You can move anywhere on Earth. It's 12 volts, it's, you know, 12 volt power. You can power it on on your fucking truck. You know, it's awesome. So when I opened a console, it just it was like a fucking onion. It just kept going. And the written guide for the REPS2, I found it very poorly written, as many guys are. Some people are very talented at making devices, make them, but for guides, they're very... I talked to Jerome one time about that, and it's true. Some guides are absolute trash, like they're really in a hurry. So I moved the PSU, not even realizing it was the PSU. It's like a square plate. Because the pictures were the plate like this, and then the guy inverted the plate and, and put it on the same place. But didn't say anything on the guide, right? So I'm I'm thinking that the second picture is not the PSU flipped, it's another layer under it. And I'm like, I keep going, going. The console was completely fucking disassembled pretty, pretty much. And I'm like, I'm in big trouble here. I don't, I didn't write down where the screws go because I, I wouldn't expect them going that deep. By the time I realized it, I was way too deep in disassembling the fucking console. And it was fucking horrific. 
And thank God I remember everything but one tiny screw. I could not fucking remember where one tiny screw. It didn't affect anything. So it was touch and go there for a while after I put the PSU, but uh, by God, it worked. Uh, everything worked. Everything was put back together. And, uh, you know. So I got a PSU now. Uh, I, I want a bigger hard drive, but the, I have one from the other PSU. It's a two terabyte. That would do for now, I reckon. I'm, I'm out of cash, you know. Chase says, I don't know about that game. So first time for me when you play it on here. And Chase, you've been playing Resident Evil 1, right? Okay, let me even take the headphones for this one. Doing a little pep talk, you and me, Chase. As much as I love having you here, I wouldn't suggest that. Unless you really, really want to. Your Silent Hill 2 experience should be not watching somebody play. 100%. You just beat Resident Evil 1. What, what were you planning on playing next? Because here's the beauty of it. You don't have to play Silent Hill 1 before playing Silent Hill 2, if you never play Silent Hill 1. As far as plot goes, it's completely not connected in any way, shape, or form. Silent Hill 3, 3 is the sequel to Silent Hill 1. Do you have the means to play Silent Hill 2? Satsun, uh, apparently there's a Silent Hill 2 remake coming out. Yes, I might have to look into that, but it's probably too scary for me. Silent Hill 2 is scary at points, but it's a different type. Uh, for me, of all the Silent Hills I played, was Silent Hill 1 to 4. That's what I played so far. I'm going to go with the fourth one as being the scariest one. The best game? No. Fuck no. Not, but it's not as bad as some Silent Hill uh, people say it is. I mean, for them it might be. For me it wasn't. Uh, it was excellent, except for escorting Eileen for half the fucking game. That is miserable. Oh my god. What the fuck were you thinking doing that? That's my main fucking gripe of that game. I despise mazes. I despise crows. And I despise in-game. I like crows in real life. And I despise, most of all, first and foremost, I despise escort missions with a passion. Horrific. They should go away and never come back. Are you supposed to fight, run, or decide when to fight and run? I never watch gameplay. On Silent Hill 2? There's some times you cannot avoid, avoid fighting. I mean, you could, but it's not normal. Uh, you can go killing. There's ammo management. Yeah, you can be shooting everything and everyone. Uh, for example, Silent Hill 1 and the first one, which I streamed here. Uh, those flying enemies, a lot of people that started to go shooting those things. It was a waste of time. You know, it's, you just avoid them as much as you can. Silent Hill 2. Uh, oh, that's shit. Silent, see, that's why I can't play Fatal Frame here. This creepy ass shit, man. So Silent Hill 2. Uh, no, you kill some enemies. You have to kill enemies. You can't go the whole game. I really don't mind watching it here. I'll be honest with you, it's a shame. It's, it's up to you. I mean, you're a grown ass man, you decide. But I think Silent Hill 2, everyone's experience should never be watching a playthrough of it, but playing it for you, by yourself for the first time. Keep in mind, and well, you're welcome to watch it here, but keep in mind you'll be depriving yourself from a very, very unique experience. I tell you, a very unique experience I had in that similar vein that any other occasion would have fucked it up. I was, uh, and that's going a little break here, a little talking break, if you don't mind, my good sir. Ladies and gentlemen, well, gentlemen, there's no ladies here, apparently. According to analytics, there's not, and that's fine. Not, not be, uh, well, why am I talking about this? Listen, one time I was in a, a cousin's house, right? They were out, they had, they had a Trinitron in there, PS1, a bunch of VHS tapes. So I grabbed one of the VHS tapes, which now I know is from Dust Your Dome. Had never heard of the movie ever before. I was there, had a bottle of whiskey, and I was very young. And I uh, popped the movie in into the VHS player, the VCR, and started watching that movie without ever, ever hearing of it, ever. If you watch that movie, then by now you realize that I'm in for a very unique experience because the movie starts as a road, sort of a road movie, crime movie, and it turns to what it turns, right? And when it did, well, that caught me by fucking surprise, and it was awesome. 
Had it been any other occasion, had I heard of the, the movie, had I seen trailers, it would have ruined it. Had I had a box and read about it, maybe seen some pictures in the back. No, it was just a fucking bootleg VHS tape in there. And when I watched that, that way, very unique. And here's another one, The Blair Witch Project. When I watched it, I was 100 fucking percent convinced that it was a real thing. And the, I had no access to the internet. I caught up late with that. Uh, the news, I didn't want, didn't have a TV. Well, I had a CRT, but it was just for watching movies, right? I wasn't gaming at that time. Uh, and I watched the Blair Witch Project. And on that video store, they also had the Blair Witch Project was a, a, a mockumentary mockumentary of how it was real now so i was uh i was uh i thought this was a this is the greatest footage ever found right uh uh, you know how i found out about it you think a few months now life went on and it wasn't until I, i was all the way in nevada one time in i was living in reno and i was watching the sci-fi channel right and there was a movie about sort of like, sort of looked like uh, Starship Troopers with the insects. And there was the lady, the lady I recognized her immediately from Blair Witch. At that time, at that, and that afternoon, I realized that I'm a gullible idiot. So that's when the re- realization came. So, yeah. So basically what I'm saying here, if you watch Silent Hill 2 here, you will deprive yourself from a game that it, it is only... It, it will be good after you play it yourself, but you ruin a lot of things for you if you don't experience it. So you can watch it here, or you can emulate it right now if you don't have a PSU. You just beat Resident Evil 1. It's a game that is it's kind of similar, right? Silent Hill is similar. Don't tell me it's not. You're full of shit. It is. It was a carbon copy, but it, it became its own thing later on. So Chase, if you have access to... Shoot- any access, any way to play Silent Hill 2, do it. You'll be a few days before I get to that game, I think. I don't know when or if I'll get to, to it in Hall- Halloween. But that's that's the advice I have for you. But if you don't, if you want to play here, watch it here, that's fine. But you will deprive yourself of a very unique experience. L- let it be known. Shout in front of the rooftops here. Silent Hill always recommend play by yourself because there's a lot of plot things. Especially the second one is all about the plot. As for the remake, all right, that's enough of a break. As for the remake, uh, I'm actually excited about it. Uh, sometimes the Silent Hill fandom, they're a bit weird. They're... Why am I here again? Is this... Oh, no, it's a different place. Okay. All right. Blow up, you motherfucker. Yeah! Okay. Oh no, I need a bull power. Can I? Nope, the current. Okay, maybe kind of drop down here. Activate this thing. Let him come. Come here. Even though he probably respond. Mm. Yeah, fuck. I go in here like this. There we go. Big, big brain time here. <laughs> oh, really? That's very. There he is. Uh, Chase, have you played Silent Hill 1? How do I kill this thing? So I can only jump on top of it when it's not when it's not charging. Is that it? There we go. That's what do you get? The dragon power. You better be there when I come back. There we go. It looks very weird. It looks like some kind of weird dildo. I gotta redo Silent Hill 1 because of the save stays. You fucked up on the save stays, serve your right. You know my opinion on it. <laughs> get, get wrecked. The game has saves. Why, why you need save states in there? Hey, you can do whatever you want. Are you telling me, telling people what you do with the save states again? No, you can do whatever the fuck. Oh, is this is more powerful. 
Nah, I don't know, man. This was the right course of action. He says, plus you'll be fresh. I was a puss. All right. Well, at least you're honest about it. There you go. Just, just do regular saves. Just, ah! The game is enough. Or not. Do, do your thing. But I'll never, ever say that playing Sentinel save states is... Damn it, Thomas died there. It's, uh, it's the real deal. It's not. can ruin many games. See, you kind of ruin. I, I know what you mean with the save state room. It's safe in a spot maybe is impossible to get out of. Oh, checkpoint is over there, my good sir. Get this out of here, crazy. But I already have it. And there's a door in there. It controls very well, this game. It's very fun. The mechanics. It's a door here. I almost didn't even see it. Resident Evil was no safe stage and was the most fun I ever had. Bingo, there we go. It was a pain at first, but it was worth it. I'm very happy to hear. That game is fucking awesome. Uh, we'll revisit someday uh, with Chris. I never play as Chris, so there'll be something interesting to do. Get out. Get out of here. What are you doing? Fuck off. So I'll definitely do a Chris run at some point. But, you know. Maybe make it interesting. Make it a Saturn version, which is a tiny bit harder. Okay. I wonder if there's secrets up there. Nope. No. Why would I? Why would I want that shit? I had 19 saves. Uh, the saves part I never get it unless you're going for a ranking. Uh. Did it? Uh, di I never found that the amount of saves that it had make your, you know, your playthrough less worthy or something. So, I probably on my, uh, when I played it here, I probably had more saves than that. I think it was 20 or something. 23 or some shit. It was a lot. If somebody tells me, you had a lot of saves, I don't, I don't care about that. I will save as much as I want. You know. Oh. It's fine. The saves are there. They're part of the game. They give you the ink ribbons. What's the problem, you know? There's such a thing sometimes being too purist. It's annoying. Now, I think if you have one of them, if you want to, like, the S ranking or whatever, then you, oh, then you can't... You can uh, use a lot of save states, or you gotta use... Or I think you can save only once. And uh, also first aid sprays, a bunch of shit you can do. But if you're playing normally, I don't see what's the problem. Chase says, yeah, watching you play made me want to play, so I don't think Silent Hill 2 will ruin it for me. But I get what you're saying. I know when things happen shit, but I also forget shit a lot. With Silent Hill 2... Uh, Chase, that's the thing. I wouldn't say that with, with the other ones, like Silent Hill 1, maybe the third one maybe a tiny bit, but Silent Hill 2 is a very special game because of its plot and what takes place in there. It's very different than Resident Evil 1. I love Resident Evil 1, oh, but come, come off it with a plot, yeah? It's, it's there, but it's not like, you know... Silent Hill 2 is... Silent Hill 2 is, is one of the greatest games ever made. It's just... It's very unique. It's a very unique game. So it's... I would treat it very different than all the other Resident Evils and Silent Hills and games like that, for the most part. That I would... That's why I went through the trouble of telling you this. But, again, you're a grown-ass man, and you, you decide what's the best course of action, but, you know... But I, I feel it is my duty here to let you know that. That you, if you play Silent Hill 2, the after you watch me, it ruins a lot of the things that you would experience by yourself. Resident Evil 1, I would say no. Resident Evil 2, I would say no. I wouldn't say any of those. To an extent, yeah, but not like... Silent Hill is his own thing, I would say. So, but if you don't want to, it made you play, but, you know. Uh... 
is not connected with the, with the Silent Hill 1, as far as the lore goes. And somehow I moved... There we go, the trap out here, that, that's, that's better. That being said, I love uh, Silent Hill 1 might be my favorite. I, I really, I just really love that game. Uh, can I use this? Oh. Then get out of here. Shit, the timer. <laughs> huh, it's a weird pattern. I gotta run because of the time. Mer. Shut up. Chase says, fuck it, I'll play it. That a boy. I'm proud of you. Uh, Chase, do yourself a favor. Boot that game tonight. Boot Silent Hill 2 tonight. Forget Silent Hill 1 for now, if you don't mind. Uh, as much as I love Silent Hill 1. Go experience Silent Hill 2. I love the bad ending. No, Silent Hill 1 is awesome. I love that game. I, I, I want to remake it. I... I, I <laughs> Konami's going with the cash cow, of course. Silent Hill 2 is the one that everybody loses their shit about it. Uh, and I love that game, too, but the other ones need attention, too. Silent Hill 1 should have a remake desperately. It's the one that actually really needs a remake. You can play Silent Hill 2 on the PC with the enhanced experience, with the HD textures and shit. It's pretty good, you know? Yay! Chase is gonna play Silent Hill 2. Bet I'm downloading it right now. And here's something that is a there's a silver lining to this if you like watching the channel. Sometimes I love to play a game, a very deep game, and then watch my favorite YouTuber or whatever play the game and see. Oh, I wonder how he's gonna react to that part. Ooh, that part is coming. That sort of shit. So it might it might make it uh, enjoyable for you to play here. I'll do emulation. Do emulation and do. Uh, internal resolution and all that shit if you know how to fiddle them or not you know uh, either way you're gonna have a ball with the game so i look forward to hear what you have to say about it and i'm glad you took that course of action i don't think i would say that uh, probably about some games but not as strongly as silent hill 2 it's a very special game that i believe i believe sincerely strongly believe that looking Watching a whole playthrough and then playing, it will never be the same. Especially if you haven't watched a playthrough, then you go and then you're going to have a very, you're going to have an experience not different than anyone back in the day. It'll be the same thing. Like I play Metal Gear now. Granted, when you're older, you're a bit more cynical. You're not as easily as impressed by things, right? Uh, maybe. Then a kid would be more like more of a, everything's bigger in your head, right? But you would have the same experience. There's an edited and long, long version. Yeah, they do have, sh uh, what's it called, not Shatter Dreams, or, th th there's another edition. Uh, play the PS2 one, just make sure you don't, don't play the other ones, don't, uh, PC, Xbox. I uh, would st stick with the PS2, it's made with the PS PS2 hardware mine. Uh, the fog would be better, a lot of things would be better. Uh, I don't know, just play the common one, the normal one. I don't know about the long version. If... Just just look it up, maybe the cutting room floor. They'll mention the differences. Or just look up Silent Hill, which, what's the difference, you know? Because there's one you can play as Maria. Um, I think that maybe, that came out on Xbox first, and then I think they brought it to the PlayStation. There's a lot of Silent Hill 2 editions. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, it's a bit overwhelming. When in doubt, just play the one that the launch one. Done. You know, that's the... You know, or just, or, or if you want more bang for your hypothetical buck, which is this emulation, and it's fine, they're not, you know, they'll make it a remake. I'll buy the remake, I'm not buying the old one. Come off it. I, oh shit. How much? What's it? No, fuck this. I'm not gonna get another one. I'll play once. I sure as hell hope my game is saving. In case anything happens here. You are going to have... That's a grand old game, my, my good sir. You're going to really... If you like that type of game, which I know is already been established that you do. You will fall in love with that game. You really will. 
What a what a fucking game! God damn it, Silent Hill Chew for the win, man. Chase, you're in for a treat. I don't want that shit. I already have things here that I like. You are in for a treat, my good sir. Tonight! Tonight! It's gonna be awesome. I envy you. I play once. So I, I, I'm looking, but I, the amount of time I spend, you know, watching theories and... Sometimes I play, uh, most of the times I play a game once, but the amount of time I spend, like, the theories, the stuff, it's, it's awesome. It's an awesome game. Oh! He says, but, I mean, I recorded my Resident Evil playthrough and put it on YouTube. Oh, you did? Oh, put a, put a link to your channel. No, I know your channel. Don't need to. Don't need to. I didn't know you. Because I went one time. No, oh, no, no, no. I want to keep this thing here. Now, I came from here, right? Is that a, is that a, is that a fact? Let's go up here. No, no. I'll take a look. I do like to... It's it hits different when you know the person to watch him playing the game. Is it commentary or no commentary? And uh, PCS, PCSX2 is the emulator I used back when I used to emulate. It is an excellent emulator. You can look into uh, internal resolution, uh, increase internal resolution, but take a look, ex Google about Silent Hill 2, because sometimes it does introduce bugs. I had a bug on Fader Frame, aka Project Zero, on which I increased the, uh, the internal resolution in the talisman doors, because you need to like, there's a little hint, like a blue aura, and it would not show up. And I was like, I don't know how to, to advance in this game, I was stuck. And turns out that if you increase the internal resolution, the talismans uh, disappear. So that, that was the problem. So you gotta make sure you don't have something like that, that will affect your gameplay. I have a headset, microphone sounds like dark water. That's fine, is it audible? If it's audible, that's fine. People go a bit overboard with the, with the quality sometimes, and also, like you're a small YouTuber, like who gives a shit? You improve it later. Some people spend like months fucking buying gear, right? Because they want to get, like have the best of the best. Fuck you, man, damn it. Die, motherfucker. <sighs> Come here, freak. Yeah, they spend uh, like thousands of dollars on buying gear and buying this and that to do the YouTube and the streams and then they go do the streams and uh, they're boring, uninteresting and nobody's watching and now you spend a bunch of money and now you're fucked and unhappy. You know, get, get shit going. God, you passed. And then worry about uh, worry about the uh, improving later, yeah. And by the way, that's not me saying I'm not boring or uninteresting. By the way, uh, I'm just saying that you know you, uh, you got to be careful when you spend a lot of money on things. If you have money, then who, who gives a shit, you know? But if you like, oh, can I go in with this key? If you're skipping meals and shit, right? To buy equipment. <laughs> it's not not the right course of action. Okay, let me... Give me that. You crazy? No, 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 no. Give me, give me my fucking key, motherfucker. Give me this. But... It's... This key, uh, something, something to do here. He dropped a key. The key was for something else. My channel is gonna be long commercials from the seventies, twenty tens, and playthroughs. Yeah, just do whatever you feel like. You know, you happy doing? I'm not gambling tonight. Thank you. Let's no. Yeah, do whatever makes you happy, man. You know, but uh, you're gonna enjoy Silent Hill too. That, that's for sure. It's a cool looking game. This game, I'm having fun here. 
Pardon me. Oh, that was a close one. Pardon me if I talk a lot, but that's uh, that's how the stream goes, you know? I am yet just sort of master walking and playing at the same time. Oh, fuck them. Can I? No, I cannot. I was wondering if we can kill him. Get out of here. Get out of here. Fucking crows and birds and shit. Every fucking game. So many of them. Aha! Uh -huh. Nice try. No, I'm keeping what I have here. Right? That, that'll be a downgrade, wouldn't it? The fuck? Go get that. Damn it! Move, asshole. No. Shit, oh, I missed the timing. Okay, just gotta be uh, floating here. No, 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 no. You're not doing this shit. Get out. It's gonna come back here, isn't it? Or disappear. So those things hurt you. I barely noticed. I thought it was uh, just decoration. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> yeah, I got my suit again. See, if there's a game called MUVR that emulates a bedroom, I know that. I've seen a lot of footage. The CRT or Retro Console is how it run the commercials. It's a pretty cool game if you don't have CRTs. Yes, I, I've seen that. It's very, very, very cool. What? Get in there. I thought I could walk while I was crouched, apparently. Cannot? Oh, whatever then. Let's go. Yeah, get the dragon power. Cool. Play with that around. Play around with that a tiny bit. I wonder what that key was for. wonder if this game has secret levels because uh, Super Mario Land 2 does. Ah, burn you son of a bitch. Okay, let's check this door here now. Uh, okay. There we go. I like the system of checkpoints here. Oh! I thought it... Okay, I gotta pay more attention to what the pattern is, you know, what a pit is. I'm pretty sure there's some sort of indication here. Can I break the ship? Yeah. So maybe when I look down here, whenever there's this little shine here, this that's probably it. I'm not gonna risk it, right? Oh, I lost all my coins, huh? Mother Okay. Back Yeah. It was greed that killed the man. I'm also, next week, I noticed there's a emote that... Oh, can I get crazy? There's an, an emote that... Can I? No. The people are not really using. The M buys on one. So I will uh, make a second dancing emoji. Sorry, emote, whatever, whatever the fuck you call it, I think. So then you have two of them. <laughs> hey, Paisano. Got something in here. Hey, hey, all right. Download this Silent Hill 2 and play after the stream. I want to hear all about it. You probably, I don't I don't know if you finish like right away. You're probably busy with other stuff like right away in one sitting, you know? It's a kind of a, it's a modern game, so it's a bit big. I mean, it's possible. But I'm looking forward to here whenever you finish. To hear... How do you like the game? It's a quite unique experience. And if you don't like it, by the way, I don't take it personal. I did, turns out I didn't develop the game, so it's okay. <laughs> Again, we'll go back to the idiotic people sometimes. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like taking offense. Somebody doesn't like a game that is a masterpiece for them, and they take offense to that. It's called being dumb. It's called being an, an idiot. 
complete idiot. I hate people like fanboys, eh? What do you mean you don't like Silent Hill 2? It's the greatest game ever made. I don't like it, dude. You know? Not me. I love the game. But I'm saying some people might play the game and I like it. What about it? Happens. Ah, fucking piece of shit. Get, mm. Get out of here, weirdo. But I, I, I think you'll like it. You'll love it. Ah, come on. Yeah, that one. It's just not being used. I, I think people are not getting it. It's supposed to be like when you win. So it's sort of like the dance. I think I'll replace it and make another dance one. Yeah, because I see the numbers. I think they could, could use another dance one. Maybe, maybe make some country music or something. Give them a little costume. It's spooky season this time. Yes. So, yeah, starting tomorrow, this is the last request uh, until Halloween. So, it's back to me picking games here. And I'll skip. Haha! Yeah, I find that uh, they say I was not scary. It is. I found uh, many parts of Silent Hill 2 very scary. Again, I get very immersed into the game. I found, in order to find, I find uh, Silent Hill 4 to be the scariest one I play. It's on the scare factor. Not talking about the quality of the game, but scare factor. I would say Silent Hill 4, if I had to put a second one, I'll say Silent Hill 3 is pretty fucked up. You know, it's like hell. Sometimes. And Silent Hill 1 is scary too. Then I'll put Silent Hill 1 and 2 and a kind of similar. Silent Hill 1 is scarier, but that doesn't make... Silent Hill 2 is not scary though. It's uns Silent Hill 2 is not about. It's unsettling. It's deep. You know? Silent Hill 4 is scary as fuck. And I'm not the only one, by the way. I've seen other people agree. You can always find people that agree or disagree with you. I love Halloween. It's my favorite time. It's my favorite time of the year. Uh, Christmas is number two. Tell why Halloween, because I love spooky horror stuff. I love I love decorating the house with all the Halloween stuff. <laughs> ah! Ooh. Uh, I I love that signifies that death, the demise of summer, which is my least favorite season of the year. I can't stand summer. I'm not a summer person. Not a sunshine person. Don't like not a heat person. I hate all about it. Everything about it instigates hate for me. Hate it, I hate summer. Can't fucking stand it. So fall, it is my favorite season of the year because it kills summer. When the fall comes in, the leaves start falling. That's why they call it fall. We call it autumn. Good for you. I'm gonna stick with fall. So it I love it, you know? Everything about it. So yeah, this Halloween, if everything goes as planned, I think is one of let me make sure. Is it one? one of my days off let me see the osc is scary yeah because uh yeah they know how to do sound for sure yeah i'll be off either way so uh, yeah i'll be off so uh, i'll be coming here my day off and i'll be playing the plan is to play silent hill sorry silent hill that'll they'll get copyrighted for sure i like that movie by the way i like the silent hill movie i don't care what the fandom has to say i like the movie i can agree the second one was kind of ass but i still i still it's kind of a crap movie, the second one. I'm not sure about it. There's some scary parts of the mannequin. Get out of here. That was fucked up. Uh, but the first movie, I love it. I don't care if it doesn't follow the game. It's a fucking movie. And, oh, and uh, not only Silent Hill, the Silent Hill F. Can I still get the other? This is going to be coming, which is a brand new Silent Hill game. There's the remake, and they're also working on a movie. So there's a bunch of fucking Silent Hill stuff all over the place. And of course, more pachinko machines. There's, is that two doors or no? This is the this is the place you go. Same, cause fall no more. Yeah, 120 heat. Shit changes so fast in like three. It's awesome. It's cold here. I fucking love it. Every time, you know, I'm already dreading summer. So much I hate it. It's like a countdown. It's like I know that you'll return. 
the foul season. Can fucking stand it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Keep this. Which Resident Evil should I play next? Shoo! There's no other choice. Resident Evil 2? Absolutely. Which happens to be my favorite Resident Evil of all time? Uh, more than 4? Yes. And, you know, how you compare Resident Evil 4 and Resident Evil 2? They changed the game. It's a completely different gameplay. It's a completely different genre. It's it's its own thing. I don't I don't like comparing Resident Evil 2. I don't like comparing games sometimes. It's annoying. Uh, you know, it's okay to like more than one. It's pitting games against games. I don't know. Uh... Resident Evil 2. Satson says Resident Evil 6. <laughs> I, of course, he's joking. I grew up with 4 and 5. Yeah, so you can see if 4, Resident Evil 5, Resident Evil 6, and then I went first person, changed the game again. They're different games, they're different genres. They're not the same thing. Now it's first person. So, like, well, what sense does it make? Like, I compare, I don't compare Super Mario 64 with GoldenEye. It's, what? It's like, they're different games. You can say which one you like more, but. Comparing them directly is kind of dumb. So, uh, Resident Evil 1, 2, and 3 are the ones you compare. Maybe Code Veronica, similar. Gameplay similar, yeah. Uh, 6 was different, yeah. I, 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 a lot of people hate on, on the 6th one, the 5th one, but I don't go up. I'm aware. For me, it's Resident Evil, Resident Evil 6, but since I started doing the channel... Walk and talk, walk and talk. I started doing the channel, uh, then my, for me, number two would be next. But if I was playing privately, a Resident Evil 6, because I played the fifth one with my wife in Uncle Up, it was awesome. So I look, I look forward to it. I'm aware of his reputation. You see, they're different. Now, sometimes they try different stuff, right? Let's see how, how that's going to go. Oh, there you go. This one is... It's an awesome power, this one. Uh, but for Chase here, is Resident Evil 2. The choice is, is the only sane choice. Nah. Is this weird ass shit, man? I got a key here, but. No! How the. Can you not grab it? There we go. Yeah, last key uh, didn't work a lot. Nah! Oh. God. What are you doing here? Get the fuck out of here, man. Let's try this again. I keep... You can see me, I'm... A bit of an idiot. I think I fucking fucked it up, didn't I? I wonder if you'll open that weird ass door here. Nah, that's a weird ass door. That's a fucking weird Carlos on a remake. I haven't played a remake yet, just a demo. Love that the the guy. I love what they did with the character there. Don't don't like Jill. I don't like Jill in that game. Don't like her attitude. So that's that's a key. Yeah, Leon is awesome. He's also my favorite character on Resident Evil. So you love, you love Resident Evil 2. Oh my god. That's like how Leon was made. What the fuck is this? Get out of here. Give me this thing. Chase says, I'm gonna beat Resident Evil 2, then go back to Resident Evil 1 for Chris. Yeah, you can do that, but my advice to you, if I may, if I may be so bold, sir, is I play the third one. That's the trailer you done after two. The third one is with Jill. It is awesome. Uh, I'm not as familiar as I am with the other ones, but I played once or twice. It's a very good game. Introduce a lot of cool stuff. They start going to action already then. Let me clean this up here. Uh, and then I will go back to one for Chris, if I were you. But of course, it's just a suggestion. Not, not, a, an, an, not an order. And the timer's running out, and I don't know how far I am from, from things here. Okay. So that's what uh, the key was, and it opens a... a sort of a... prize? Is this a door? No. 
So I gotta head on back. I hope I'm not missing a door here, because sometimes they're kind of dark and blend in. I came from here, though. The whole thing was a diversion. I don't feel like uh, I need to go back here. I think I'm... Oh, no. I'm gonna die because of the timer. Can you get out of the fucking way? You passed! My god, he's everywhere! Uh, fuck off! I don't think this is the right course of action here. I'm dead already. Dead man walking. Getting lost in a 2D game. Good going, stupid. But I am, though. What can I tell you? I'm lost here. <laughs> no idea where to go. Yeah, I went all the way back to the beginning of the level. Uh, I'm not sure where to go here, motherfucker. Huh? I got the fucking key and then what? Hate this shit. Probably a fucking door I haven't seen because it's so fucking dark here sometimes. Fuck off. Get, get away from me, dude. Just... I'm not a big fan of timers in games. I, I know they exist, and they're part of nearly every game I grew up with, but uh, sometimes I hate it. I want to hang out. I want to explore. I want to take my time. I'm not a never being a hurry to fuck up or, oh my god, I need to go kind of guy when I'm playing games. So I can't ever do speed runs and all that shit. I like to explore. I'm a great explorer. I, I guess I entered this one here then. See, this is a... God, this guy's a pest. Oh my god, is this motherfucker a pest. Ah! A pest! Get up there. I'll try to get the treasure again. I don't know if I have to to get it again. Again, another time. I fucked around here too much with the damn key here fucking around. Okay, there you go. It's a door right here. What's with the doors being so fucking... Come on, put a, put a fucking border around that shit, bitch. What are you doing? You can barely fucking see this shit. There we go, now we know though. It's fucking stupid. I can't see the door sometimes. It's too fucking dark. And it's not the TVs, the the, the monitor is dark. Look at the other parts of the the you know, the game here. The grass and warrior is bright and vivid. It's just the the motherfucking uh No, that's it, it's already acquired. What if I go back in there now? Give me something. Alright. Nah, it's right here. <sighs> Go away, past. Go away. Oh man. Bamboos are locked. There we go. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. No, I don't think so. Ah, oh, shit. Is this infinite? It's fucking awesome. <gasps> oh! You stupid motherfucker. Do you know what kind of Elgato you have? Yes, I do. I have an Elgato HD60S Plus. Elgato HD60S Plus. I did plan to capture with it. When I started a channel, I should have captured simultaneously with this footage. And uh, very nice. It worked very well. And the price was good. I know they have newer ones now, but I'll be happy with that. Yeah. If you're doing direct capture, you know, like everybody else, that's what you, you want something to that effect. It works pretty, pretty good. 
I use an Alfred a camera because it's basically the same concept as HDMI being fed to it. And this, before this, I use Camlink 4K, which works well, but I think the Elgato is a bit more reliable, maybe. Yeah, and the uh, Camlink 4K doesn't work for direct capture. Don't, don't, some people have tried to, it, it just doesn't, it's not made for it. You're welcome. Okay. Sorry? Ah, oh, I died here. That's right. Like an idiot. Okay. So, okay, I lost a power to fly here, and this guy... What the fuck? Okay, I guess I'm gonna act should and come back. Try to get with this, uh... Hit my head here. Okay, there we go. I kind of tried to control with the D pad before. And I... What is going on here, dude? Okay, every time you jump, it changed. I gotcha. Look at those motherfucking coins, are crazy. Oh, no, he's gone. Shit. That's very cool. Hey, hey! When he runs. He's running. He's going home. Good shit. Nice trap there. Oh, look at the collars here. I love it. Oh. Burn for it. No, it didn't get fucked in the face. I want you burning. Yes. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I think it's the boss man. So I want to move shit around the house, chat here, and uh, give me room so I can get a CRT and some retro consoles in there. Definitely. I think I had a Panasonic as a kid, as I, I can't remember. I went on a great adventure once, tried to find out the model of the CRT I grew up with. No, I'm not going to gamble here. I already got next to nothing. Oh, I got the... Oh, that's what that is. Thought it was going to be a boss in there. Oh, very cool. A red level with lava and shit. I always love those. If you like retro games, I strongly su suggest this one. Wake up, bitch. It's an awesome game this year. The mechanics, the controls are awesome. Please don't be, uh, don't mistake me talking about other, other stuff with the chat with me not being, oh, not being interested in, in the game, you know, I am very much invested in this game, it's very good, excellent suggestion by, uh, Jerome, it's a game, to be honest, I would have played eventually, it was gonna be, uh, it was gonna be, uh, ugh. come on, man. Want it? Oh, shoot for the price of one. I love it. Yeah, it's a game I would have played eventually, anyways. That's the same fucking power I already have. I'm looking forward to the Halloween stuff. Play Halloween games. Alright. 
See, there's a door in there. I can barely fucking see it. I, I just saw it. Hey, KBX, the Game Master. Thank you for following me a couple days ago, and hi from YouTube. Hi there. Glad to see you making your way here. I like to see games being played in original hardware. Oh, uh, Jerome says drop an enemy in that owl thing. Ah, fuck, there's a wasteland here now. Next time. I'm glad to hear KBX, the Game Master. That's what you get here. Game on original hardware. Uh, with mods, there's mods, there's flashcards, there's that, but the hardware it does make the hardware less original. Unless you're like a real hardcore purist, which in any case, you know, do your own thing. So, all those booze here. Are they, they hurt me if I go on them? Oh, you can kill them here. Okay. Uh... Excellent game this year, man. This is a lot of fun. No, I need the dashing power to get the ones down there. Er I'm happy, I always happy to see folks from YouTube coming here. Because that's where I started anyways. To be honest, I did want to do a Twitch right away, but I just didn't have the internet. Since you played uh, Metal Gear Solid 1 for a whole day, basically I got to do you a, a solid and beat Silent Hill 2 for you. Yeah, no, you'll love it. You, you, you're gonna love that game. If you play the first, if you like the first one, that means you already have the Silent Hill beast within you, and you're gonna like that game. And KBX says flesh cards are base. Good, thank you. I'm glad you uh, you approve because some people they do disapprove. Like I couldn't care less, but some people do because like oh, he's not original. With the prices today, fuck no. Majority of games. I mean, I have a few uh, cartridges here and there, a few, few discs, but most part, I got into the hobby thanks to the advent of flashcards and ODs and stuff. Because uh, it's going insane. The, the prices are going nuts. It's, the whole thing is... And then WADA and VGA and all that shit. The sealed games. It's just becoming fucking ludicrous. Hateful even. All right. But for people who started earlier and they have the collection, what's going on here? The fuck was that about? Nah, it's still too low for me to be gambling on the way. Yeah, that was a good request, Chase. I enjoyed the game. It was, a, it was a Metal Gear Solid was a good game. I, I'm glad I played that. Now the next step is you get uh, Metal Gear, the actual Metal Gear on the um, on the MSX. I want to get an MSX from Japan. Get the flash card. That might be a while. That might be a while. I did look at a came up on eBay talking about discs. I needed a disc to test my PS2. That that ship has sailed. Though I tested the consoles working perfectly. I'm gonna drink some coke here. I was about to buy Metal Gear Solid, like the actual disc, but Japanese. But I looked it up, and uh, no, it's not playable because it's all Japanese. Uh, there's another edition of it because it's like Silent Hill has a lot of editions that does have uh, English subtitles. Uh, but uh, yeah, it was not the one on sale because it was like very cheap, like fifteen dollars. So today here, KBX, we're playing Game Boy Color. Essentially, this is a Game Boy, and anybody who's, you know, interested. I like how he opens here, like a cross section. So this year is, uh, we're playing uh, a hack, and the hack is just colorized. It's a, a monochrome Game Boy game that's been colorized by a talented person. Uh, when I put this on YouTube, I'll put the, uh, the uh, a link on the description. Okay, it's on Internet Internet Archive, so you can look that up. Just look up Warrior Land DX, and it'll come up already patched. Whether it's legal or not, I'll leave you and Nintendo to fight over it. So you can get the patch and just patch your game, whatever. Uh, just get it in there somehow. 
And we're playing on a Game Boy Player, which has Game Boy Advance, original hardware inside. It's pretty much a Game Boy Advance. And which is backwards compatible with a Game Boy Color and Game Boy. And we're using an EverDrive GPX7 running Game Boy Color. So essentially, this is now a Game Boy Color game. On the side, there's a Game Boy Color light by the garlic there. The, gar the reason for the garlic is Warrior likes garlic, as do I. The Game Boy Color is light is modded with a band van. I will be showing that at the end of the playthrough when I show the hardware. And the Game Boy DMG is also modded with a back lid screen. And KBX Master says, oh wait, this is OG Warrior Land? It is. It's a colorized hack of the uh, OG Warrior Land. This is the original Warrior Land being played in full color, in Technicolor, my good sir. There you go. Warrior Land 3, that's correct. Twin Snakes on GameCube is like $70. And Jerome says, really? Supposedly no one likes this one. It's, it's gone nuts, Jerome. Everything's gone nuts. Very few games now are left undisturbed. I, uh, I'm very happy that I'm into ODs and fa flashcards. I should be quite frank, I don't have the space for a massive fucking game collection. As hard as it is already with the CRTs and, the, and everything else. Those Game Boys are gonna smell like garlic. Lovely. Even more, it's like if you ask me if I would like to smell like french fries, yes. I'll be a fool to say no to that. Uh, no, the smell's very faint. Uh, and if you're gonna smell like garlic, I don't know, side effect, the garlic stays. Uh, I don't think it's smelly though. I love the smell of garlic. Not after you eat, though, the smell yourself, like how you smell. I, f I always feel like uh, if I eat a lot of garlic, because I do have a bit of intolerance especially with raw, uh, you smell like sort of like an old man, like a stale old man, you know? Oh, but you are an old man. <laughs> All right, this is boss time. If they, sm if they smell like garlic, I'll know. I'll have a very, very extremely sensitive nose. And uh, so I'm... Let's... Whoa. You crazy bitch? <laughs> Fuck you! God, this pest! This is my most hated enemy here. This asshole. I would take... You're not gonna bully me out of the fucking heart, you bitch. Oh, can I jump on it? <laughs> All right, Shiro's here. Good evening, Shiro. Uh, Shiro, we're talking... I, Because you just arrived here, obviously. Uh, requested game. We're doing one per customer. Uh, I'll pause it real quick before. Try to go as quick as I can. So, for you to catch up here, uh, I'm taking requests. For one per subscriber for after the halloween tomorrow we're going to start with horror games i have picked the games if a game a request fits in with what i want to play here for halloween and up until halloween uh then it'll be marked obviously displayed so and we do after that we'll think about doing the channel points i think for now because i'm very tiny i have 15 16 subscribers whatever uh i can do one request eventually get you one request here it's not going to be like once a month because i think it said I think Mr. Leifert mentioned a month. Nothing to do with months is a thing that I'm deciding, deciding to do right now. So, Shiro, get your requests, whatever game uh, you want. And up, uh, right to refuse. So, no turn based RPGs, no long current gen games until I get that sweet SFW 900. No staple franchises, title skip. So, no Silent Hill, Resident Evil, Mortal Kombat, Castlevania, Mario. And games I have to buy, my need to wait, and, and no digital only that I need to buy. Those are the rules. So pick a game or think about it, and I'll write it down here. Just post. Once you do, uh, Shiro, put your uh, write a game on the chat. Ah, oh, you motherfucker. And I will save it as your pick. Yeah, and I'll get you it eventually. Mm. 
He's gonna think about it. Ah, you fucking... Mm. Damn it. Fucking turn at the last minute, piece of shit. The fuck? Oh. <laughs> but I noticed the little, uh, like, ra gradient. That the... Chase is gonna be a Wii game. I have a Wii, so if it's a Wii game, that's fine. Play Wii. I have a modded Wii. I have two Wiis. It's a ridiculous name for a console. What were they thinking of that? A terrible name. It might be... Is the Wii? And the Wii U takes the cake. And then I'll say Xbox with their ridiculous names. Series X, X, One X, what the fuck is going on here? I couldn't believe when I came up with the name Series X. Fuck, get off me! You fucking stick to you? Stick it up your ass! Pussy? Fuck was that? I think it's... <sighs> now this asshole here. <laughs> Past. No, I'm not gonna go down there. You crazy? What's the point? Just die. Can, can I do a dash? Yeah, there we go. That's enough. Ah, uh, the past again. Mm. How would I? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Come on, man. Oh, does it feel good? Works for me. The bunny thing. There we go. Ha! Okay, let's go up. On up. Hmm. Dragon? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. If they're giving me the dragon here, that must mean something. I saw the PS5 slam. Uh. Cool, I guess. I don't, I'm not giving up my fucking fat. I'm not going after it. You had bangers all for the week, to be honest. There's some. Every console has some good games here and there. I guess the Wii games I like wouldn't be a good choice. Very simple, Shiro. Give me the choice that you have. If you don't think, let me decide. Because then I, if you give me like something, I'll say, this is crap. I'm just going to be honest and tell you. I'm not doing it. But uh, be careful assuming because it might be things I might be into that you might not know. So if you have a game, don't pick the game that I you think I like. Pick the game that you like. And if it's very terrible for me personally, then I'll just tell you, sorry, but this is it's not happening. That's how we go down. So pick the games that you, you, you actually want to see me play. Uh, but if you're talking about length and stuff, tell me anyways. Just tell me the games uh, or game and I will uh, tell if it works or not. So pick a few and then if one doesn't work, then at least you have the other one if you want. That'll be a, a good way to go about it. Ha! Die, you passed. Okay. Let's get some coins here. Oh, what do we have here? Checkpoint? What the fuck? Just follow the thing. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I have to... What are you doing, Captain Pussy? Let me fucking move this shit. I think I gotta go in front of him. I wait to get in the PS5 because I hope for a better design. The same looks... One, two, one to the same, but on a diet. Yeah, I don't think it's that much slimmer. I guess lower power, more heat problems. Yeah, I want to know about the technical stuff. I did, I wasn't impressed with the slimness of it. And also, you know, I, I went... That going by a comparison on Reddit, I don't know if they did an official comparison. I didn't watch the whole video. As soon as it came up, I had to go. But I'm wondering how much slim that is. So this, I know, this is death because of this pattern here. Very clever. I should have paid attention to it more. What the fuck are you doing, bitch? I'm gonna check what's in here. Just move your ass. I mean, it's liable to have something here, right? The fuck? Hmm. Hope that bitch hasn't coming back here. No, he ain't. 
Sorry, we're gonna miss out on those treasures. There's a timer. Burn. Oh, you fucking throw me up. Throw you, bitch. Come on. Get out of here. Ho ho! Ho ho! Give me cash, bitch! I need the, the PVMs! <laughs> but yeah, the, with a separate hard drive and all that, it's a common the death of physical, very soon. But it's good they're still offering it. Uh, Gamble? No. Why would I gamble? I have enough coins now, I don't want to gamble. Yeah, the vertical sand is sold separately, yeah. Cough up that cash. One thing I really hate with the new ones, they're getting real fucking bold and lazy with it. It's uh, no optical toss link out. It's like, oh, the TVs already have it, so we're saving a couple of bucks. We are saving on you, we're not passing the savers on you. Come off of there, they're not. Although sometimes I do get it, they sell, sell consoles at a loss. It does happen. Stove Canyon. Ooh. Have a quick smoke here. I want to know, I didn't have time yesterday. Uh, but I, I want to know, what's the hardware difference? Yeah. Cause is it an upgrade? She so says small, but oh shit, there's an auto scroll. Let's go. No, I don't need a ship. Get out, bitch. Get out, bitch. Get out, bitch. Gotta move, bitch. What the fuck is this cockadoodle here? Yeah, well, I kind of bl blew there the first time. The thing didn't move. Let's try it again. Yeah, I'm not too excited about new anything. Uh, I still haven't played my, my PlayStation 5 yet because of the age verification. It's it's ass. And I kind of lost interest. So sitting there. For now. Maybe maybe things will change when the Silent Hill 2... Shit. Silent Hill 2 remake comes down, down the line, you know? Perhaps I'll be more inclined on putting up with the bullshit, but right now, what do I have? Mortal Kombat... Mortal Kombat 1? I haven't even dived deep into Mortal Kombat 11 yet, so... I don't know. Not really... Not really feeling a sense of urgency to play. Again, I did try. I wanted to play Astrobot, and I couldn't get my age verified, so... There we go. So, fuck it. <laughs> it sits there alongside the uh, the Sears X. Here I am playing the GameCube. Don't need to verify anything. Plug and play, bitch. Plug and play. Come on, dude. The thing is coming still, right? Is it? Let's not find out. Let's get out of here. There. Yeah, check this out. What? I get hurt? How? Don't know if I should go up there. No, let's fucking go in here. Oh, I lost a lot of coins. Let's go for a little game of chance here. Same specs down to ports, except 170 gigabyte bigger storage. One centimeter less. Just one centimeter? Four centimeters smaller in height, and four centimeter less depth, like 700 grams lighter. But who knows if it's underclocked. Yeah, they need to get more details on them. They didn't? Ah, fuck off! Should be more, uh, more details, huh? Not a bit. Oh, fuck this shit. It took my coins. I'm gonna play this crap again. Insane. I love this, this soundtrack here. Awesome. Fuck off. Oh, those are permanent? Ah, permanent bridges now. Moving up in the world. What 
or demon feller. Oh, yeah. Playing a trick on me here. <laughs> Give me all the fucking treasure, you bitch. Bridges here. More secrets this way. <laughs> well, but which way is the way to go? There's a door right here. I'm gonna go on the door. Sometimes a bit confusing here. A bit too. Oh, it is a checkpoint. Okay. Love that sound. For people in the U.S., one centimeter is one eighteenth of a hamburger. Same way Mercer Tower. <laughs> Your burgers are tiny here. Every The portions are very tiny here. They're ludicrously small. Terrific. Ah, nice try. And the McDonald's here like salt. I always have to bump up the salt. It's the first thing I notice. <laughs> yeah, I want to keep this shit. Oh! Very cool looking level here. No! Oh man. I know a bit of the tiny. It... No! 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 I know, uh, like on the small size, I don't like, I know centimeters. But anything bigger than I don't, I lose track. If you tell me one, I kinda have an idea what it is. Kinda. But I believe you have an idea of it. Burn for it. Fuck did I do? I fucked up. I, like this, you gotta just wait, man. It's not even that difficult here. Uh, there's another console too. Breaks my heart a little bit. I haven't invested or know much about it or have it anything related to it. Is the Virtual Boy? There's an awesome Warrior game in there. I did have a chance to buy the flash cart one time, but I, I don't know, I blew it. I, now I don't think it's available anymore. I talked to the guy even privately, the, the maker. <laughs> That's all I had to do it last time, just wait a tiny bit now. Go to hell. I don't know, I'm not, not feeling this land PS5. I, I, like, again, I barely even use I'm not buying a revision. Maybe in the future, I don't know. Not quite. I'm, here's a, something I'm excited about on the looks department. The, y'all seen the, uh, what's it called? The shells coming up? The official shells? I want the silver one. I'm a sucker for silver. I want the silver PS5 official uh, shell. And I hope they'll make a control. I think they're making controller shoe. I want silver. If I always have a choice for silver, that's what I'm going with. Second choice will be purple. I love silver, though. I'm like gold member, but silver member. Silver and chrome. That's my thing. Oh, if there was a chrome, oh my god. And there's a... It's... It's a... Uh, what? Fingerprint magnet. Hello. Not for me. Although he would also, the gloves also will leave marks. Because you do, do touch things with gloves, so they're not, you're not immune to that. One up, bitch. It does like duck pirates. Whoa. Thought that thing was gonna hit me. Die, comrade. I love the redness here in this level. Fuck off, trying to kill me here. <laughs> what? Ow. <laughs> Checkpoint? Yeah. Let's 
see here. Che is a black and red purple PS5. Is that like a carnival? How many, co <laughs> how many collars you want in there? Ah! Fuck off. I'm tired of you, little man. It's like fucking Mardi Gras P PS5. <laughs> the Mardi Gras PS5 here. Come on. Mm. Now, for me, I, I don't like too many collars. This is, oh, I can oh, come off it. For me, I just want uh, silver and black. Not a big fan of the white and black scheme, to be honest. I never was. I, I don't think the PS5 is uh, pretty looking. I think it's an ugly console. But again, I applaud that they tried something different. At least they're not a boring black box, a monolith. Which works, but lack of imagination there, you know? It's, I, I suppose it's functional. Of course, I'm talking about that, that Sears X. It's functional, though. It's a functional design. All black PS5, yuck. I don't like black consoles. I find them boring. Everybody likes black consoles. People go like, it's more professional. It's not, for me, my, my opinion. Uh, boring, you can barely see anything. I don't like black stuff. Don't like it. Don't like black TVs. I don't like black consoles, except for the Genesis. Uh, don't want a black Game Boy. Don't want a black GameCube. I don't want black anything. I find a black PS2 is the stock, is the one I think of, but I, I prefer the other. I don't even have a black PS2. Uh, people lose their shit over black. It's like 99% of people, they just want black everything. I don't get it. Uh, I don't get it. Not, not, not for me. I find it boring. So boring. Just blackness. Boring. Find it boring. Ah! Fuck. Black 360, I have it bo boring. Don't like it. Uh, I have a, I have a, uh, Jerome sent me a red one. It's like his black and red. Awesome. Uh, I have a silver one, I have a white one, the, the the initial one, I have the white one, and my Xbox was actually black. The Xbox that got me back in the game, and I still have it, and it's the one with all my digital purchases I had from back in the day. Uh, and this is probably what I have to use here if I want to play those. It's all black, I don't like it. I, I, it doesn't work for me, I find it boring. Lack of imagination, I, I don't like, I don't find, I don't find that black things are more professional. People say that, like, I, like my cousin that came here, he bought the, he bought the Switch and he bought it all black, which was the Rage. Oh, all black. Find a black joy. I don't... For me, it's like... It's so boring. You know, I like color. And granted, it's kind of weird. I say I like color, but I like silver. Silver shiny. You know, si shiny silver. I don't like gray. Gray consoles. Not not a big fan. Like gunmetal, that kind of shit. So, silver, like satin silver. You know? Black, I, it, it would be my last, my, my last option. Like... To an extent, if there's a white and black PS5 and just a black, I'll still pick the white and black. I find just all black things should be just mind numbing to me. Oh man, come on! What the fuck? How the fuck did I? Oh, fuck off! Silver is my favorite. I have a silver PS2, but I want to get a true NTSC one. I have a. I, I really want to get a silver PS1 case, and I'm running out of time as they're running out of stock. I want to get a, a silver shell. Um, it's not every con. There, there's one console that I, I did mention that for me, black. It's it just works. Uh, that'll be the uh, the Genesis. Uh, it, it just works well, you know. Is the one console that mm, fucking threatened me here. Just for me, is the one console I think it's... I can't see in any other color. Well, I have seen it. It looked weird. Just mindfuckery. There we go. I'm tired of black things. I, I, I'm i gonna go on and say I hate black things. You know TVs? You go in the back, you can't see shit. I always have to have a flashlight. I am actually, I get actually complain a lot about black stuff. Just everything black. Can't see shit, man. Just enough of the fucking black. I saw white. And another thing I like about the PS5, maybe white appliances are making a comeback. They were big in the, what, late 90s? 
There was a time there was a time for silver. Everything was silver. A lot of silver Trinitrons, which are still my favorite. I miss the silver. I wish the silver appliances would make a comeback. I'm tired of black this, black that, black everything. Silver with purple eyes. That sounds like a good combination. I'm a bit of a, an asshole. I probably would get thrown off by having a purple eyes. If I had a purple, purple light, a silver kind of white light, just kind of boring, so probably just stock. I'm getting the silver shell. That that much is certain. Nah, I don't have coins to gamble here. White is good. I like white. Not my favorite, not on top priority for me, but definitely for me way better than just black. Like I have, the, I had a wee black and a wee white. The wee blue you saw here with the shell swap is black. And the white, I'm so fine with that. I haven't, I bought a clear shell, but I haven't done the swap yet because it looks fine white. And I do like to have a stock one. The M cube is the perfect specimen for me because I know there's more, more colors, but I have a silver and I have a purple, indigo, whatever you want to call it, is my two colors. Cause some people say, well, silver is not a color, right? Okay, well, then purple then. Wood stuff, yeah, it's beautiful. Yep, I love the Atari 2600 because it has the wood in there. A wood grain PS5. I wonder how that look. I think I've seen it somewhere. I do love wood grain. Uh, duh, you know, look around you. <laughs> I love it. I love wood grain everything. I've seen some consoles. It was a Switch. They made a wood grain for it. That's pretty cool, too. I like wood grain. Here's something that I looked into that I would love to have. I don't usually like, like a lot of decorations, but the GameCube as the lament configuration from Hellraiser, but well done. Not a fucking shitty ass dick out, like really well done. I got a half of mine to try it someday, try my hand at it. Getting a GameCube, a black one would be the, a, a good base for it. And print, 3D print, polish, make it gold, all the decorations and make it look just like the lament configuration. I think, I think that would be very cool. Okay, I'll click on this here. There's a link about, what is, what is that link about? Let's see here, is that the wood grain? That looks boss. I like it. You know what I'll probably do? I'll probably not do the middle. I'll leave the middle black for more contrast. Too woodsy. So I'll leave the black. I would not use the middle strip and everything else, yes. That's how I would handle this. Cannot be shipped to my select location. I'll look for somebody who can then. I've seen them around. I think, uh, and you have different types of wood grain. You have light, you have. Oh, a card stage. Look at this shit. I think the. I usually prefer. What the motherfuck? I lost my train. Look at what you've done. The fucking little demon guy. Wood is too dark for me. I think for the PS5 it might work. But yeah, it is a bit on the dark side. It can be. I don't. I. Because there's many different woods for different applications. Like, I like, I like light wood like this, but you can see on the walls, I went with a darker one for the contrast, right? More of a rough looking thing. I don't know. I look at that one, it, it looks good. And by the way, because we're talking about the garlic, no garlic is touching my, my Game Boy colors. My, my, my Game Boy color or DMG. It's, it's around it, but it's not touching it. Because I actually was freaking out if it was actually touching it. So I gotta stay on this cart here. That's what needs to happen. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Get off my fucking cart. I fucking got greedy! <laughs> Gravity is a bitch. If it was your table color, it would be better. I think I've seen one. That, I think there's more of them, Chase. I think I, I'm pretty sure I saw one that was light in color. The one I, I saw. Somebody did. Yeah, wood grain is pretty sweet. 
I don't know how well it would work here, though, because there's already wood grain here, wood grain there, and then it'll be more wood grain. I gotta think about that one. My wife said I died many times on the stage. I remember because I beat this one for you, I believe. Uh, this is the one stage I remember playing for you. So let's take it seriously here. I, I could be misremembering, but I, I remember something cards unless there's another one. I just gotta stop being a Gavon here. Yeah, just stay more in advance. There we go. Don't get greedy with the fucking coins like this. Just, there you go. Still grab most of nah. them. Mm. Yeah, they get you there. They are crafty. They are crafty. Just focus a tiny bit. Jump in advance. Fuck is this shit? Yeah, but... Oh, checkpoint now. Yeah. Is it? Is this the way? I oh, know it's a checkpoint. It reminds me of, uh, even though this game obviously is a lot older, it reminds me of uh, Shovel Knight with a checkpoint. A little bald thing. Ah, the bonanza up there. Damn it! Give it to me! <laughs> Fucking missed out. Big time. <laughs> Get your bitch ass out of here. Alright, go, 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 and don't... Arrgh. Ah, fucking mustache. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, you little fuckers. Yeah, whatever. I remember they had a wood grain Xbox. You know what they had? You know, there was one thing that for consoles for me that I like the most: translucent colors. Now, I'm sucking for. I need to get. I need to get the GameCube fucking purple translucent. My God, do I need to stop fucking around and have more fucking cash here so I can buy that one? I'm desperate. I need to get the purple fucking one. I've been fucking around for months, and that shit is going out of stock. And I I need to quit fucking around. I need the purple translucent purple GameCube shout that they have now i need that shit and i need to get for the uh, translucent colors for me is my favorite fucking thing ever shira says official what the wood grain unlikely that sounds like fun and they, i'm surprised they're even doing the other ones and look at how long it took them fuck official if he's good enough uh if he looks is well made i go uh, unofficial all the time Sometimes you're waiting a fisher, you're gonna be waiting forever because it never fucking happened. Uh, and talking about Xbox 360, I remember seeing that, yeah. And there's a there was an Xbox 360 clear shell, which then I could you could potentially make a translucent color with there's translucent paints from Tamiya. Uh, that'll be fucking awesome. I knew I should have brought the fleece jacket. It's fucking cold here now. I'm actually fucking freezing here. I'll beat this boss. I'm gonna get go go take a leak and uh, get my fleece jacket. Then six four six to four had the best translucent collars, and now they're making it. There's third party awesome translucent shells of all colors you can think of, just like the fantastic collars. Yeah, that that's awesome when they had it. See, in the head, it was a pretty, it was plentiful back then, right? Dreamcast had a few, I believe. Ah, fuck off, will ya? You know, there's one thing about this game. When you get hit, it kind of, it's weird. It kind of throws you around and jerks you around and shit. The one I found and made look better. Because, yeah, it would be newer, too. If you're talking about dancing, they're new. They're good quality. <laughs> so, definitely. I'll be, getting, I'll be getting the purple one for sure, if they have it. The grape one. I always want to have a grape one and have the little uh, Ultra 64 label. Make a real... Oh, you fuck. Make a real unique one. I have the green one, the jungle green one. And uh, a lot of people go like, I don't like it, I prefer the stock. Fuck off! 
And I like uh, I like the stock. That's why I buy I buy a second one. I don't have to just have one fucking console. So if the prices are good, I can get inside. I get a second one to do a mods on. You know. Like I love fucking fucking fuck. The hell, man! Ah, Jesus Christ! I'm a hustle here, my broster. Yeah, yeah. How the fuck did I? Which one was the one that I fell here? What, what, what is this bullshit here? Why? Why did I fall last time? What happened? Was it this one? Ah, fuck off! What is this? What happened here? Oh, it's game over. Ah, right, there's a save there. Mr. Leifer says Shiro Banner should get the old one now before it's forever because it's the better one. What is the better one? The N64 shells? Is that what you're talking about? Old PS5? go away. They, they have a lot of supply. No, I don't think the PS5 has risk of about the, the PS5 going away. Ivanovich, thank you very much for uh, following and first time chat. Hi there. Nice to meet you. I hope I pronounced it correctly. Ivanovich or Ivanovich? Well, either way, uh, happy to have you here. And the chat is nice, they're waving for you here. Then we'll make them anymore now. Nah, I think there'll be plenty of them, dude. I don't think you're gonna risk of losing, missing out on a PS5. They, they're making a shit ton of them. They're gonna be around, there's a lot, there's a lot of them made. You can go right now and get a PS1. I mean, a PS5, I, I don't think it'd be disappearing in a time soon. Uh, from new, yeah, if it's new, yeah. Two, Ivanovich. Okay, no problem. If I forget here and there, uh, just remind me. The V sound. Nice having you here. We're playing some uh, some Game Boy Color today. This is a colorized Game Boy original Game Boy game. It was monochrome, black and white, green and green, silver and silver. If you play on the on the Game Boy ah, on the Game Boy Pocket. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Fuck off with those fucking fireballs, man. Fucking massive hitbox. And I don't understand the last jump there. It's kind of getting me a tiny bit. It's uh, bumming me out a tiny bit if you. It's a bit of a weird ass jump, man. Fuck was that sound outside? Oh, did I just did I make past the jump without even? This is a checkpoint, isn't it? I mean, why buy a used one for not even really that much cheaper? I didn't say buy a used one, but uh, yeah, but uh, over time they're not going to be that price anymore. They'll be cheap. There'll be a time. You want to know the time to buy the fucking console is is now. If you want to buy new or used, it doesn't fucking matter. But especially used. As soon as they release the PS Slim, PS5 Slim, there'll be a gazillion people want to buy a PS5 Slim. That's just the way people want the last fucking thing. That's the time that you see the prices on, on used going down. If they don't, that'll be the first fucking time in history. I waited to get my PS4 Pro win. It was very expensive. Not, not when I paid. I waited for the PS5 to launch and everybody go crazy selling everything they have, including their PS4 Pros, because they won the PS5. And that's when I can come in and I bought it for next to nothing. And then later on, the price actually went back up. So, 
It's not even marketed as a slime. Slim is a funny part. It's not... Oh, well, it's marketed as what then? We all know it's a slim. They always done that. It's like, since the beginning. It don't matter what they call it. Ah, uh, fuck, I'm dead. Damn it! Oh, I didn't beat that. Okay, so I get it. I, I'm sent. No, I don't get it. Just PS5. Oh, that's dumb. Then the fans come in. It's like, uh, it's like Mortal Kombat 9. It's not called Mortal Kombat 9. It's called Mortal Kombat. But we are with the fans name in Mortal Kombat 9 to avoid bullshit. Nobody calls it Mortal Kombat 2011. I don't call Mortal Kombat 1, Mortal Kombat 1, come off it. I call it Mortal Kombat 12, and I always will. So if they don't name it, we'll name it. It's a motherfucking slim. Like, oh, fuck off. Like, why the fuck would you call it a PS5? Like, how, will you, how would you make a distinction between both? You have to say the slimmer model, so you might as well call it slim. Everybody's gonna call it the slim. They can market it. The names of consoles are fucked, but... I'll say, mm, I'll say Xbox. Xbox is the worst, in my opinion, with their names. It's horrible. They're horrible names. Completely un unmemorable. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> ah, fuck, you're not quick enough, huh? Yeah, there you go. Forza Motorsport 8 is just Forza. I hate when they do that. <laughs> fucking, but stick with the fucking numbers, you know? You made a thing and then called the first thing. It doesn't make any sense. It's like uh, First Blood, then Rambo 2, even though there was no Rambo 1, and then Johnny Rambo. Is, then the fuck is going on here? It's like Ghostbusters 2016. How dare you call yourself just Ghostbusters? Go to hell. How fucking dare you, man, with that garbage, that, uh, that cinematographic abortion of a movie. Call itself just Ghostbusters. Where do you have the fucking balls to fucking dare to call yourself just Ghostbusters, you pieces of shit? Hateful. Fucking hateful. Call it... Put a, or, or, you, don't, you don't have to do the numbers all the time. You can, fuck. You can do... Uh, I, I don't know. With the Ghostbusters, what do you call it? Ghostbusters Garbage Edition. I don't know, some name. Put a, a slogan next to it or something. That one I would say, uh, Ghostbusters, if you don't like this movie, you're sexist. That's what that should be, that, that movie, right? But it's still garbage, but you gotta pretend you like it. Guys, pretend you love it, no matter how much it stinks. What the fuck am I looking at here? What is this? This is how I see Boraicho. So the tongue? I know the tongue is... This guy's out here throwing snot rockets. Okay. <laughs> Do I grab the ball and throw at him? Ah. Ugh, suck on this, motherfucker. Get out of here. Oh! Xbox has the worst name. But the worst name of a console that I could ever think of is Wii U. That has but There's no way, even the Xbox. There's no way you can deliberately come up with a, a name that is worse than Wii U. It's already a bad name, and they expanded upon it. Within one generation, to call it the Wii U. What were they thinking there? I love to be a fly on the wall when they came up with a name. Wii U. <sighs> Man, it's fucking rough. That is rough. That's a rough name. That's a rough fucking name for a console. It's like they wanted it to fail. Starting with the. No! Damn it, you were. Ah! This is bullshit. It fucking throws you back. Get out of here. Wii U, Wii U, yes. <laughs> the ambulance. Wii U is a very bad name. It's repulsive. It's a repulsive name. I, keep, I feel sorry for the console being named that. Like, I feel pity on it. To, to have such a name. Huh. 
PlayStation has it. PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, 3, 4, 5. As long as they don't fuck with it. Awesome. Just PlayStation numbers. Done. Fucking X. Uh, okay, just wait it. There we go. Now we're talking here, Turkey. Well, on the console names, one thing I, I, I like. Uh, the, the, fuck. The, um, Atari 2600 in Japan, it was released there, and they call it the Atari... Ah! It's, this game's got knockback, it's fucking weird. Doesn't feel like a game that would have knockback, but it does. Come on, dude. So they, they re-released the Atari... What the f... What the fuck was that? The Atari 2600 in Japan is the Atari 2800. So, I wonder what the reason was. Atari... Give me the ball. Motherfucker. Yeah, there really is the Atari is the 2800 out there. I want to get one. God, this guy is kind of disgusting. Good that... Horrible, horrible look. Come on, do the snap thing. You gotta grab his fucking snap rocket. Come on, dude, stop with the tongue shit. Oh my, he's breaking the stage now. I need to do something here I'm not aware of. Give me the snap rocket. Ah! That's it, I'm done. Oh! Bitch ass motherfucker. Oh fuck! I'm gonna I'm losing a lot of opportunities here. Come on. It's not rocket, bitch. Stop with the tongue shit. Oh! There's gotta be a winning bouncer. There was no way I could get that though. But one, if you get the one X, we and we use terrible in the Xbox Series S or X. Every time I say the names, uh, at least the Wii is like, okay, it's a horrible name, but we we you and Xbox like Xbox One, they already fucked up with the Xbox One. And you know what's annoying? You go look for a regional Xbox. You got to put a region. You can't do like PlayStation One, PS One, PSX. You can't do that. Xbox One would be the new console. It's, it's done. Whoever's in charge of the names of naming the xbox uh see i remember the guy explaining when the when they're just announcing that series x and there was a guy doing a tear down and he's like he's one of those guys that talks with the eye closed very condescending like what, what happened there what is this what what was that shit what the fuck was that crap what was that bunch of bullshit hmm Excuse me? I went through the platform or something? Xbox One is, is always confusing when I say the names. You always gotta... I feel like I always, at least me personally, I always have to think before saying the names of the consoles. Of the Xbox consoles. Oh, there we go. Uh, you're very annoying, mister. Okay, we'll play later. I need to, I need to get going here. Mm, you fucking son of a bitch, you. No, no, I want you to burn. There you go. Is there a fireball here? Oh. Oh. Burn alive. There we go. Get just... Alright, this... This asshole again. Alright, good shit, good shit. Starting... Starting on the wind inside. Come on. Ah, fuck off! I hate fucking weapon and going in on an arch. Stupid ass motherfucker. Give me this. Ah, now he goes straight. What the fuck? The guy went nuts. 
The guy went nuts. Oh! <sighs> I had a fucking gazillion balls here. Fuck, wh why are you doing this shit now? There we go. Oh! Come on, that one should count. Yeah, let's do a game of chance, shall we? You're cheating, piece of shit. You're cheating now. Nothing but cheating. Oh my god, no. Fuck off. No fucking way. Him is really for the weird ass. What's a weird fucking boss, right? Fucking. Okay, where are we headed now? Oh, SS teacup. I'm gonna go take a leak. And I'll be right back. And, uh, oh, get a fleece jacket. not to mute the game this time. Okay, I'll be back in uh, two or three minutes.
Barfac. Thanks for following me. I'm back here. I'm just gonna. My stomach kind of hurts. I'm just gonna eat some uh, good old lamb and ams here. Brownie. My wife bought it. Good stuff. And uh, thanks for following Barfac. I'll be back in uh, a couple of minutes. I'm just sitting here eating lamb and ams. All right, just about done with my M&Ms here. Mm. It's a good game. Fun little game. Let's finish my chewing here. Of course, I put the microphone on mute. Nobody wants you to hear me munching on fucking M&Ms here. They're crunchy, make a lot of noise. I'm just getting my tobacco stuff here ready so I can go back to the game. That can be the last world already, is it? I mean, the ship is here. Because I remember the ship from the intro of the game. Hmm. All right. Hmm, M&M's brownish. Brownie flavor. Very good. Not a big fan of the peanuts. Yeah, I'll eat them. If I want peanuts, I eat peanuts. I when I eat M&M's, I, I want M&M's. I don't want peanut stuff. All right. When I look at garlic here on the side of the screen, it makes me want to eat, like, food, you know? Everything I cook has garlic. <laughs> Nearly everything. Heavily. Heavy on the garlic. So I'll get along with Wari on that one. Okay, put my headphones and let's, uh, headphones are in, let's head on back. I'll take the brake shit off. There we go. Let's go, let's head on back to the game here. SSD cup. All right. It's like a, like a jungle thing. Guess we're at the shore right now. So these fellas are not, you know, when I look at them, those little bird things, it looks like it's something you could get on top and they get kind of heavy. 
But Jerome, I think Jerome is gone by now. There we go. He gives you coins. All right, cool. He does. He was correct. Nope, you're not doing this shit. Oh, they come back. Wait for it to go to sleep. There we go. Pop those out. And you could just spam coins here if you wanted. Farm them. Ooh, man. There's the garlic. Outstanding. Oh, I missed. Oh, another game I want to play, but not, not after ha Halloween. It's uh, Mario Kart 64. I love that game. I grew up with that game. It is my favorite Mario Kart. More than the original. Yes. I just, uh, although, you know, again, hate comparing games here, but yeah, probably think of it as just for a reason. The, <laughs> this motherfucker, he's, he's on the original. Uh, Super Mario land well chew kind of flies away see if we can ah he's gone now. <laughs> that's pretty cool oh oh so you can get your stand stand on top of them now i know this here is a bottomless pit so if you fall here you're dead whenever you have that pattern there we go I want to get him before it flies away. <laughs> it's very weird, anyway. On the first one, well, second one, I say first one because the one I grew up with, uh, Super Mario Land 2. And by God, it's getting cold here. I'm kind of shaking a bit. It got very cold in this motherfucking shed. If I want to continue doing this channel, and with the temp temperatures dropping here, I'm going to have to seriously consider weatherproofing this year, insulating, and making a partition here so I can have the heater on because it's getting kind of brutal here now with the with the cold at least the mice seem to be gone I killed the whole family looks like it oh and they were getting to wouldn't you know hardware so my wife found a box that was completely fucked so they, they were chewing it and inside it, there was Xbox stuff. What do you want, freak? It's just... No, that's the same power I already have. Oh. Ah, you fuck. Well, I'll go back, man, and get the... Oh, my God. Who's this motherfucker here now? Get out of here, you murderer. Get this thing. There we go. It's when he has his weapon out, you gotta be careful. Ow! Fucking piece of shit, he shoots you. I didn't fucking know. Burn him. Oh, it's cold here, man. I should have grabbed two jackets. <laughs> Die. I'll say that again. I'm not no, I think I prefer the fire thing here. It looks a bit more useful. There we go. Sometimes the animals get killed, but no rhyme or reason. Ah, I fucked up. What took me by surprise that this game have a knockback? It is, and sometimes it can really mess you up. Oh, so they want. I know what they want you to do here. I don't know if I risk coming back here. Let's see. I mean, they gave me a power-up in the beginning, right? Just gotta watch out the time here, because it's very clever. 
I want to kind of show this. I get what they're what they're driving at here. Oh, damn it. It's gone. Can I go back and get the power up? How much time we'll have? No, fuck that noise. Let's go. Fuck. Okay, I guess I'll just verbally explain what it is that they're driving at there, if you're not a, a genius yet. Come on. Okay, let's... No, no. See, that's the, the thing. You're jumping there quickly and they, they kill you. So here, when you have the bull helmet thing with the horns, you just hold on to this here and that thing is going to drive it to the uh, coins. And we got a new follower here. Son of PR? Son of, Son of PR. Sometimes I'm a bit down with the names. Terrible. Son of PR 24. Thanks for following. And my regards to PR 24. <laughs> His Farger, Dr. Evil. That thing is so weird. I wonder if they I wonder if they put it in as a nod. You notice it's also oh whoa whoa whoa. Uh, it's also black and white. Look. But again, oh again, this game isn't black and white, the reason is to be Gavon. So if you're watching this here and you caught in the middle here, this is a... Ooh, I wonder if we can... Yeah, they're fucking invincible here. This is a colorization hack of the original Wario Land, aka Super Mario Land 3. Granted, this part is not very colorful here. It's not perfect, but it's, it's, it's damn good. I, I couldn't do better. I wish I could. There's a lot of games on a Game Boy that I would like have colorized, you know? That would be fucking awesome. My stomach is growling here a little bit of hunger. I did eat the M&Ms. No oh, I got one. But this is not, I don't think it's a very long game, so I don't think it's worth taking like a full supper break, you know what I mean? Barn. Yeah, coin. Let's go. I ain't betting no motherfucking coins. You took all of them last time. SST cup. Is it the, the last world? I saw that's too bad. We'll play a little bit more. Very cool game. I like Wario as a character. Leave that there. Ah, you fuck. I don't get those fucking birds, man. I think you have to wait for it to die first and then jump on top of it. Burn. Burn everything. Burn all, all those who disagree with me. There we go, yeah. Waited for you to die first. Took me the whole fucking game to figure this out. Wait for you to die first. Let's try it out. Take that. Oh, checkpoint most likely. Did something. Do I die jumping in there? Kind of hard, kind of, it kind of phoned it in on this bit here with the, with the collars, you know? Because this is a kind of a shade of brown. I don't know, man. <laughs> Fatality. Warrior wins. Mmm, the pit. Yeah, that's a lot of, uh, coins here, my friend. Boom. Okay, I'll risk it. Yeah, it's fine. It's just water. Oh, this is good. I love this power-up, because it's essentially flying. But it can only do once, like, if you... You can do, like, a little bit, and then... Oh, you can. Oh, if you hit something, that's when you can't do nothing. Look. 
Oh, it does have its limit limitations here. If you turn around, can you do it again? Yeah. Okay. But if you hit here, yeah, if you hit something, then it's over. Birds look like Pokemon. We got this here truck full of the Pokemon cards. <laughs> you know what? I know nothing of Pokemon. Pokemon. Now I got I got me saying Pokemon. <laughs> I did watch the, the cartoon back in the day. Hmm, which way would be that? I guess this is a special door. Maybe this here is a checkpoint, right? Yeah, it is. Boom. I know Pikachu. What's the other one? Charmander? Char Charizard? There's a Charmander as well, right? Charmander? Mewtwo? I know Jigglypuff because of the Smash Brothers. I know there was a racist one one time. Right? I think they probably changed it. To the black one. Right? With the lips. Uh... I know, uh... Hmm, not a lot. I know the turtle... Squish, squash or something. This one, there's a turtle. It's a water one, or... I think that's about all I know of Pokemon. <laughs> Games are pretty much uh, RPGs. That's why I'm not into. I'm not into RPGs, turn-based stuff. Cause that's that's essentially what it is, right? I mean, mm. wow, what the fuck? <laughs> no, I prefer the power of flight. Unless this is a boss and this will kind of help. Well, if it die, we'll come back and get the other power. Yeah, I remember the racist Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon, it was a thing back in the day. I was like, wow. <laughs> they went there, huh? <laughs> I don't remember the name, though. But I'm sure they change it by now. Oh, there's no boss on that one. Okay. Fake tits. Yeah, what the fuck with the tits? I remember that. <laughs> no! Shit. Could have kept the flying power here. No. Nope. Yeah, duh. <laughs> I think I remember the brother and the sister, right? There was one that he was a bit ambiguous. The, talking about the... Uh, the cartoon, you know, from back in the day. <laughs> now, Detective Pikachu, like, what, what, what is that? He has, like, a very deep voice. Hmm. I, I get it, gotta make a movie more than him saying Pika Pikachu or something, yeah, but... I didn't, I saw, because I saw a trailer came up, and I, I wasn't expecting the voice. Of Pikachu to be that deep. Yeah, get this power. They're giving it to you. Yeah, Pokemon will never happen here. Just so you know. Ah! Fucking waited here. I'm not into the game. Z the franchise in general is just not for me. It's not like a hater or anything. Does it matter? What if I hated po Pokemon? How would that affect your enjoyment of the game? Think about it, yeah? Some people are like that. You can't hate a game. What, what do you mean? There's games I hate. Supposed to like and respect everything. No, that's not how it works. There's some games I don't like or respect. I don't respect Dark Castle. It's a terrible, horrible, disgusting game. I never want to play that. Maybe as a goof someday. Ah, fuck! Why'd that come back? Because this place looks weird. It's like something... Something more... Ah, oh, fuck. Like something more should be here. And just that power-up. The detective Pikachu. I think they just wanted to use Pikachu and they had to come up with some kind of idea. Because Shay's here says it's kind of cringe. I think maybe it's... Uh, maybe it's a reactor to kids, right? I, I don't know. I'm not... As for me, because I know one thing, Mario being directed for kids? Yeah, maybe, but come off it. Like, we, we grew up with it. We're adults now. Of course, I, 
Fuck! Of course, I watched the uh, the Mario fucking movie. I watched it with my my daughter, my wife, and my kid, my all my kids, and it was fucking awesome. I thought it was a great movie. The Detective Pikachu. That's a, a something that my kids will have to do solo. I'm not. I don't think I'll be. I'll be watching that even with them. I love pleasing the kids. The kids here, my kids and my kids. You know, and then. Uh, <laughs> But there's a limit. There's a limit. You know, they have their own time and their own things that they do. And Detective Pikachu would be one of those things. <laughs> the old movie is way better, of course, being sarcastic. I used to say uh, sometimes people ask, what's the greatest movie ever made, Mr. Liffer? And I always answer with a straight face. I say uh, the 90s. Now I have to say 90s, but the Mario Bros. movie. <laughs> the greatest movie ever made. I hated it then. Uh, I don't. Now it's kind of like so bad is good. I want to watch it with my kids. They probably will be very annoyed with it. Especially you now after watching the new one, which is so great. Yeah, the bar has been raised very high now for for the movies. I would say. Yeah, uh, <laughs> the old one is pretty rough, and it was back then. I thought it was Luigi doesn't have a mustache. Is John Leguizamo? Uh, I don't know, dude. I, I want to keep the this one here. Oh, and I can run real quick. So bad is good. I, I agree. Get the fuck out of here. I agree. It is so bad. It's very bad. It is very bad. You know that they were that they were they were zoom fighting. They were drunk most of the time. The actors. I read a you know a backstory about that. This is amazing, isn't it? It is. I think. Die, you fuck. I don't. It's amazing here. Amazing. Only terrible. I hate maze levels, of course. I had to have a maze here. At least there's no escort mission, unless, you know. That's what I said uh, when I was playing Castlevania 64. It's sort of an escort mission with a kid. It's sort of. Although, when I played here on the channel, I followed the kid, I think, very closely, and it didn't feel like it. Yeah, that's one crazy ass movie that Mario. <laughs> the 9 is one. I don't know. It could have gone gone with an animated movie sort of thing. Satson is misunderstood. Well, on, on what? <laughs> it's, it, it's misunderstood as in like, what the fuck is going on here? I don't understand what's happening. Is this even Mario? If you're saying like that, then it, yes, it is grossly misunderstood. Uh, in the nineties, I didn't understand what the fuck was going on when I watched that. I was very young. I I did not like it. The tiny Goombas. What the fuck was going on? What, what was all that shit? I was like, back then, I was like, what the fuck did I just watch kind of thing. I was hyped for it because I was a big Mario fan. And then when the movie came out, I was like, what What did I just watch kind of sort of ordeal? It's just I came from here, didn't I? I was amazed, so fuck me. Goombas don't look like in the movie. Yeah, it's fucking horrible though. Oh, just going back. Fucking mazes! Mazes are never fun for me. I never play a maze anything and thought, wow, this is great. This is, I'm having a good time. I'm usually bored out of my mind and I want, I want it to end. Immediately. Like, as soon as I, I realize something is a maze, I wanted to stop. So I gotta look for a key here somewhere. Oh. What's so funny, bitch ass? <laughs> Die, you fuck. And I'll leave it here. I wonder, does it stay here? Um, let's put the mammary to task here. It does. All right. They got a leak. Shira, I made a game for a school project. Playing stuff, didn't even have half of it done until really late in a given time. What, just now? No, you don't go to school anymore. 
<clears throat> when English translation, Mike plays it. No way to stretch a game and mazes. My way to stretch a game. That's what it is. It's padding. It's called padding. You're padding your game. You stretch the game. That's right. It is. That's correct. A lot of stuff in game is padding. I can smell it from a mile away. It's padding. Is that, I'm not sure if it's a case here, but either way is unpleasant to me. It's boring. Look, this is boring compared to the levels like, oh, ski, oh, you got to beat this here. You got to jump over this. It's just going around like a, like an idiot. I hate it. I can't stand mazes. They're the bane of my fucking existence. I can't, I can't fucking stand a single moment of it. Every game that was a maze, I hated it. Look how dumb this is. We gotta... I thought you went through that according to the fucking sound effect! Mm. I'm tiny. We got no shit, it's a fucking maze. You ran out of time. That's the other thing. Mazes with timers. Fuck me sideways, man. Motherfucker. Okay, maybe it's... Get out of here, dude. I'm gonna run out of time, you fucking little shits. What? No, I don't need the shit. I need to get out of here, man. Oh my god, I'm dead. Fucking ducks. Yeah, even if I get you the boss here, right? Is there a boss? I'm gonna die because there's not enough time. There's more maze, maze stuff here. At least I got a checkpoint. Get in. Oh my god, no. Get the f Oh my god. The worst shit ever. <laughs> Quick. There we go, we made it. God of War. Has many parts where you crawl through narrow walls, but in this case, actually good design. Yeah, that's fine. I've seen God of War. My wife played. I haven't played God of War. It will happen here, though. That obviously is a gigantic franchise. Uh, I haven't played it myself. I saw my wife playing it, though. I've seen the narrow stuff. Uh, zero loading, good design. This is actual good. Oh, it's like loading. A high load. Very clever. I like when they do that. I don't have a problem with that. For me, it's just mazes. You're bored and you're walking around and don't know where to go. That's, for me, is the worst situation in gaming. When I finally redo the game, but maybe it's turn-based fighting, so I'll learn RPG Maker, more converted to different engine, because I don't like the base turn. It's very interesting. You learn a lot by making games. That's got to be fun. The Greek God of War games are so damn good. I played them first time last year. Why do you say the Greek God of War? Is there a God of War that is not Greek? Just curious about that, why you, you failed to need a bit of Greek before. Is there... Why is a Greek God of War? Is there a... A Mississippian God of War? <laughs> Just breaking your balls, but kind of curious why you put Greek. The new ones are Nordic. What, he changed his nationality? You mean the ones that, like, the games are? Because he's still Greek, right? He's a Greek man. So, but yeah, I did see the footage of the new ones. So I, I get what you mean, man. Yeah. So all the, uh, the lore is Nordic. I get it. No, I got it. I got the gist of it. <coughs> he's still Greek, yes. Thought so maybe apply for Scandinavian citizenship or something. Okay. Yeah, no, I did get the Nordic out of it. Uh, I tell one thing, uh, as a guy who never played any of them, uh, seen it being played, I am aware of it, I know what goes on, I know the influence, all that. It's not unknown to me, right? I just haven't sit down and played it myself. Uh... Yeah, uh... The new one, what's going on with the, like... 
there's no blood. It's like, I, I found it ugly. They, they, they explode and it's like the Nordic ones, as y'all see. I, I remember me and my, my wife watched it. She didn't like it. And then I noticed it was like uh, some kind of like gold color. I don't know. I like the blood. Keep it blood. Keep the fucking blood on. First ones, they, I've seen it. They have blood. It's very bloody. And the new one is like, hmm. Didn't like the looks. I like the the one I did see the fight of uh, a relatively small man when compared to him, and he's like nearly indestructible. That looked pretty cool. I look forward to playing those games. My first try at making a game was back in nine class, so 19 years ago. Long time. I was never too late to get back into it, and there you are. No more mazes here. Enough with the maze bullshit. Give me a difficult level. Die, you piece of shit. As long as the maze is... Mm. I can't do nothing with that. Let's check the door here, then. Oh, is this Gavon here? You fuck! You fucking fuck! Get in here! Fucking! Damn you! Son of a bitch! Shut the fuck up for that! <laughs> it's so weird sometimes, isn't it? Oh. Fuck. Come on, dude. Fucking hit. Mm. Fuck was that beep? Oh, yeah. No, no, you're dying. There we go. Yeah, I got some coins here. Mm. Mm. There we go. No, we already have that, so keep that quiet. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a key thing in here. Yeah, so this game does have replayability with the keys, yeah? The key mechanic thing. I'm just trying to go as far as I can this way. Okay, there's a spider up there. Say, watch a video recently how well they did the first new God of War because much of Kratos does and shit. It only does because it's fast. I really thought about it. I didn't know this first time play because I never knew the original games before. I knew the original one, so the new one was still new to me. Even though I haven't played, I saw people playing and I was deeply aware of them. I didn't notice it was quite different. The blood thing was the first thing I noticed. Oh! Don't mind if I do. Damn you. So this one. <laughs> yeah, new games are different, you know, that's for sure. Things have changed. Oh man, I guess I have to get it now because it's on the fucking way, isn't it? I hate when they do shit like this. Put the fucking weapon on the way. Can't avoid it. Fuck. Oh, it's uh, blowing me away. Okay. Oh, 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 I don't know what you want from me, bitch. 
Okay, gotcha. Come on. Fuck! No, I don't get it. <laughs> Something to do with the birds here, but... Oh god, how far back am I gonna be? The checkpoint was a gazillion years ago, bitch. I have another one here. If you hold up... Is it a hold up or hold a button? Yeah, hold up, you go further. Very unique game on that regard. Because usually it's like, the convention is you hold just a button, right? But not, not, oh, fuck, I'm sick of your shit, man. Shut the fuck up. Get out of here! Okay, I want to keep the, uh, the fire. I don't know if they'll allow me. Ugh. Yes. Mm, coins do count. Let's try to grab them. No. How'd I get up there again? Oh. Right here. What's that? Yeah, that was it, but don't don't touch these. I wanna see if the fire will do damage to the uh, balls. That might be it. <laughs> Let's take a look. You bitch ass. Fuck you. Burn your fucking face off, man. Hey, hey. I want those coins. Nah, I'm keeping all my coins. Fuck your bet and fuck your casino bullshit. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, there's more gameplay here. Awesome. Yay! It's not that short. Fucking A. Fucking A. Love it. Yes! I thought it I was afraid it was going to be the end of the game there. A little bit. That's good. That's good. So there's a lot more to be seen here. I love it. I see cards. Yes. But in this case, let me drink some Coke here. We get going and goddamn it is cold in here today. Yeah, hell yeah, next time, next paycheck. I gotta think about insulation here. Insulate those walls with that pink stuff. And do a partition here, otherwise I'm, I'm gonna, and, and cover the damn floor. Probably with insulation and some rubber on top or something, some wood. I gotta come up with something, otherwise I'm, I'm fucked, I'm history here. I won't be able to do, do streams, because you'll be frozen, the fucking shed freezes. Completely in the winter time. Yeah, reduce the the height of the roof here. Yeah, so I'll need buy I need to buy a lot of plywood and maybe some drywall. I think a plywood probably would do it. I don't know, it's kind of expensive now, isn't it? Fucking plywood. So I I need to do some measuring here. This the next few days off. Otherwise I'm done. How the fuck I'm gonna stream here in the winter time is gonna be impossible. So I'm gonna need to buy Yep, buy insulation immediately. Measure the thickness here and start boarding everything up. Then I can run the heat here efficiently. Right now, if I turn on the heat, it does nothing. Gaps everywhere, especially the floor. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Grab a smoke here. My check woods. I always love woods. Like uh, Super Mario World, my favorite. My favorite section of the game is the woods. The Forest of Illusion. So I, like, I love woods in real life, too. I, if I had to pick a place to live, it would be a log cabin in the woods in Finland. That's what I, where I would live. My, if I won the lottery tomorrow, I would move there immediately. That's what I would do. Northern F Finland, Lapland. A cabin, a wood cabin, a rustic one. Now that fancy two-story fucking, you know, looks like a house was a log cabin. An actual log cabin in the woods in a very cold place. 
The chase says, I hope you get the insulating sorting out. Yep, the damn winter. See, problem here in the summer, problem in the winter. I'm hoping maybe the insulation could help a tiny bit with the summer, keep cooler, you know, because it's insulated. But it could make it, I don't know, worse if the heat get, gets in and it never comes out. But the winter time is definitely a problem. If I can do the only way I can stream here in the winter is there's no way. The only way is being inside the house and streaming at night time only while the kids are asleep. That's the only way. In the shed, forget about it. It's fucked. Even my CRT stopped working here last winter. I had to bring one inside and keep inside the house. Sometimes the shed door is frozen. You can't even get in. But if that happens, I'll just bring my, uh, my, my heat gun. So what I use to uh, wax my mustache is a heat gun, because it's manly enough for me. I don't have a hair dryer. <laughs> so I use my uh, my heat gun, you know, for soldering. No, it's not just for soldering. It can use for a lot of stuff. It, it does, it's essentially a hair dryer, pretty much, but it's a power tool. Because once your mustache is big enough, you got to wax that shit and make the, the old handlebar. Sometimes I get in the mood, I just cut it and make it go down. You know, like a, what do you call it, a broom mustache or whatever, a, a sort of a walrus. Anyway, Parsley Woods. Love the names, it's always food related. <laughs> yeah, I got a heat gun for my, my mustache, none of, that, none of that hair dry, but to be honest, it's a bit scary. I got to keep it away from my face or it's burning off. <laughs> it's very powerful. The more you leave it... Oh, no, no, I want to keep this here. Power. There we go. Yeah, I haven't trained the mustache in a while, so it's going really <laughs> kind of big. Ah! Get back. Get out of here, you freak. Fuck this guy. Go back get the fucking garlic. Shit. So if you play this game and you see this pattern here, that means there's a bottomless pit. You're going to die. So do, at first I was annoyed, I was like, well, how the fuck am I supposed to know? Well, that's how. I think they only fall once. Sounds dangerous. No, safe. The the hairdryer thing. No, safe. It's just, uh, you got danger of burning your mustache, like uh, being too hot. For, for, for the face, it's fine. You just you gotta be careful you don't hurt your mustache, you know? The fuck is your deal, dude? Huh? Yeah, I, I think I've done it one time. I, I see damage your mustache. Look, doll, I had to, I had to not shave it off, but uh, do a lot of uh, use all of treatments and whatnot and conditioners because of uh, the heat, you know. So you just put a tiny bit. Nah! Ah! Fuck! Up or down? What's your problem, dude? I'm just fucking standing around this shit. I'll go down here to grab some of the goodies. And that's, that's the end of the line here. Yeah, this is cool. Like, <laughs> you grab the things with your horns momentarily. No, if I had something powerful that would, like, put my face in danger, then your mustache is <laughs> be fucked. I'll be a mustacheless, which is a nightmare. I've been I've been wearing, you know, I've had a mustache for many years now. So I had a nightmare one time. And this is a kind of affliction that hits a mustache me. And I had a nightmare one time that my that I accidentally shaved the mustache or burn it off or something, and I was no mustache. And it was like a proper nightmare for me. I was I woke up stressed out. My fucking lips are naked. It felt bad. <laughs> you know, because when you're in a nightmare, you think it's real, yeah? So up until the time I woke up, I thought I had really lost my mustache. Yeah, you grow again and all, but it, it takes takes time, you know? For me... To reach your size here? A couple of months at least, you know? At least, at least more than a month for sure. 
Oh, I can't see myself without a mustache. There's no way. Sometimes when my wife has seen uh, old pictures down memory lane, and I see myself without a mustache many, many years ago. And I look younger, but eh, it's not for me. It doesn't. It's not me. Some other dude. Oh, doesn't fall here. That's a bottomless pit right there. There we go. Yeah, but a mustache dream, I never forget. I was like almost crying. Like, oh, <laughs> what happened? It reminds me of a family guy. He does have an episode, he grows a mustache, and then it burns off when he's trying to save a guy from McBurger Town, burning building. And then he burns his mustache at the end, and the guy said, you saved my life, and he grabs him, but at what cost? At what cost? <laughs> <laughs> and then it tapes Brian to his face, the dog. To cope with the not having his mustache. Chase had the same thing, but I had long hair to my shoulders, and I would have dreams of getting shaved off and wake up terrified. Ah. See, that's the one thing I never had long hair. My hair's nothing. I buzz it all off. I, uh, the hair was always more of an inconvenience for me, and I never, never had long hair of any time. Maybe when I was a kid, I think I had a mullet. A very young kid, because I've seen pictures. But then you don't, you don't have control over your hair. I always had very short crew cut, military cut. Very well maintained. I had a flat top for many years. When I was 18, I would just have it buzzed as well. And then I was just buzzed. I'm not a freak about it, just... It's getting cut all the time. I buzz here and there, just whenever it grows big enough that's an inconvenience, I gotta worry about shampoo and conditioner and all that, then I just buzz it off. Last work. It feels good under the shower, too. Be bald head. Well, it's not bald, bald, but it's very short. She so said, got a haircut after three years. What made you, uh, what made you, uh, decide that? What, uh, what drove you to cut your hair short if you had a very long hair. <clears throat> Just wondering. <laughs> I'll keep this one. You crazy? Those are some cool levels. I always like cart levels in any game. Donkey Kong has the best ones, dude. Did a good job with the collar here. The feller. Oh. Come on, bitch. <laughs> I'm just fucking annoying. I always in my face, the food. My face, my foot. Oh, yeah, it's getting my foot. A mustache with foot is not it's something you learn to live with, but it's never the same not having a mustache. I say, fuck it, I'm done with this. Well, there you go. That's a good answer. Oh, get out. I did shave my mustache many years ago one time, and I regret it immediately. No. But I do remember that it felt good drinking and eating without having to worry about it. It was pretty, pretty cool. Oh, shit. Mm. Do I even need you, per se? Maybe, yeah, because there's a limit with a flying. Nope. Yeah. Can't even go back, bitch. <laughs> yeah, this power is very cool. Sleep was terrible, tossing and turning. Oh, that's right, it would affect your sleep, too. What, you pull, like you were moving around? Yeah, I know, because my wife's got long hair, so she's constantly adjusting. Sometimes I get in bed and pull on her hair by mistake. So, yeah, what, do you have very short now, or just kind of nor normal? Just go quick here, and should be... Oh, should be fine. Oh, what are you doing? What the fuck is wrong with this guy? Funny, sometimes they don't have a door, just a... What the... Mm -hmm. 
I'm happy this game is a little longer than I thought. That's good. No, I'm not gonna gamble anything, dude. For mustache, the problem is eating, I would say, but actually when you have it longer and you fart it sideways, you do the handlebar stuff, it becomes easier to eat. Because you leave an opening. I don't have visible lips. They don't show. I don't have big lips. I think it's weird sometimes to see guys with a mustache, right? They have a good mustache, but their bottom lips are too big. And it looks like a hairy sausage. It looks disgusting to me. Sorry. Just when I see it, you know? Like a big-ass fucking wet lip under a bunch of hair. It just looks, <laughs> looks terrible to me. I think if I had big lips and my mustache didn't cover my lips, I would not have a mustache. I'll just... I'll just stick with having l l luscious lips. But I got, I got crappy thin lips, so it don't matter. I have no lips anymore. Yeah, I've seen one because I've been on the ratted mustache a couple of times. And yeah, this guys have, a, have pictures and it looks like a, a big sausage with hair on it. it looks <laughs> That's the image that I got. Like big ass lips, right? The red lips. Nah. Mine is just there's no lips. Even I forgot what they look like. Sometimes I'm doing styling and put them up and I get to see a bit of my lips. I'm like, oh, there they are. I have lips. Sorta. <laughs> oh, this is new music here. Ah, you idiot, you forgot the rolls. <laughs> Die, motherfucker. Come here. Come here. <laughs> the physics of this game is very fun. You, you, you get to do a lot of stuff. When Rax kiss me, I can't breathe. Oh. Too personal. No, no talking of our private live here, my dear. <laughs> We're talking about our kisses here. You don't kiss and tell, my dear. Right. Well, you stay out there. Is this auto scrolling? Oh, this one is awesome. We get the sparrow. Give me this guy! Oh! What the fuck? Yeah, but once you have this power up here, you have peace of mind. Still going on about the mustache kisses? <laughs> well, you're gonna, you're gonna suffocate, because I ain't shaving that shit. Ever. You just never have. You'll never see my lips again. They are not meant to be seen anymore. Ah! Mm. And I ain't dreaming it either, like, too much. I don't know, man. I don't know if that's a good use of my time to power up. I'm gonna stick with what I have here. Yeah, no, I think it was for the bat. Oh, no. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, oh. Ah! <laughs> Just squash me. Okay, now I think I need to get the dragon thing. And Chase, a hairy and hairy. Hairy and hairy sound about the same to me. Oh, pretty easy to mix them up. Hmm. Perhaps this is... Ah, man. The thing that gets me about the dragon power-up... Fuck. My goodness, I'm gonna get... Hit game over here. Hmm. No, no, no. Not impressed. Get the deal to go back. 
must try to do better here. As I'm auto scrolling, so I can't be fucking around. Oh, I got him on it. There we go. <laughs> yeah, the thing is, like, right at the end, that, that there, it gets you because you think. Uh, fuck. No. You bastards, I'll kill all of you. Alright, let's go another. Can I do this? Yeah. Well, that was a smart thing to do. Come, bird. <laughs> You can suck a fuck. Oh. Hold the fucking thing, leaves back. <laughs> yeah, my wife took the, uh, you're suffocating me <laughs> to the literal level. <laughs> you know, when somebody shoot. Oh, fuck. Up in your grill. And you go, you're suffocating me. But in my case, because of the mustache, just quite literally. <laughs> Alright. I don't know why I keep doing this. It's it's already open. Mm, no, no, I got nothing to gamble here, my good friend. <laughs> if you have a plant chance to fucking fresh how is this? Ah, I got you. I see what you're all about. That was the whole level. Got a lack of two in here. How about this tone up? You can't, can't kill it. Love it. Fuck you, man. Yeah, but I'm above the above the clouds now. I don't think the cloud itself can... Oh, we trigger happy here, are we? Nah, it's not an upgrade. We we'll stick with the dragon stuff. It's the way of the dragon. Is there something here? God, this guy's a pass. I was thinking that the bubble could do something. <laughs> I like Wario's look when he's tiny. <laughs> it looks funny. It looks like he has a mohawk here. <laughs> Give me coins. Oh shit, I killed it. I don't need your fucking money. I'll push you out of here. Somebody made a good hack one time uh, with Mario and Walu oh, sorry Wario and Waluigi. I'm gonna play that. I want to play a lot of hacks here. There's a lot of cool hacks out there that are good fans work on. How hard? Hey hey! <sighs> Die! Hmm, the shoe doors, but I reckon the harder one will be. Hmm, then what's the other one? The, oh, there we go. Good old checkpoint. I wish, I wish the checkpoint rooms had something on top of them to let you know checkpoints. Sometimes you might think is a... Hang on. Go, 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 go. Past. Oh. This guy's a fucking... Oh my god, I can't stand this asshole. The patterns are all over the place. Let's see here. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this uh, this will be useful against those douches. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Burn him to a crisp.
Mm. There we go. Who requested this? Your own map? Well, like I said, it would have been played eventually after uh, Super Mario Golden Golden Coins. I said six Golden Coins. The last. Whoa! Give me this. Okay. All right. But uh, yeah, that, that was Jerome's request, though. This is a bottomless pit, isn't it? Is it? Oh, you can climb with it. Okay. Yeah, this is an excellent game. What? Oh, fuck it. Let's risk. Ah! Get out of here, you wiggly duckling. Nah! Fuck. Is there kind of a bunch of leaps of faith here? I don't... What is this? I, I, I'm not getting it. Okay, uh, kind of regret fucking with a key here. I'm not, I'm not going for 100% of this game. Just normal, normal playthrough. <laughs> the fuck was that shit? Yeah, this game is awesome. The physics is is not. Sometimes it's kind of like a Super Mario World 3. Ever played that? Super Mario. No, sorry, Super Mario World 2. Hmm. Well, it's motherfucking Yoshi's Island, but that that title is in there. It's kind of it's kind of dumb. I mean, they're doing for wrecking. I don't get it. It's a completely different game. What? Pardon me? Fuck, what's going on here? Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm out of bounds. What the f... Well, I glitched out. What the f... Fuck, what am I looking at here? That's it, I... I went past the fabric of reality here. I can't, I can't go back. What the fuck? I'm on a different fucking plane of existence here. All right, I... I guess... Oh my god, he's shitting me. I can't... I can't even die here anymore. I might have to wait for the timer. Some kind of glitch. There's nowhere to go here. Yeah, I think I might... <laughs> All right, I guess I have to wait for the timer to go out. There's nothing I can do here. So I guess I gotta fill it up with talking. Hey, and the light goes off again. Will you fuck off. I needed a fucking goddamn hub here today. Got in the mail, I forgot to bring it in. I bought a USB hub for power. You know what I hate? Ice machines. So I bought a, so cause we gotta make some idle talk here for 246 seconds. So I got an ice machine one time. So a, a machine dedicated for ice. Because we got to talk about something. So I might as well talk about ice machines. And you got to keep the fucking... You only have ice if you keep the thing on. But it's using a lot of power, right? So it's making ice. But who the fuck wants that? Nobody, I sold, It's one of the very few appliances I actually sold. I got a story to tell about what, when I sold that too. So... So then basically when I want to have some cocktails that require ice, I have to plug the thing in and wait for like an hour. So in other words, we never fucking use it. Because I, I don't have the refriger the fancy new refrigerators that dispense ice. That's cool. Ugh, fucking stop bourbon, asshole. So that's cool. You know, you have ice all anytime you want. 
But now if you have to turn on the machine, wait a fucking hour. Have a little bit of ice, then turn it off, and then it turns... Or just leave it on all the time, which is, I think, I'm pretty sure the manual said it wasn't recommended to do. Then what's the fucking point? See, it's a matter of convenience, isn't it? I'll tell you when I saw the ice machine, so this guy was on eBay. So this guy goes and, uh, it's not a bid. Like, so a bid I could understand, but he, he buys a machine on, like, Monday. I, I kind of needed money. I can't remember what he was, but I needed cash quick. So I sold it for a, a, a re very reasonable price, very cheap as compared to what I paid. So the guy, he bought it, and it's like, it was like Monday or something. So, I'll, okay, I was like, well, and then it's like, I'll pay you on Friday then. I'm like, what? Like, that's not how it works. You buy an item now, and you pay like a week fucking later? It's not even bids? You know? Fuck off. Reminds me of another guy. So he buys a, a travel trailer. I had a tiny one. And I offered delivery at the time my Dodge Ram was on the road. So I go and bring to... So he, he wins, right? I, I think that one, I can't remember if it was on a bid. But anyways, he, he, he won the item. He, he got the trailer. He gave me his address. I go deliver it. It was fucking horrible. It was a very busy road. You know, I had to go sideways with the truck. And backing up into his his place was not possible. Well, I think it was, but my truck wouldn't fit his driveway. Because it's, uh, yeah, yeah, let's go. So we detach it and kind of push it in. And then I get back in my truck and I'm waiting for the pay. And he goes, so, okay, so I'll just pay you with PayPal tonight when I get home because it was a different time. I was like, what? Pardon me. That's not how it works, buddy. No, you pay me now. And it's like annoyed. Like, in what planet is it? I wonder if this guy comes from. Like, you, you deliver a trailer, he pays nothing, and I got to go home, travel back home, and wait on his goodwill to pay me. I was like, no fucking way. You're paying right now. Are you kidding? That's not how it works. And he, oh, I have to go to the bank. I have to do whatever you got to do, but I came here for money, you know? So <laughs> you tra the trader's in your house. If you don't have it, gonna, you're going to help me to attach it back, and I'm out of here. And uh, and fuck off, you know, I wasted the gas coming here, dude. He went and got the money. But I, I found it incredible that that's how we thought that transactions work. Imagine, you buy a console on eBay, right? I bought this GameCube. The guy ships it to me without getting paid, and I tell him, oh, I'll just pay you later. It's like, yeah, okay. <laughs> like, not on credit, just uh, on your word. Uh, so I managed to fill up the conversation here, so it's not as awkward. And we can't die fighting here. Like, yeah, get me out. I mean, I'm locked in a different dimension, please. And I, oh, you could have gone back. No, you can't. You can't go. I'm in a different plane of existence here. There's, there's nowhere to go. I can't even get the coin. See, it's not, I'm not interactable with anything here anymore. Ah, as high as possible. There we go. Now we can go back to gaming. So be careful here. Yeah. Well, didn't get. Okay. <laughs> Fair. Funny. The game over. Okay. Cool. Cool. Have a little smoke here, and then we'll go back to the game. Gives me a chance to get a thumbnail because I fucked up. All right, let's go. Load that file and let's get going here, bitch. Now we're done seeing. <laughs> it's a great game. 
Well, let's not get caught up in shenanigans here and get locked up somewhere stupid. Oh yeah, get the thing here. So if you fly here, you're in a world of shit. There's, you're, you're, you're in limbo. So I got a key from up there somewhere. Damn it. No, I meant to go up, dude. Cause I'm holding up to go jump further here. No, oh, no, let's go on again. Oh, fucking out of control. I'm gonna keep this power up here if this asshole gets out of my fucking way. There you go. So you got a key in here. Oh, so that's the bottom of spit. So there's a key, but... No, fuck no. Just a heart. Thank you. Oh, one up. Good. Yeah, but I can do this with a... Really, uh, pushing for the... I don't know about the mystery of the key. Oh, there we go. But how in the fuck am I going to get here? I don't think you can fly with the key. So this is... This is the key place. You can't, I don't think you can fly with a key. I'll try here. Yeah, you can't. Okay, I'll open it, but... How? Shit, trying to... <laughs> okay. Okay. There we go. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, look at this environment here, it's pretty cool. So you can 100% uh, this game if you're, you know, a lot of replayability here. I'm not doing it tonight, but, you know, it's, you can always do that. Oh, yeah, this power up here is pretty cool. There we go. Oh! Doofus. <laughs> Thought it was automatic for some reason. Just going quick here because of the power. Parse. Parse selling. Bit of a misspelling here. What, what happened? It was parsley. Was it always spelled like that? Parsley? Pretty sure it was parsley. I think uh, glitching out earlier fucked things up here a little bit. Pretty sure it wasn't misspelled before. Oh well. Shut the fuck up with that. Wait a minute. Oh, can go back, okay. There we go. Auto scroll, okay. 
No, no. Damn it. Fucking sometimes I go and goblins with the power-ups. I don't want a shitty ass fucking downgrade power-up, asshole. I have the fucking ultimate power here. Oh good, that was that was well thought out. Fucking panic and us everything here. Come off it. Okay, God, I hate this duck. Fuck you. Auto scroll, you can't be fucking around with the auto scroll, man. Shut up, you bash. Get out of here. Well, I'm gonna enjoy this. Get squashed. Motherfucker, I waited too long. Why did I do I wait there? I'll run you over. I will run your ass over, man. So those are, you want to kind of stay up front. Unless you don't get... You hiding something up there? Hmm? Nothing. Yeah, sparse woods. I, I'm pretty sure it was spelled correctly when I first. What the fuck? Piece of shit. You sack of fucking crap. How the fuck? I, I don't get it. I thought when he's not throwing it, there's no hitbox in there. You hurt me. Okay, remember, don't wait. Come here. <clears throat> I can squash him out into, into oblivion. Okay, don't wait for the, the, the other asshole. Quick. Squash him. Squash him of nothingness. This this asshole here. Where? Where is he? He's coming up. There's one here. Keep fucking this. Mm. Not today, asshole. And Chase, what was your favorite part of Resident Evil 1 that you played? And Liffer, take note, because uh, Mr. Liffer here, because I remember Chase said he did have problems with, uh, with Yon. It's not, not the same as it. Fucking, what the fuck you want from me? What the fuck? I'm not getting this guy. At least I have the checkpoint here. Come here, come here, come here. No, 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 come here, little freak. <laughs> god, now shoot them. Oh my god, I made life harder for myself. Come on! You bitch, get him! Fuck him up! <clears throat> I'm dealing with this shit. <laughs> You miserable fuck. Yeah. You feel his weight when he jumps like boom. Boom, boom. Favorite part was the lab or doing the mansion. So all of it? Mm. I'm not fucking risking my neck for a fucking coin, you're crazy. What was your favorite monster then on Resident Evil 1? A favorite like anime. Tough luck, buddy. 
You gotta go. Yeah, nice try. I'm not falling over that. Get squashed in there. Pull him. There's nothing up there. Hitbox is big. Yeah, some of the enemies here do have massive hitboxes. Ah, <laughs> very cool. Check this out. No. Trick is not wait. Mm. Past. Let's shakers do a hide here. Nothing. Boom. Boom. Again with a ship. Already open it, doofus. I hit it, yawn. Yeah, yawn is annoying. The space is, the hitboxes in that room are annoying. They're kind of all over the place. A lot of jagged edges and shit. The box and it, it's, it's hard to move in there. So that's why uh, I was like with Mr. Leaf, it's not the same as on the on the remake. Is it's it's smoother. You know, it's easier to deal with. A lot easier. I look forward to playing the remake here. Parsley Woods. Pretty sure when I came here it was Parsley and it fucked up somehow. It was a dark level, is it? How does a desk go behind the glass? I don't get it. Well, my favorite enemy that showed up in Resident Evil, even though short, is Neptune, the shark, right? <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. Now we're keeping this shit. Oh, keeping this shit. Ah! The fucker! We got a hobby, asshole. Get out of here. Boom. Aha! This guy! Get a, get a life, man. Go get some Pone Tang or something. Fucking, you know, we're a dick. I don't care what you do, just get the fuck away from. Oh my god. Oh, you killed the guy. Okay, you get on my book, man. No, but seriously, man, get the fuck. Get away. Yeah, this is a fun game. Just classic stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh! Fuck! Thought he would uh, hit the thing here. Checkpoint, most likely. Yeah. There we go. The okay. kind. Oh, that one scared the fuck out. Oh, yeah, no, that one is extra scary. Like, genuinely fucking scary. The kind of your thing. I thought they were monkeys, but they're flies and they're throwing up and there's a mess. And it's. Yeah. You, oh. Oh, that's cool. Ha! Ah, oh, yeah. Instant relief. Can I hurt that asshole so much? Oh, can't do anything about it. Yep, I'll take it. Do your thing, asshole. Jeez. Oh, shit. Ah! God, this guy's annoying. It's just like Lacket 2 on uh, Super Mario. God, get lost, asshole. Fuck. Come on, bamboozle him. Fuck the coin, get out. I'll leave him behind. No, I'll keep the fire thing. Yeah, it's a boss. Ghost man. It's freezing me here. Get out of here, bitch. How long? 
can't kill him like that. The fuck? Top? No. What do you want, damn bitch? Okay, the old. Ah, ah, what the fuck you! One more, come on, bitch. Ah! Get off me, you fuck! <laughs> yeah, 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 bitch! Yeah! Tyrant did a sun combo first time trying to fight him. Oh, Sunlock, you huh? Motherfucker. I love the pre-rendered graphics on PS1. Makes it me feel scary. The PS1, a lot of people had that uh, conclusion, arrived at that conclusion that uh, PS1 games and graphics are scary, are scary in their own way. And I agree with it. There's something about it, you know? I don't know. There's something about PS1 graphics, yes, that makes them, makes everything weirder and unsettling. 100% agree with that. And you know, and it's not just us because there's a, there's, People make modern graphics, uh, modern graph, modern games with PS1 graphics, and it's not just because they're lazy or not. That some people deliberately go for that look. I heard a lot of good things about Lost in Vivo, which is around similar, like PS1 graphics. Syrup Castle. <laughs> And watch getting me spell later on down the line. Yeah, that looks the same as the last one. Good music, man. I get the goodest. I see a coin there. We don't reject. Oh, give me this. That was a coin in there. Oh. Ooh. Shall come, bitch. So yeah, well this game is not just about holding a jump button. If you hold the D-pad the in the direction you want to go, or even up, you jump further. Which is quite unique, usually compared to like Mario game. Ah, ah, there you go. Fuck yeah. Definitely a checkpoint in there. No, you go, go right by me, bitch. Where is it? This will be a checkpoint here, isn't it? No. Hmm. Ballsy move. No, there you go. Let's come up with a Wario... Wario Land with PS1 graphics. I like when they do the, uh, like Resident Evil 4 PS1 graphics and all, but I wish somebody would fucking actually make... I love D-makes. Oh. oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> Fuck off! I'm under the thing here! Whatever, bitch. I'll get this power up then, bitch. There we go. Yeah, don't fucking come out of there. Oh, 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 we're not leaving coins here, we're not Rockefellers. Yeah, but I need to go up there to get this stuff, okay. Ah, there we go. a trap. Hmm. Something down here. 
Oh! Motherfucker, I can barely see the fucking things. Oh, not this asshole again, dude. Okay, so he has a period of time he's not holding his stuff. What do you want from me? I don't know where this motherfucking key goes. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. Get me out of here, then. Bloodborne Demake. I haven't even tried a regular Bloodborne. I heard of it vaguely. I heard about the demake. Somebody mentioned it here before. That is a full-blown working remake, yeah? Is that... Is the Game Boy touching that garlic? No, it's not. Okay. Stop pushing a fucking tripod, you on. I hate this shit. I need to come up with a better way, because I can't move here without hitting the tripod. It's a pain in the ass. No, no. Incorrect. That's not the way it was. Right there. There you go. All right. <laughs> How the fuck you break the shit in? Nothing I can do about it. Not right now. Okay, this is gonna unlock everything. There you go. <laughs> and then I go back there and invert it again. Open the other part. Ah, there you go. Ah, you fuck! God damn it! Come here. No, 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 no. Get out of here, you trash. Shit. Fucking mind pricks, man. Need that shit? Damn it. Oh, fuck. Ah, fuck. I done goofed. Oh! Give me the deal, though. There we go. Yeah, it's a good power up. Yep. Ah! Past! Oh, watch out for those fucking birds, man. Bitch ass. Yeah, but which way will be the way here to go? 
Oh, fuck off. Let's go with the lab first. Yeah, 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 bitch. Yeah, fuck yeah. Yeah, because in the Bloodborne, I would definitely have to play the... F oh, shit. The first one, because he makes... What the fuck? I thought I had to fire one for some reason, because that's how stupid I am. Uh, I'm not waving. Told you, fuck off. <laughs> oh, no, this ass are going quick. Of course, I hated this type of shit. Now, oh, God, this shit again. My god, no. Stop it. There we go. Yeah. No, you don't know. Okay, there we go. What the fuck? Like this? Bloodborne is it? Is that like Dark Souls, Demon Souls, and all that stuff? Bloodborne. Now we got it. No, I don't got shit here. Might be the last level, I reckon. No. 39? That's an odd number. You think they'll go to 40? <laughs> no. No. No, I'm gonna keep doing the shit I have here. <laughs> you. Fuck yeah. Yes. Hmm. Yeah, I wouldn't need to break that on the other one, but that's fine. I can live without it. Hey, hey, bitches! Oh, this is getting painful now. Whatever. Lost some coins, so what? Nah, you passed. Motherfucker! Oh, from software, they're pretty good. I don't know, man. Think, and I'm curious what's down there. I, I think you're going too far. I think that's kind of stupid what you're doing just now. Just stop it. Get help. Get mental help. There you go, we'll just carry on here. Nah. <laughs> yeah, now I see your game. There you go. Oh, thought it'd be one more here at least, but not really. Checkpoint. Yes. Oh! Motherfucker! Damn you. Uh, mm. 
Cheddar. Mm, wow. Well. No. Mm. I wonder what's in the middle there, because you can jump up. Probably the key or something. Don't need that shit. No! What the fuck? Get out of there! Okay. It's a chill game. It's kind of a dick move. Get out of here, man. There we go. No. Shit, there we don't go. No. Fucking man, take a hint. Just, just wait here. And yeah, just wait. Too high. The ramp is too damn high, party. That's my political affiliation, by the way. Just wanna know. The ramp is too damn high, party. Nah, <laughs> this guy. Fuck you. It's the Souls game. Ah. I messed up that. Okay, this has got, has got to be it, I think. Number 40 makes sense. 40 courses, that's a pretty good bang for your buck here, my friend, with a, a Game Boy game, you kidding me? Okay, just making sure how everything works. Those are kinda... Is the boss gonna be the duck guy or something? I already have it. do here pal let me see but then I fall right ah! oh, shit same thing here <laughs> oh now we got that thanks though No, again, I'm not, didn't need it. Yeah, something fishy around. Oh, checkpoint, of course. Watch out for the treachery here. Get out. And let's go. Concentrating here. Don't need it. Don't need it. Don't need that. Give me something besides garlic. We got plenty of garlic here. Coins up there. Holy shit. More garlic, thanks. Mm. 
Yep. Yep. Fuck you! What the fuck? Okay, so I hit it once. What the fuck is this? Get the other garlic so I get bigger. And then... Ah! Fuck! What is this guy's... What is... What's your fucking damage? Fucking asshole. I think I'm... I don't know what he wants. Did I leave and come back again? Or perhaps come back later? No. I'll, I'll get the garlic here. But what the fuck? Now I'm actually needing the garlic. What's the deal with this uh, jerk off here? Fuck you, man. I'm not. I'm not understanding. Uh. What is this shit here? Fuck you know. Okay, so I got a fucking big brain puzzle here right at the end. Maybe get him near that thing. Urgh! There you go. Fucking hell. <laughs> ah! Fuck! Goddamn hitbox from. Fucking hell, man. Oh man, stop being an idiot, please. Just stop. Okay, just go on top. Get off. Yeah, if you eat gar- Fuck. Shut up with that crap. He's not letting go. Alright, have a good life, dude. What the fuck? You know what, you fuck? God damn it, I wanna throw this. Yeah, 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 thanks. No, no shit. Fuck. Hey! <laughs> fuck you, Wario! You fat fuck! Qu fucking jump higher! Just fucking light again! Come on, the one time we used a fucking USB hub I just bought. Would have been now. Uh, how far back? Oh my god, okay. Fuck off. Oh god, okay. Really? <laughs> Bravo. Mm-hmm. Mm, I don't know. Checkpoint a little further. It's not a hard game. This is by no means of it. It's just a very chill game. Very chill. sure what it is. I, I kind of remember the boss now that I, I saw my wife going against the boss. But I can't remember. What, I know you have to make some clouds or something. Salt garlic. Well, now we know the trick here, though. This wooden garlic, what is it? There you go. 
<laughs> Fuck off! What? You fucking bitch ass motherfucker. God damn it. Get her from one of behind, man. Just follow this jerk off. I love Aria's phases. <laughs> Mischievous. <laughs> Fuck off! What's going on here? Are you? There we go. Still gotta deal with those jerk offs. Oh. Ah! Yes. Kill this asshole. These are shit. I hate this animal shit. There we go. This is just garlic, yeah. Alright, see what's up. Need to leave it in between? No. Okay, okay right now. Nope. What do you fucking want from me, dude? Not a fucking big brain battle here. Do I need to have it in a certain way? It's never. A Never the right side, side up. Fuck off. You fucking tuba lard, I'll fix you. Get that bitch down here. Ah! What the fuck am I to do here? What do you want? I thought... I don't fucking know, dude. <sighs> Boss fights sometimes are fucking weird, dude. I don't know. Uh, well, I guess we'll keep doing this until the time is out, because I'm, I'm out of fucking ideas here. What, can I climb? Is this climbable? Can I climb on top of this and then... What the fuck? Oh, I, I see the cloud, but how did... What the fuck was that? What's going on here? What is happening? I don't know what the fuck is happening here, man. It's just fucking stupid. Yeah, but what the fuck is... I, it's random? What the fuck? What's going on? Nothing happened. What is this shit? Man boob motherfucker. Oh, gotta repeat. I don't. I, I'm not getting the boss fight. Not understanding. I didn't. I don't want anything cryptic. I just want a normal fucking boss fight. I don't know what the fuck is going on. I, I don't want to fucking hearts either. I just want to get out of here now. Now, now is irritating. What the fuck was that? Think you fuck, you went like? Uh, what, what was that shit? What the fuck was that shit? What was that? What the fuck was that? Why does every game find a way to get under my fucking skin, man? What the fuck? What was that? What was that? It went like a bit sideways? What the fuck is going on here? What was that shit? What the fuck was that crap? It was wind? What? 
He just went, oh, 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 oh. What? 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 Ah, no, it's fucking cryptic shit. I hate it. That it's. What do you want from me? There's a cloud, a puff of red cloud comes out. What? Let me fucking hit you. I, I, I like. <sighs> yeah, how to be a fucking level to piss me off. Thank you for following, following Dano Box. Much appreciated. You help me beat this boss before I think you need to climb the cloud? No, I, I know the cloud, but I, I'm not sure how the cloud is not showing consistently. And I, I don't know how I'm making a cloud show up. Is that random? You get the fuck out of here, man. I gotta wait forever. I hate this shit. I gotta wait for this asshole. It takes a fucking gazillion years. Hey, pick up the pace, asshole. I hate cryptic fucking fives. I don't know how the die, motherfucker! God damn it! This is random. I... Hey, bitch! What's up, bitch? What's going on, bitch? Where you going, bitch? Turn it back on me, bitch! The fuck is happening, bitch? <laughs> It's random? What the fuck? Fucking feels like a gazillion fucking ears in between the, the clouds, and then it's the chance to shoot them all. Ugh. Could do without this asshole here. <laughs> Big mistake. Don't be an idiot. Today, buddy. Today, motherfucker! What the fuck were you doing in there? Having a fucking smoke break? What the fuck was that? I'm waiting, I'm waiting. The asshole never comes. Like I even last your fight with. You cunt. Fucking a gazillion. What, 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 what was that guy doing in there? So, right. Hit the lamp. The fuck was that last guy doing, man? Okay, so I don't, I don't rub the lamp. I just keep throwing the lamp and randomly. What if I don't even touch the lamp? Then what? Yeah, he grabbed it anyway. I don't fucking know, man. Kind of dumb. Uh, random? So random puff of small comes out of the. I don't fucking know, man. I don't like this boss fight. Fuck off! This is stupid. Where's the fucking small? God damn you! Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off! Hey, neckbeard. The fuck is going on here? Give me the fucking... Yeah, but then I get hit. What the f... Whee! It's a gazillion air. Fuck. Thanks for that asshole there. I'm a fucking smoke break. Hey, asshole, I ain't got all day here, you know? No, no. You this is so awkward. This is so fucking awkward! Oh, now you give me another one. But of course, I'm not there to fucking enjoy it. Ugh, I don't know. It should be something you do to have the plot and not be fucking random shit. Come on, man. Do I have to throw him in at times? Does it matter throwing? Does it have anything to do with a fucking lamp? What the, what the what? He doesn't let me fucking jump in. Get your fucking lard ass out of here, man. Fucking got bigger tits than my grandma. Fuck out of here. 
fucking titty twister, you ass, man. What was that last guy? Just fucking standing around and shit, man. I don't want to do this crap. This is boring. Fucking just do this here's enough. <laughs> what the fuck? What was, since when I can do tiny jumps? I want to try now deliberately to do tiny jumps. Because now it just feels like the game's fucking with me here. Had to be a fucking level, huh? Had to be a fucking delight again? I bought a fucking goddamn shitty ass USB hub and I left it in the house like an asshole. Tripod getting fucked again. Fucking random ass bullshit. I hate it. I don't like, I like skill on my boss fights, not random garbage. I had to find a fucking. Okay, I want to know you do. I want to see you do a small jump. No, no, no! You did a small jump a minute ago. Where was it? Let me see the small jump. Do it again. Do it again, you you bastard. Where is it? How come one time I did a small jump? I'm holding down. How do I do a small jump? So the game just fucked with me. Is that it? It did a small jump. It's on tape. It's on fucking tape. It did a tiniest jump here. How? Why? Ah, oh, fuck you. I hate, I hate random bullshit garbage like this. It did a tiny ass jump that is not possible. I lose my fucking shit. I suck my dick down. Repeat the whole fucking stage now. Ah, oh, fuck off. Shut the fuck up. Oh, it saves the checkpoint or whatever then. Then what's the point of the game over then, huh? I was just losing the stuff. So what, you lose your completion? Do the tiny jump again. Do the tiny fucking jump again. I want to see it. Because you're a lying sack of shit. Do the tiny jump again, motherfucker. You lying fuck. You lying fucking sack of shit, you. Do the tiny jump. There's no way you can do it. Look. I want to see the fucking tiny ass jump again that he did that one time and cost me a fucking life. How's that even possible? Hmm? Hmm? Nonsense. That was nonsense. That was a life stolen from me. Ugh, half an hour later with this guy. Can we go like right away? The fuck? What are you doing? Since when if he feels nothing? The game has random fucking rules sometimes. Since when you hit him and he does nothing? Because I hit him up front? Yeah? Oh, is that it? You sure about that? Okay, let me show you then. Allow me to show you to you then. There we go. Go in front of him. Don't fucking do your tiny ass jumps. No, no, no. I want to go in front of him. Oh, magically I can hit him now. But not a, a second ago. What are you on about? What? Go to hell, you fuck. Oh my god, this- what, what is the secret here, man? Just more random bullshit? Oh my god. Just kill me. Fucking kill me. Kill me, dude. You know what? No, I'm gonna go there small. I can't even know- just kill me. Just- just kill me! Can't even- it didn't- alright. Fuck it. No, come on. There's gotta be something you do to trigger the fucking lamp, man. No way. Just random. Doesn't make any fucking sense. This asshole here. Yeah, you cost me the fucking goddamn power up last time, you piece of shit. It's annoying when, when you're ready to attack him, he throws the fucking balls in between, so. <laughs> Do I need to throw the shit, or constantly? It's 
just gonna stay in one place. Oh no, I'm sure harass me. You and that bitch of yours. I'll fuck you both up. Can't wait. Where's the cloud thing? So I need to get, keep throwing this garbage? Ugh. Just give up, alright. Just go and forget the whole thing. I'm gonna jump on him if right right on the jump he does that crap. This one here. Ugh. Why is every fucking boss fight takes forever? Like I don't wanna be doing this shit forever, man. I wanna be be able to attack. I can't do nothing before that. It's stupid. You're tanking the legacy here of Wario. There you go, but then he does... Okay, he does that shit! It's like, look at it, and, and the knockback! Why does this game have knockback? You know, motherfucking Gastrovania! Fuck with the knockback here! Game has knockback, i never seen nothing like it. Like, like, not in a Mario fucking universe, it has an actual knockback. What? It doesn't work well here, it just stops you dead and you fall. Do the tiny jump again. I want to see the tiny jump. Where's that tiny jump? You did a tiny jump one time. How 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 was that possible? How come you can't replicate that? Just just that one time to fuck with me. Is that it? I can't I can't climb up there because the, the fucking guy the minute is my time my turn. That asshole doesn't fucking let me. Every fucking game I gotta come here and lose my fucking mind, innit? Fucking goddamn it! The problem I have with this level is everything takes forever. I don't have the patience. Like this asshole here, you gotta wait a fucking gazillion years to have a chance to fucking attack him. Look! Oh my god! Where are you going, asshole? You gotta wait for him to be in front of you, facing the back. It's annoying. I, I don't like waiting. I'm not a waiting kind of person. Look. Look. And then sometimes it doesn't fuck. It doesn't work like this. What the fuck? Why? Why that that doesn't work? I don't I don't get it. What do you want from me? I thought you just hit him shoulder barge right at the end there by that fucking blue shit. And that's all you have to do. And sometimes I do it. I want to blow up in a burst in flames here. So how come the, the one before didn't work? RNG. I don't know what RNG. R Rign Lamp is wild. I done told you. I don't understand a lot of abbreviations. I don't get it. Is that a very long word, Chase? RNG. I don't, I'm trying to decipher, I don't know, there's so many uh, acronyms on the internet, sometimes I lose fucking track. Fuck off! Get out of here! Yeah, I don't know what RNG is. What is RNG? Some kind of weapon? Oh my god, go away, please, just go away! Random, oh, okay, random number generate. how the fuck would I know that, honestly? Is that, is that something that people know when you say RNG people say is random number generation? Nah, I, I wouldn't have known that. Just write that, so I know what it is. We, do, we have too many acronyms nowadays. Half of the time I don't know what the kids are talking about. Constantly until his face is up? Constantly what until his face is up? Do I need to throw this garbage here over and over? I'm not... I'm not... I'm not a thinking... boss battle kind of guy. I like just... Like, ooh, you dodge that, and that's it. And now's your chance. I'm very simplistic when it comes to boss fights. I mean, props are the big-ass sprite, though. Very cool. I'm not understanding you. When is my turn? 
he fucking he blocks me like this. Sure. How the fuck, dude? How the fuck? And the knockback! The fucking knockback! Fuck you! Constant throw lamp until it's face up. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. So there's a there's a the knockback in this game. Why? Who thought, who thought it was a good idea to have knockback here? It's not cold. It doesn't work well. It's very unnatural. It's not like Castlevania expected knockback. Here is very unnatural. A very unnatural knockback. It reminds me of a... It reminds me of a Ben 10 on the hyper skin. Like a message pops up and it kills your momentum. So the knockback here, is, it doesn't knock you, but it kills your momentum and it just fucking die because it... It's so fucking unnatural. It's not, it's not fluid like Castlevania. It feels heavy, like an actual knockback. You push back. Here's like a more of a st somebody's holding you and moving you this way. That's what it feels like. It's my one gripe with this here game. It's okay. So, oh no, and now to wait a gazillion years for this. Porca vaca. Fuck you, you bitch. I hate you. Have to fucking wait on your ass? Are you serious? Like, can you stop moving here? Oh, God. You just have to. There's no... Just supposed to lay back and take it. Oh, my God, no. No, I'm gonna save that in case it fucks up here. Come on, you bitch ass motherfucker. Damn it! Fuck off! Okay, so lamp up. Uh, still gotta do this balloon here. stood up there okay so fa lamp face up I'm gonna fuck you up you piece of shit so not now maybe after right after the powers end do that Let's see if the cloud comes up. So right after the power, that's when I do. So it's not a coincidence anymore. So that way I can jump without... Damn it! I still have to wait a gazillion fucking years, man. Shit. The knockback is weird in this game. Christ! Yeah, I still hate it. It's fucking stupid because you're relying on luck. Oh my god, fuck me. Fuck me sideways, man. <laughs> oh, fucking piece of shit, you. Oh! I could have used it. Could I have used that guy to hit him again? Okay, so now I know the lamp. You know, I didn't. I did think of it, but I threw it so many fucking times and never lands the right way. Ah, uh, it's a test of patience. That sure is. Get it, get it, motherfucker! Motherfucker! Got you in, piece of shit. Good ah, bull crap, you cheating piece of shit. Cheated, you cheated. You're like, you're not getting me twice this time. 
because reasons. <laughs> Asshole. Come on, man, stop fucking around here. Come on, bitch, fuck. God. God have mercy, man. Come on, come on, come on, man, come on. Fuck off! It's not possible! It's like the fucking... What the fuck, man? Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. You f motherfucker. Fuck you. Get him, get him in that door. I think that's it. Is that it? Wait. No.
Okay, uh, I just see that Twitch, and I tested my internet, and hi there, CS1Z003. What now? Yeah, I think I might. Uh, so, my, it looks like uh, it split my VODs. Did y'all get to see the ending, or did it destroy everything? Because uh, it's... I don't know what happened here. Went to zero and everything got fucked. So I can see it now. It's been a while, but now it's back to the bullshit. And it's Twitch. It's not my internet. My internet here is, is doing very well. So the the VOD is split, are split now. How do I go to see my VODs when I'm live? I would like to know. Or when anyone is live. I don't know what's the mystery here. How do I go to see the person's fucking videos and shit when they're live? Okay, there's the about me. So I think my ending got butchered completely. How do I check my motherfucking VODs for, for crying out? Can somebody tell me how this website work? I'm on my own page on Twitch right now because usually I'm on OBS. Where's the option? They disappear. I don't know where it is. How do I see... I want to see how butchered it is, because if it's completely butchered, then I'll just beat the game again. I'll just beat the last boss again, because and then I'll cut for YouTube and put it patient in there, because it's fucking unacceptable. You fucking drop my stream right at the end and fuck off. I want to know how fucked it got here. Separate videos, then added videos, but I'm not seeing videos where. Okay, video producer. Is that it? So, but I have no ways of knowing until it's over. Let me see where where it stopped here. I'm I'm doing a playback. Forty-six. Four, oh my god, I don't have two minutes here. Can you go full screen and let me go a little bit further? It's so one thing YouTube has better than Twitch is that you can rewind videos live. You can actually do that. I'm checking right now how fucked it is, because... So it was on the credits, so I got the... Yeah, I see. It, it fucked up here. Okay. Fucked up the credits. Completely unacceptable. Uh, it's not my internet. There's no fucking way. I just checked it. I've been noticing that from Twitch, that it just decides to drop you with like a bag of shit. For no rhyme or reason. So I'm I'm just gonna leave it then because I think if you butchered a boss fight, 
I wouldn't have liked that. But it split, it split my VODs again, so we're back to that shit again. It's been a while since that happened. So it's going to be a weird-ass VOD at the end, which has... I'll, I'll change it to hardware showcase, I guess. I don't know. They don't even stay here forever anyways. <sighs> Very annoying. I'm not. I, I'm always blaming the internet, and I use you, but it, it's pretty stable. But I think it, sometimes it does a hiccup, which is the worst thing because you have high speed, but every now and then it does a hiccup and fix, fucks everything up. So how can I fucking... How can I do anything about it? Uh, this is a game that you should definitely retry because, uh, yeah, I was going to come in here, so I got a birdhouse. A motherfucking birdhouse with a little flag on it. So I think it's like Luigi's Mansion. The, the more money you get, the more things you get, the more seekers you get, the bigger your mansion is going to be, right? Uh, yeah, so I, I got to download both thoughts, put them together. I got to do Edit Engine tonight. Wonderful. I love it because usually I just export the video to YouTube and that's done. So now I got to fucking deal with butchered footage, footage that Twitch just butchered the fuck out. Twitch or my internet, uh, bits are missing. The audio goes out of sync. It's horrible. It's not easy. Okay. Uh, yeah, CS1s is a uh, garlic because of water. He likes garlic. Okay, do my hardware showcase and got to move on. This is it. I always took exception to games that do this, like you have to reset. You should be like, you press start, right? You... The music restarted. Okay, it's fine. Did it hiccup again? Is that another? Is that a third bot? We're going for the record today, because it says you're welcome to my stream. So let me go check Twitch again. It's starting to a shit show now. Huh? You see? How long is this? No, eight minutes. It's a fucking mess. Okay. As usual, whenever I feature the Juicy Loader, I'm just going to move on. Fuck it. I'll deal with editing later. Uh, so this is a GameCube with the Juicy Loader. Nowadays, they have Pico Boot. Boot. Pico Boot. Some of the names they come up with. Okay, Juicy Loader. I have Pico Boot, because I guess it boots from a Pico. Stream Elements is late. Okay, it's very late. Very fucking late. So basically, the GBI is something that allows you, that is uh, miles ahead of the Game Boy Player with the Game Boy Disc, the Game Boy Player Disc and Nintendo's own software. It, it's, you can't even compare both. This allows for a shit, a gazillion things that you can do here. You can change the aspect ratio, which is different depending if you're playing Game Boy Advance. This is with a Game Boy Advance in mind, I would say. But it works for just as fine for, for any Game Boy game. You can change this here. You can do all kinds of stuff, man. You know? Uh, and it's awesome. I have a couple of this with the uh, Game Boy EverDrive. You know? You can play uh, any Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color game here perfectly. You know? Um, which is not something you can do in Nintendo's blurry. It looks like shit. It's terrible. I recommend GBI every time. Okay. How do I... Uh, can get out of here? So, okay. So, basically, for the Game Boy, uh, Kyler and Game Boy, I go with 5x4, even though this is a 4x3 monitor. It doesn't matter. And 240, 60. I don't fuck with the other stuff. And then, with the... With the full GBI, you can change here. You can see, but there you go. Three. This is a, you know, integer scale here. And then this is here, the uh, EverDrive for the Game Boy. All right. Utilities. Got a test suite. So this is a colorized. I got to do a fat sorter to sort this shit out. 
And I think the Game Boy Color is the one I wanted to use uh, to show Castlevania Color here for the Game Boy, because it came out in Europe only. And this has nothing to do with PAL, so it's with the, with the game, game Boy. It's not tied up to CRTs, you know. I mean, we're playing Game Boy on a CRT here, but in reality, Game Boy is, a, it's a, is an LCD, right? It's, a, it's, it's not a CRT, obviously. So I'm, I feel quite comfortable uh, comfortably playing Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, uh, all the systems on a, on a flat panel. Uh, I love the OSSC because it has, uh, especially for the GPA, it has vertical and horizontal scan lines you can put, and it works very well to emulate uh, a massive GBA screen. Okay. So let me see here. I think there's a hack to separate that. Okay, so it was the first one, was it? So go to Game Boy Color Europe, and I think it's Konami Collection. I, I, I think I have hacks to separate them. Was it Konami Collection 1? Is that it? Yeah. It's a game I'll be playing at some point. There you go. Castlevania Adventure in color. Officially. Europe only. This game is weird. It has screen tearing. Noth nothing wrong with the equipment. It actually has sc screen tearing. And I thought it was a, a problem with the colorized version. No, it's with their normal version as well. Yeah, I've beaten this game. It can be pretty brutal. There's a lot of slowdowns. The music's still awesome, though. I'm not going to play the whole game, by the way, just showing them what it looks like. So, you know, if you have this combination, they have a thing with eyeballs here. That's why when you saw uh, Castlevania The Adventure Rebirth, it has a lot of eyeballs. It comes from this game here. So if you're watching this as a VOD, my VOD got split later on. This is a message for... Ah, bitch. Uh, just, if you want to watch Wario, fucking cunt. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm out of fucking practice. Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, if you want to watch Wario Land DX, just the previous VOD. I got a half a mind to just fucking delete this VOD and just make it YouTube. Because it, it's weird. Because it'd be like a hardware showcase VOD. There you go, they do give you the power ups here. This is what. Yeah, Castlevania Advent. Fuck you! Castlevania Adventure, the adventure looks like in color. The music is excellent, though. Ah, asshole. All right, that's enough of this. Anyways. What are other things can you do? Oh, and thank you for following following G Town eighty five. I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing that correct. G Town eighty five. Thanks for following the channel. I hope you enjoyed the cut. It's right at the end here. The vods are split. Is a fuckery. Uh, this is a profile I have for the OSSC whenever I'm using. So Gen Plus backup backup your memory card. Uh, fucking emulation here, patches, and of course you have your GameCube games here, which are best played played with a GameCube controller. No oh, shit. Where do you go, games? And there you go. I have some games here. Uh, I mean, in a 
I mean to put, I aim to put a big S, bigger SD card here, but they're expensive, you know. There's Twin Snakes. Y'all kept talking about has been here. Metroid Prime 2 is here because I played the first one, but if I'm playing on the channel, then i got to play the first one again. Midway Arcade Treasures, that has Mortal Kombat 2. That's why it's here, Mortal Kombat and Mortal Kombat. Uh, Nintendo Puzzle Collection, I put that, this for my daughter and my... Uh, this stays in my uh, daughter's uh, bedroom. She has her own GameCube. It's a black one, uh, but it has the now outdated mod that glitches a lot. It slows down on uh, cutscenes and intros and whatnot. There's Resident Evil 1 here. Smash Bros. I'm not into Smash Bros. I wish I was. It's a game I really try to get into, but I just can't. Luigi's Mansion, I'm going to be playing this at some point here. All right, enough for shit. I'll do my uh, TV thing, show around what I just used on this here stream, and uh, get out of here, you know. Okay, let me go turn on the light. And I know the monitor's on. I'll, I'll be brief this time. Can turn the light on a kind of bit for now. Put them on the same channel. It's probably for the best. There we go. There we go. So you can control both of them. That's it. Okay, so I go through things here rather quickly. So, Game Boy's here, I guess. No, no garlic smell on them. Nope, not at all. Awesome. I, I guess if the garlic was unpeeled, then yeah. We'll probably get the garlic out of here by now, right? The uh, warrior's land is over. Somebody comes in at the bottom and they see all this garlic. You go like, what the fuck is going on here? What's with the garlic? Uh, put it here. Oh, there we go. Fucking, there's always an asshole that falls, isn't it? That's my wife's garlic, so I gotta bring it back there. It's not, it's real garlic. All right, then, so. Fuck with that shit. It's random fucking noises here. So I'll go on full screen here, so every now and then it might take a while for me to see the chat. I wanna have one monitor. It's kind of ass. And don't worry, I'll focus. There you go. Yeah. So that's the EverDrive. Awesome. It's an awesome device. Took me a while. I, I forgot one time, but you do, like, if you need the menu, uh, there's no button combination. You squeeze it. The button is here. You squeeze a cart, and then that's how you bring up the menu. And this here, let me clean it up a tiny bit here, what the fuck? This here is one of the first mods that came up as far as replacement screens. It was the Band Van mod. Nope. Every now and then it wants to play up a tiny bit. You see Nintendo then, then you're good. Same thing, you know, this here is basically Game Boy Advance hardware. And uh, there goes. If you press start, I think it goes to the last one you played. There's a fucking volume, you crazy bitch. I think you see the Castlevania, same thing. Are you telling me I have no volume anymore? On this motherfucking console, you crazy. Oh, great. I don't have... How come every time I come here and I go test my Game Boys and there's something wrong with them? So I no longer have volume here. Is that what you're saying? Okay. Weird. Very weird. Same happened to me last time. So, so I got a thing. I bring, I bring those Game Boys here. 
and they completely lose volume. This happened, the same happened to this, even though I never, never had a problem with it before. Is that inverted or something? What the f... Piece of shit. What the fuck was that about? There's something wrong with you. Gotta open and see what's going on. Lost the fucking volume again, you can't. What the fuck is going on? Okay, pause it. A range of shit. Just see what it looks like. Get close. There you go. Atta boy. That's it. Yeah, nowadays they have better, uh, you know, replacement screens. They're bigger. Very cool stuff out there. So I do want to get a, another Game Boy collar and update. To be honest, I don't do a lot of portable gamer, but uh, gaming, fuck. But I like to I like to keep things up to date while they're available, just in case, you know. You might not be into now, but it, you could later. You know, sometimes it's good to have them uh, portables. And I'm looking at my monitor here, so gameplay is not fuck. It's not the focus. I just want to show what it looked like. Ah, sorry about that. It's horrible. If I was to play like this on the channel, which I'm not going to, I would uh, I would have this on a so some sort of tripod or something that would keep it from moving around. Ah, fuck. I think that's it. Probably seen enough. See if I can get. Well, it's a very good screen. It's tiny, you know, compared to what's available today. Oh, is a cocksucker. There we go. Yeah. That's my Game Boy Color. Yes, and it's a glow in the dark screen. Rechargeable batteries. I got I, I got no use for lithium fucking batteries. I'm happy with those here. You got a lithium battery after it runs out. After the battery is dead, you got to decide or do things with uh, rechargeable batteries. I can go somewhere with a bag of them as long as they're charged and play the Game Boy Color, Game Boy for, for a very long time. Whereas if I have a lithium, uh, it's one time, then I got to find a plug, right? So if you've never been on a very long road trip, that would be a problem. But if you have a lot of pre-charged batteries, then man, you're good to go for a long time. Yeah, that's it. That's the Game Boy Collar that I have. I want to get an another one. And I have those shells here. And I bought them. Now I think they're very popular with Game Boy. I bought them before they became popular. It was a feller on Reddit, and he mentioned about those here. Oh, they're for they're waterproof and everything. So they were uh, Persian airs awake. <laughs> and yeah, they're made for something. I don't know what they're made for. But uh, fits the Game Boy perfectly. This is the... What the fuck? What was that? Shit falling all over the place here. The DMG, I don't think I have batteries in. But I, I showed here last time. I oh, fucking... Dirty ass shit. What is this? This one has an original screen. It's just backlit. Gets his bread out. I'm hungry. I'm, I'm ready for garlic and something. I wonder what my wife cooked out there. Whatever it is, gonna be good. Game took a little longer than I thought. You know, the stream in general. I did talk a lot, I suppose. I have a pocket as well. I'll just show it real quick. The silver one is my favorite color. Just looks so fine, you know. And there's a two different ones. There's one that it has uh, this part here is black, and I think the one with a black part I think is the one I had as a kid. I had a Game Boy. I had the silver one. So my love for silver, yeah, it's very similar. A little bit lighter. Get in there.
I just love silver. Anything silver is all right with me, man. <laughs> yeah, we get in there. Fuck is this bullshit? I just fucking closes your toad. There we go. Okay, so GameCube. Uh, I'll leave the monitor on because I'm not going to be very, very long. I uh, can unplug the controller right now. And so let me see here. Let me get this out. Bear with me. And again, if you're watching this as a VOD and you want to watch this uh, playthrough, if you're watching as a VOD on Twitch, it, I hate when my VODs get split. It's really annoying. It's very weird timing too. Because right at the end of the stream, right? Uh, at least I, I can say the all the playthroughs on the other VOD. I don't know, maybe uh, unlist this one and just keep it on YouTube or something. I think most people on Twitch are just interested in the gameplay, I guess. I don't know what people are into. So the controller is actually a Super Nintendo controller. And I'm using it on the GameCube via an adapter. Which is very good. You can find them on eBay. People make those. I think it's an open source project. And it works quite well. So Super Nintendo goes in. GameCube out. You know. It works perfectly. The controller is a Hori Game Boy Commander or something. Let me go ahead with a full screen again. There we go. I'll always show if you've seen all this, then uh, your body I'm showing this, then get the fuck out of here. Okay? I don't know what to tell. I'll always show as long as I have the disposition, unless it's really fucked at the end of the playthrough here. There's a bit of a claim here, bud. So this is the, uh, if you see me shaking, it's fucking cold here. So you can swap between Super Famicom or Super Game Boy. It does change the scheme here. So because when I was starting... When I started today, some of the things were not working. It was set to Super Game Boy, so I swapped to Super Famicom because that's what the adapter uh, expects. So there's no shoulder button. So this this is all to do with Super Game Boy, but they're L, R, Y, and X. So if you're playing DMG or Collar, you just need this. Just set to Super Famicom. And if you're playing on the Super Game Boy, which I don't do often because of the lack of full screen, it, I'm not really into it. If I have a Game Boy player, that's the usually this is going to be the usual combination that I'll use to play Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, and Game Boy Color. Here, it's the Game Boy player because I prefer a lot more option. I got firmware and it can go full screen, so for me it's just better. Uh, so it's got like a Super Nintendo D-pad. It has like details that resemble a Game Boy DMG, obviously. Yeah, and it works with your Super Game Boy on a Super Nintendo. Okay, now the console. Just give it a quick tour here. See what's going on. So the console. Should really think of the background music here. Ah, who gives a shit? Fuck it, too late for that now. GC loader. That's what it looks like when you have a 3D printed mount. And it just it's a big SD card. They went with that. There you go, but it could get a small one with a big adapter. Don't, don't fucking matter. Everything is possible with the magic of adapters. Adapter. So this here is a spare one. If you have more SD cards, you can use this as a sort of storage. You know. Uh, if you don't have the 3D printed mount, it's still it's going to work. But you got to reach your hand down there. It's kind of ghetto. You know. And if you drop it, the tiny SD card or SD card in general, you drop anything there, you're going to have to reopen the GameCube unless you leave it open at all times. So this is the Platinum Edition. We're using SCAR today. This is a PAL. Only PAL uh, GameCube supports RGB uh, without a mod. Okay? You can make the NTSC support RGB, but why bother? You have YPBPR. It's the same thing. For me, this monitor wouldn't work. I don't think this monitor supports YPBPR. Okay? Or a component. Uh... This is the jack button. I, to be honest, it was a long time before I realized that. I should just put my cartridge cartridges in and out. And the back of it, you got your digital AV out, which is necessary if you're using component. Uh, now, the component cable never came out in Europe, as far as I know. But uh, as far as I research, it, it would work just fine on the PAL. Uh, not on PAL games, though. Because, well, you will, but you're not going to get 480p support. There's no 480p support for PAL games. 
which automatically makes the PAL not as superior. I mean, you have RGB, but you have some. But if it's modded, you can add NTSC games and play them at 480p if you want, 60 hertz, okay? Okay, analog, you have a multi-out use comp composite. I use it here sometimes. Same as uh, Super Nintendo, Super Famicom, and N64. It's the same style. There you go. So side your fan. Fantastic. And yes, a bit yellow here. It does yes, it bothers me. Uh, I have a cover here, a USB cover, uh, to protect the port. Uh, in here, that's how this is a Game Boy player, which is awesome. It's an attachment. I'm not gonna unattach every time. No fucking way. There's a bottom. I like how it makes the cube more of a cube. Doll 017. That's the Game Boy player. Uh, that's it. I'll show you the set now, if I may, and then that's uh, that should be it. Right, let me see here. Just a second. Yep. Yep. Shut the fuck up, goddamn computer. Motherfucking robots. Okay, the set. Uh, can I think I can? Can I turn this crap off for now? Fucking looking ugly here. Okay, I'll leave it on. Just be quick. I'll show the back first. This is the hardest to to put it in here. There we go. Let's see if I can. Pretty much the back where all the stuff is at. There we go. So this here is a 13701QM, which is the European same fucking monitor as the 1271Q in the States. It is the same thing. I have a 1270Q, which is also identical, but internally it is not. There's a difference between internally, a lot of difference between the 12, 1270 and the 1271 or the 1370. 13701. So you got here your RGB, your line composite, VTF, more like WTF because I have no fucking idea what it's used for. I'm sure I could Google it, but uh, I was having problems with the V hold on RGB, and there's another way to do RGB. This here, the computer plug. Um, and luckily, Retro Gaming Cables makes a cable for you. There we go. So it's sort of like a VGA, pretty much. So And just like v VGA, is still RGB. Uh, and that's it. You know? You can plug everything. What a fucking mess is this place, man. Fucking bags. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that's what the back looks like. Uh, you got your Terminators in here. This is going to the DVD player, so that's how I'm going to be playing my intro, my outro commercials and whatnot. And uh, yeah, and I'll show you the side, so that's what it looks like. And you got all kinds of adjustments here, you can see, you can do. I think there was another here, what is this? H centering, very useful. Yeah, it's uh, from the 1980s, so it's a very cool monitor. Uh, one of them showed up in the Ghostbusters shoe movie, uh, somebody mentioned. Uh, I was never able, able to spot. Now, this here is a crack. This monitor once fell, and I nearly had a heart attack. It was horrific. It fell at home. It didn't fall like boom, like, but enough that it hit something cracked, and I thought I was going to have a heart attack. Really sad day. Very sad. Luckily, it's a hairline crack, but it's n there's nothing lucky about your CRT falling, dude. Come off it. Luck, luck is you have your CRT be safe and never fall. Now, what the fuck? I never never had it happen. It's just this one time. And then it was funny. The day before, I had a premonition. I saw, hmm, this monitor looks a, a little bit too forward on that shelf. And boom, I should have fucking done something. And the front is here. And that's what it looks like. Have your panel here. Have some controls here. There you go. That's what it looks like up close. You have fast, low. I, mean, I can't go ahead and turn this crap on here already. Get ready to, to go. I'm very fucking hungry. There we go. I'll do that in a bit. And I'll probably adjust the shutter speed here to match. Just give me a second. Sync. Contact this sync or scan in 59.9. There we go. So you have CCAM, which is a French thing. You have line A, composite, composite, line B, VTRs, whatever VTR. I forgot. I looked it up once and forgot. It's not important for gaming. RGB, which is the the RCA ones for BNC ones in computer, which is also RGB, but is with that 
weird at, at 25 pn i can't remember vga cable which also you can do for scart afc fast is low looked it up forgot the scan mode this is a under scan if you need under scan and sync internal external okay uh doesn't matter when you're using computer but when you're using the the rgb with the bnc uh cables then it matters and you got to put external here because you have external sync v hold volume hue for ntsc <laughs> never the same color again yep well 60 hertz oh bitch color brightness picture there you go how long do gamecube this last 25 years hmm first time chat and thanks for following big rad new york city nyc happy to have you here how you come across that information though i think so what after 25 years they self-destruct like a like a spy sort of thing <laughs> starting to be kind of sanding but and there's this card and i unplugged the light again don't matter i bet that it will last more than that some it depends on some discs uh, i don't think that in 25 years all gamecube discs will fucking disintegrate or stop working though i think they'll be long after that a lot of people said a lot of things will last this much and that much and then they end up lasting more you know look at this motherfucking crt all the way from the eight is here still going strong while my uh, new flat flat screen is just already having image retention problems and all kinds of shit but yeah this they uh you know there's this rot there's the lamination some discs are some discs are doomed right away uh the hd dvd discs are fucked a lot of them they have the lamination problems bronze and oxidation nothing lasts forever that's for sure that's that's a fact my good sir you're correct on that assessment so yeah so that's a pvm 13701 qm outstanding one of my favorites i love the looks of it i love the color uh and the gamecube is also an excellent console strongly recommend it if you don't have one uh and uh yeah i think that's about it i'm very saddened to hear that uh twitch has fucked up my vods so it's gonna be a weird one i was enjoying not having split vods for a while but it looks like that ship has sailed now there we go. Fucking more ray through the roof here, goddammit. There we go. Despite all that, I hope y'all enjoy the stream. And I'll be back tomorrow with something else. I don't know what yet, but starting tomorrow, we're gonna get in a. Get rid of this fucking shit as more ray. I don't wanna zoom, my dear. I just wanna get rid of the more ray. Starting tomorrow, uh, you'll be Halloween stuff. I got no effect on the brightness here. Well, that's kind of fucking odd, don't you think so? Right? I, apparently, I have no control on the brightness here. Well, whatever then. All right. Uh, that's it for me. I reckon. Is there Shiro? If you're still here, if there's anybody to raid, I'll go take a look real quick on the Twitch. Uh, is whoever's on my list? I don't know anybody else. I don't have much time to watch Twitch. To be honest, I'm here streaming most of the time. And off that, I'm doing, you know, family stuff. I don't see anybody online right now that I know. So unless Shiro knows anybody, if you're still here, then uh, feel free to raid. Uh, and if not, I'm going to sign out now. And if you're going to raid Shiro, if you're still here, uh, just wait for the outro to be done. When I wave goodbye, then you go on. Satsun is here. There's a PS1 that has a Halloween theme. I don't think, I try to think of it. It reminds you of Nightmare after before Christmas. Is that medieval or something to that effect that you're talking about? Medieval or because I saw a game and in medieval, I think it was kind of reminded me of Nightmare before Christmas, which I really, really, really love as well. Is that a request in Satsun medieval? So I don't think you have mentioned any requests yet. Nope, it's empty. So you want medieval. If so, can you do me a favor and just type medieval there so I can remember it? Because I don't have the keyboard here. I will just copy and paste into the... I guess do that. 
Now, if you just guess, if you don't feel strongly about it, just think about it. Think about it, medieval, thank you. I'll put it here if you want to change. I'll put it here for now if you want to change, let me know. And I think this has a sort of a Halloween look to it. I know it's a big game. People like it. I haven't played it yet myself. It says do it. It looks interesting. All right. So we got the request today. We have Satsum with Medieval, Brew Tendo with Friday the uh, 13th game on the NES, and Persian Air with the Green Fandango, which was way ahead of him. I already ordered the game. I knew he would say that because Persian Air is a very predictable fuck. Uh, really just human garbage all the way, that guy. But I'll do his request. <laughs> he knows I'm just breaking his balls. We talk like that here. Don't be a pansy. Okay, and uh, I still need to hear from Commodore Crash. Yeds is a friend of mine. He's not going to bother. He's very busy all the time. Uh, Tunem Aftermath, I haven't seen him in a gazillion years. But, it, you know, Fort Max was going to think about a schmuck. Bedham Wells, probably busy drinking uh, mouthwash. Not showed up today. Probably drunk a lot too much, too much mouthwash. But when he shows up next time, I'll ask him. And Alex Star Wiz Retro. There's a DVD logo. Brute. Yep. Feeder House. Haven't seen him in a while. Declimatic Sh Shiro is going to... Shiro, I don't think Shiro... It says, I'll break your balls, cunt. Well, if I'm a cunt, then I won't have balls. I'll just have a cunt. <laughs> Persian air. You can break You can break the balls of who? The one who is ballless. And Mr. Liffer, Crash Bandicoot 1. So that's that's it. Uh, okay, you pieces of fucking shit. I'm out of here. Enjoy the anthem. Be anti-American. Leave if you're sensitive. I don't really give a shit. Very good uh, good stream. I'm curious to see how the VODs are going to do because people are going to come. They, they tend to gravitate towards the second VOD, but there's no gameplay. It's just me talking nonsense here and showing hardware. And they're going to be, where's fucking Wario? Whatever, you know? What happened? <laughs> so, you know, I can't do nothing about that. So that's it. Have a good night. Thank you, everyone, for today. And I hope to see you tomorrow. God willing. And until then, take care. God bless. And have a pleasant rest of your day. I'll see you next time. Good night. And Shiro, if you're going to raid, do your thing later on. See, see ya. Have a good one.